Yeah, man, big up, you know. Blessings to each and everyone. Yeah, respect, respect for the check in, you know. Big up, big up. Yeah, man, sound check, sound check, 369. Sound check, sound check, 369. All right, so let me go through the formalities. Quick and fast. TG Media. Yeah, man, big up, you know. Manners and respect every time, in general. You know the thing, you know. Ray and Williams, yeah man, big up me general, enough respect. Lone Star, yeah, big up in you know, enough respect me general. Godfrey Goldburn, yeah, big up in you know. Gems 101, yeah man, enough respect, big up. Deja D, yeah, Deja D, big up yourself in you know, enough respect, enough respect every time. Mood Man, yeah, big up yourself, me general, respect in you know, her, respect, respect. Greatly appreciate the support every time. Yeah, man. Big up success over hype, you know. Enough respect. What me think? Yeah, big up, big up. Enough respect, you know. Ma at root. Yeah, man. Big up, big up, big up. Greatly appreciate the support. Make sense entertainment. Yeah, man. Big up yourself, you know. Enough respect for the check-in. Watch, look, listen. Yeah, big up yourself, you know, man. Yeah, yeah, man. Watch, look, listen, man. You know it, go, man. I respect same way, man. As me say, me general, we don't have to agree, but we can respectfully disagree. I think that's the key thing. Sometimes, you know, yeah, man. We don't have to agree, and that's what healthy conversations are based on. You know, opposing views, opposing ideas, and we reason it out, and we can respectfully disagree. We can learn to acquiesce, and we know, say. That is just that. You get what me I say? So big up, watch, look, and listen, man. Manners and respect, man. My members say, yeah, day one, no, watch, look, and listen. So, yeah, man, a simple like a disagreement. We're not going to make that change, not no, man. And big up to the ones and ones who might not agree with me all the time, but at the same time, we know, so I respect, same way, mutual respect. So, big up to the ones and ones, them, same way. Ever blessed. Big up yourself, my general. Yeah, man, manners and respect. Rayan Williams, you know the code in you know, my general. Ray Blay, yeah man, big up, you know, enough respect for the check-in. Janima Music, yeah man, big up my general, respect for the check-in. Lynette Thompson, yeah, big up, big up, you know, Lynette Thompson, respect for the check-in. B.I. Strong, yeah man, big up, you know, manners and respect every time. No, what's look and listen, you know, say... You know, it's so a 7.20, you know, it's normally like my timing still in our way still. They get with me, I say, me general. So, I just them timing, yeah, man, you know. um, Yeah, I've not been active for a couple of days. Saturday, reasoning did for go on, but time and space never did permit. So, we just met that flow. You know, Sunday, we did feel have some esoteric Sunday settings, but time and space never permit. So, we just make it flow the same way. So, Big up to the ones and ones. I'm checking for the Monday night. I feel like a reasoning still, you know. Yeah, man, Lynette Thompson. That is good. Master Kirk. Yeah, big up yourself, you know. Manners and respect me, general. Black Light. Yeah, man, the Hierophant. The Erudite. <laughs> yeah, man, big up in the Black Light. The Vice of Reason. DJ62. Yeah, big up in the general. Yeah, man, big up DJ62. DJ 62, um, where you say you day? You're there, Lone Star State, no, Texas. Yeah, man, big up DJ 62, you know. Manners and respect, man. You stays faster. Yeah, big up in a you stays. You don't know the thing going on, my general. Fully Gaza, you stays. Big up yourself, man. And big up the ones and ones, them, whoever want to support you, man. And just know some reasoning more time and argument presents itself and different perspectives and we know, so we present with argument and whatever is logical or whatever makes sense, makes sense. <laughs> it's as simple as that. You know, no intricacies involved. So big up, um, you stays. Bakari, 56TV. Respect every time, you know. Greatly appreciate the support, you know. Private figure. Yeah, man, respect teacher. Was looking for a reason yesterday. Yeah, man, um, private figure, man. You know what the thing of in general. Time and space permitting. I just saw it go. So respect for the check-in still. Yardos Pro. One emotep. Yeah, man. Respect. Respect Yardos Pro. Enough respect every time. 
Mandela strength. Bless up. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. You know it going on, Mandela. Seven hour. All right, Mandela strength. You know it go more time. You know, more time. We'll drop on five, six, seven hour reasoning more time for the ones and ones them still. So big up Mandela strength on the journey. Just be safe on the gravel same way. Big up to Jamon. Big up to Ruan Noble. Big up all of the truckers them out there. You know. Big up on yourself, man. You know, say, yeah, man, we're going to a little five or six hour solid reasoning. I don't know if you can just know, so you want to listen to a solid reasoning on the journey. So big up for that. Shenet Edwards. Yeah, man. Big up in a Shenet. Yeah, man. Respect every time for the support. 100% Shenet. Um, Alex Smith. Alex Smith. Yeah, man. Them say patience um, is a virtue. You get what I say? Yeah, man. So as time progresses, you you know you will definitely understand um what it means so i will definitely be speaking on the topics but you know how it go we big up the ones and ones and we'll check in so big up in alex smith respect for the check-in yardos pro where you say from london yeah man big up the london massive them man you know the thing going on big up to only good karma every time big up to chanel yeah hey, chanel you're large you know respect every time for the support um chanel Kai Ipe, big up yourself, you know. Miss J Detta, aka Jalove Detta, big up yourself anywhere you're there. Yeah, man, manners and respect every time. You don't know the thing, go. Yeah, man, Miss J Detta, one of the realest in the streets, people. So, anyone who see Miss J Detta, not a big her up, you know, in a real life. Ah, uh, DJ 62, uh, so I go, my general. Cunningham Spice, big up, you know. I think Cunningham Spice is from England as well, you know. Big up Cunningham Spice. Yeah, man, Lone Star, greatly appreciate um, you reminding the ones and ones them for us. Drop a like on the stream, you know. Greatly appreciate that. Please remember, as you enter, you can just hit the like button, you know, as a way of um, wiping your feet, so to speak, and also showing your appreciation for the channel. It's a small platform. But yeah, it does make a big difference in the streets in terms of reasoning and content and things like that. So big up to the ones and ones who drop a like on the stream. Big up to the ones and ones I'm on the play forward as well who leave a like on the stream. And if you're new to the channel, yeah, man, and you rate the content, you have not yet subscribed, you can feel free to do so. Raw money. Yeah, man, big, big respect in a raw money TV. And thank you for... The kind words of encouragement. Yeah, man. Respect. Respect for that. Skara. Hey, big up in a Skara. You know the thing going on. You know? Yeah, man. Respect. Dance all war. Big up, my general. Manners and respect. Ricky Tan. Yeah, big up yourself, my general. Respect. Kid. Yeah, man. Big up yourself, you know. Manners and respect every time. You know the thing going on. You know? Christopher Lawrence. Big up yourself, you know, my general. Yeah, man, me have to big you up, you know. Anywhere you're there, trust me, my general, because we see you in the streets, you know, and you keep it real. Yeah, man, big up yourself, Christopher. Nikki Willie. Yeah, man, big up yourself, you know, Nikki Willie. Yeah, man, you don't know a thing going on, Nikki Willie. How we say family, you know, so greatly appreciate the support every time. Big up yourself, Nikki Willie. Yeah, man, DJ 62, man, you know we deal with it, my general, man. You know, some solid intellectual, intelligent reasoning. You know the thing, my general. So, I saw we do it, man. Nothing not change. Taya Campbell, big up yourself, you know. Jeremy and A. Simon. Yeah, man, big up. Big up, my general. Respect. Johnny Black. Yeah, big up, you know. Manners and respect, you know. Gary Buckle, London Brickstone. Ah, see there. Big up, big up, big up, Gary. All right, let me see who is there. 56, big up my general. You know it going on, man has a respect. Nadia369, yeah man, from England as well, you know. Big up my sister. You know the thing going on. Um, DJ Congo, yeah, DJ Congo. Big up my general, man has a respect. All right. Um, big up to Everbless. You know the thing going on, Everbless. Are we is a family? Desmarks, aka Rutical. Yeah, man. Bless up Imhotep and family. Great channel. Yeah, man. Greatly appreciate that, you know. And people, yeah, please remember, man, you can also share the platform to, you know, your friends or, you know, ones and ones who you think might be interested in these kind of conversations because we do encourage 
um, the dialogue, you know, the opposing views. Yeah, man, that's what we encourage at the end of the day because it's a platform where it's an open platform and, you know, ones and ones can check in and share their views and opposing views and healthy conversation. You get what I say? That's right there. Private figure, yeah, man, big up, manners and respect for becoming, you know, a member of the channel. So, me definitely have a big up private figure. Enough respect, me general. And, um, we just want to big up the members, them too, you know, quick and fast. Yeah, man, big up Jamon, big up Vioni All, Humble Man RB, Lone Star, Jatori Music, Born Vex, yeah, man, Art as Magic, Jamaica Something, Apostle James, Jamel Pickers Gill, Canon God, big up yourself anyway, you're there. Michelle Clark, B.I. Strong, Sweet P, Tex876, Global Life Records, Rick Storm, The Free Thinker, Nikki Willie, DJ Congo, Miss Julia, aka Not Your Child Car, Moodman, Ryan Williams, Only Good Karma. So big up to all of the ones and ones, you know. Yeah, man, who are members of the platform. And yeah, man, you can feel free to become a member if you can. You can support the platform in whatever way, shape, or form. Whether it's a like, it's a share, it's a subscribe. You can super chat, super thanks, you know, cash up, PayPal. Whichever way you want to support the platform, yeah, man, it's greatly appreciated. So, yeah, yeah, man, big up on yourself and manners and respect. Dwayne Makala, big up yourself, you know, um, Dwayne. Probably you can check in and make we know what your perspective is, you know, Dwayne. You get what I say, me general? Yeah, because at the end of the day, um, it's good to have different perspectives and things like that. So, that's the whole objective of the platform, you know, to actually have different perspective you know and then no uh, we can definitely establish um what what arguments you know what arguments actually you know are logical and definitely make sense so it's as simple as that you know and we just respect each other and that is how it goes so ones and ones remember the link is pinned at the top of the chat as always so you can hit that link and you can check in and give your perspective. So we have some topics up for discussion. Vibes Cartel. Yeah. Is Vibes Cartel going to win this hearing? Because we definitely want to discuss um, some key components of the hearing. You know, um, the matter is pretty much at the appeals court. And the appeals court is asking for the submissions from both parties. You know, I think um, the defense has until what? May 6? Something like that um to to present their submissions and i think the prosecution or the dpp have until may 29 there and about to submit so we definitely um anticipating a lot of interesting arguments for throughout the five-day period you know how that goes so we definitely i watched the one there 85 million red flag that's a question asked this is a banker this is a banker that was found with um white lady in in our car valued at 85 million dollars was arrested and charged and walked free um you know the lawyer presented a no case submission um that's peter champagne presented a no case submission which means that she has no case to answer and she walks free so we definitely want to speak on that because it just goes to show that um the justice system yeah man it really 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 question every more time still because you grab somebody with 85 million worth of the thing the white lady right in at them car in them possession and them walk free because of a no case submission so we definitely want to speak on that one um cartel and movado you know yeah the dance hall does dance hall really need them back in you know yeah, in a dance hall because dance hall I got to a phase I you know where people are pronounced dance hall null and void and dead. You know, dance hall, music or jack, but it's like, you know, we don't really I get that the feel there. It's not as impactful. You know, so we ask the question if dance hall really miss Movada and Vibes Cartel because me certain say if them man they did fully active upon the ground like that. Dance hall would be way, way different. So that's my perspective still. You know, everybody kind of in a them lane. I deal with them thing. Everybody I work at them own pace. Everybody I do what's best for them. 
So at the end of the day, we definitely gonna ask those questions, you know. Um, we also have a topic, you know, Kaka. You know, for those who are football fans, you don't know the great Kaka, the Brazilian, right? Yeah, he played for AC Milan, right? Then he, he went to Real Madrid. You get what I say? Yeah, man. I think he went to, um, I think afterwards he left Real Madrid, he went to Inter Miami or something like that. But long story short, you know, yeah, his wife, his wife said, boy, I'm too perfect. So she divorced him because I'm too perfect. So we definitely, time and space permit. Yeah, man, we can definitely have a conversation on that. And we see we're open AI. Uh, along with Microsoft, they are building a $100 billion supercomputer called Stargate. So we definitely want to speak on that one, you know? Yeah, man, I'm big up the skeptic, you know? We don't always agree with, with, with everything, but you know it go more time skeptic. We can always reason. So big up skeptic. Anyway, you're there. Big up all the ones and ones. Them. So, you know, so the open AI thing, yeah, might be a good topic for all skeptic or whatever, but the ones and ones who are familiar with it can also chime in. You know, it's a $100 billion supercomputer that Microsoft and OpenAI is, 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 is planning on building. You get what me I say, people? So we're keeping our eyes on that. I worry about things that go on in the world where we can throw in our topics still. But trust me, we, we're overwhelmed with topics right now. You know, I'll trump the pan trial and now and we see what I go on over the Middle East part there with Iran and Israel and them something there and all the political things, we see the Church of England apologize for slavery, you know. Well, well church over England there. Yeah, them apologize for slavery. But here we are. We just pick some topics and read the pandemic here, man. That's right there. All right. So, um, Ray and say, Imhotep TV, a bad man, cockers. Oh, XY needed, um... TV, a bad man, Kaka ex-wife needed. Oh, okay, word, word, word. Well, it's the same too perfect still. And, you know, Kaka them are somebody where every woman would say, boy, a dream for someone like that. You know, so I don't know what really go on still. You get what I say? Um, mute up your second, the black light. Well, one second, I'm a general. Um, all right, so big up to Jazzy. Jazzy Ellie, you know, yeah, man, respect and big up to all of the ones and ones. Them so black light, yeah, my general, bless you, yeah, man. Big up, man, as and respect for the check in, you know. Um, you know, yeah, we want to start off with the vibes cartel here in there. You know, what is your take on it? Um, do you think that DPP has a stronger uh, argument to present? You think vibes cartel have a stronger argument with the new phone evidence? Um, as a matter of fact, too. As a matter of fact, um, let me hear your perspective quick and fast. Let me just drop this on the screen there. Go to black light. Let me hear what I say. Um, well, you know my position already. Um, I'm going to draw it back to there's a case, um, Privy Council case with a brother named Sangstan Dixon. So that is R against Sangstan Dixon, where it's long and short, it is a, it's a robbery that takes place in a Spanish town at a Western Union where two police were shot and injured. One was killed. Um, where Privy Council sent it back to the Court of Appeal for us to determine if um, if the, the men should be exonerated or if there should be a retrial. Now, the matter was quashed because of a videotape. A videotape that the police had access to that did not show the two accused, the two defendants, it didn't prove their involvement as well as the eyewitness report that also substantiated the um the absence of the of the gentleman on the the videotape now the issue is that um that matter was not there was no retrial ordered by the court of appeal so the men were exonerated the main issue with that case was that the videotape was not made accessible to the defense team as well so there is video footage of the incident Police to the incident, the two men them not on the in, not on the video footage, you know. Other assailants are acute, are, are the alleged um, criminals were seen on the videotape, but these two men were not a part of that. Four gentlemen who were accused of the the, 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 the robbery and the murder. So, long and short of it, when I draw the comparison to this matter, um, 
we have a tape. We have witness reports that support the tape. Um, the accused men are on the tape. <laughs> There's no question about that in terms of them voice, people tattoos, people face, all of that. Um, and um, I believe that the, the DPP have a stronger position going into that matter than the, the matter that I draw the comparison to with the Sangster and Dixon. So I would be confused if I don't see the Court of Appeal accept the DPP submission for a retrial with the same evidence. Right. And um, if you look at the screen, you know, I kind of bring this up because I'm watching this one very closely, you know, because I remember, you know, this matter that occurred in the West Kingston incursion in 2010. Right. And, and 14 years, 14 years after, you know, it's still being dragged out because remember it was supposed to start um, today, you know, right? Mm -hmm. And what's going on now? Keith Clark trial adjourn until April 29 amid Jura shortage. And and remember, say the, the Keith Clark case is not even as loud, so to speak, as the Vibes Cartel case. Yes, ones and ones who follow up the news and ones and ones who was observing what transpired during the West Kingston incursion where the JDF soldier then go up at the yard and you know, um, some of them get uptown, charged, please. right? Some of them get then, then they get charged, but I think it was Peter Bunting that gave them um immunity, right? Yeah, I believe so. Yeah, the Peter Bunting was the one who gave them immunity letter. The incursion occurred under the JLP, but Peter Bunting, as Minister of National Security, he was the one who gave them immunity letter. So, long story short. This trial should have commenced today, but now they are saying it's jury shortage. And the reason why I'm highlighting this, because it's the, the same thing is going to be applicable in the Vibes Cartel case. And I want to also tie this in to a conversation, Blacklight, mm -hmm. that we need to really be discussing so that the government or people who are in positions of authority to really look into it because... The jury pool, in my view, is too small. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. You get what I'm saying? So, so the fact that you're talking about jury shortage, 14 years, 14 years, you know, since this, since the incident occurred, you know, and you are telling me, say, 14 years, we can't find the the quorum of jurors to proceed. So. Can we find jurors for the Vibes Cartel case? I am 100% sure that his legal team is going to argue that what? There is no one fit to um, stand as juror in the Vibes Cartel case. You get what I say, Blacklight? Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. So right now, if we can't find enough jurors for the Keith Clark case, like how can we find jurors for the Vibes Cartel case? Um... Big up to Fly Eye, you know. Big up my general manners and respect. Respect to each and every one where they are people. Just remember to drop a like on the stream, please, and thank you. 161 people there. Drop a like on the stream. If you're new to the platform, you want to join the panel, you want to engage in the conversation, please feel free to hit the link at the top and check in as well. George Smith, the erudite. What are you doing, my brother? Black yeah, man, light. Man, I respect me, general. You know what the thing going, you know? Where, where you are going with? You want it on black light. Well, my... I, I look at this in terms of the, the retrial, you know? And the date where it's set. And my concern really is that seeing that the Privy Council ruled that the, 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 the evidence pertaining to the phone that the, the expert had put forward, that that evidence should be considered and looked upon. I am saying that that was, remember, the DPP said that that was the main thing that they used to get the conviction for vice cartel, the circumstantive evidence. And if the expert testimony is taken by the appeal court in terms of it is if it is found credible and saying that this phone was tampered with and substantial tampering would make this the evidence from the phone unacceptable 
I don't see that the appeal court is going, in other words, and I don't see the DPP having enough material to go forward with an, a next um, trial. If the phone evidence based on the expert testimony is thrown out. All right, so that's well said, um, George Smith. However, however, the same way how the new phone evidence, right, the forensic analysis of the phone that the defense um, team did, you know, and they wanted to also submit it to the Privy Council, and the Privy Council um, rejected it, so to speak. Um, I'm, I'm definitely sure that they will argue that, you know, if in the event, because they have to argue for both scenarios, right? Once they have to argue for an acquittal, right? Like, an, you know, no case submission, so to speak. Yes. Yes, we kind of get the matter thrown out. Or right. they, they have to also argue that if it does, if, if the court does decide to go to trial, that the, the forensic um, analysis of the phone be admissible evidence, that is one. Right. You get what I'm saying? Um, yes, true. But yes, man, true. What true. I'm also looking at as well is, is there any new evidence that the DPP would like to present to the court to have them add as well? I'm looking out for that because I know the DPP, right after the, the verdict of the Privy Council, she was on Nationwide, I think, and she was saying some things and she was saying that there are certain things that she cannot divulge as yet and time will tell or time will reveal and things like that. So I'm definitely looking forward to see if the prosecution will present um, new evidence, so to speak, in terms of them arguing for a retrial, right? Yeah, so yes, we definitely yes. want to look at that. Um, James Bond. Yeah, big up my general. Unmute the mic and go through there. Because you know it go more time when the panel get hot. You know what the thing going on. So go through my general. Respect to the ones and the ones who take it right early too, you know? Go on, go on. Bless yeah, up, bless up. There, know. Bless you. What, black light? Yeah, brother. So my question for you is, remember in the first trial, you know, the, mm -hmm. the question of phone tampering did came up. And the forensic analyst, technological analyst, showed the evidence that the, the DPP wanted to use in the case. All of those were time stamp on So the evidence that they actually used in the case showed that the phone was not in the police hand at the time because they were time stamped. So I don't see the defense getting that out of the trial, out of the case, because that is time stamp. I agree with you, Twitter. I agree that, um, you see, for me, even if what they have there in terms of the that the fact that the master copy was stolen from the evidence area so that they only have that copy copy of the timestamp and the location information the, the the text logs and all of that the all of the call information call logs text logs all of the location information from digital is on a copy disk now and the master copy was misplaced or stolen or what have you but it's no longer available it wasn't available from the trial because it was, you know, it was missing from that time, from, from the Supreme Court trial. So that may be an issue in terms of what is um, the original, the original um, documentation from Digital, which the, the, the defense team is going to raise the credibility of the copy. Now, my issue is that um, the, 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 the court of the court, I mean, the Supreme Court, if it goes back, would, would, easily be able to subpoena digital to bring forward those records exactly uh, exactly what i was about to say like that when it comes down to technology you know we know nothing get lost so it's easy to, it is very easy to get that back yeah um it's the mere tampering of the phone after it's in custody is not enough to say the information retrieved on the phone prior to that tampering is not credible or is to be brought into question i mean we have a phone. All of us have a phone. Um, there's no way for you to go into your phone right now and to tamper with call logs um, at the service provider's data clouds. 
You can do it from your phone and remove the information on your phone. That's why the DDP made it known that all of that evidence was time stamped. So if the phone coming to if the phone coming into custody on January 10th, we can take everything as far as we can say, right, we're gonna keep everything from January 10th. And this is what the, the telecommunication <coughs> sorry company has provided us, us from the birth of the phone up until January 10th. So I mean like it's a very I think it's a very easy case to get those evidence back in submission. submission yeah. evidence. I believe the evidence question is not a is not a is not a suppress because as we said before, the defense teams are arguments on the evidence in the both the Supreme Court level and the Court of Appeal failed miserably. Even the fact that the Privy Council just merely mentioned that there is a question to be answered. That's, it's not really a recognition of any substantial issues in the evidence itself. Um, because if they had seen any sort of substantial issue in the evidence that convicted them, they wouldn't have, they wouldn't have held the qualms to exonerate the men. If there was something questionable that we used to convict them, not the procedure, no, you know. If the evidence in itself is questionable that was used to convict them, these men would be free. <laughs> no doubt about it. The fact that the Privy Council sent it back to us to, to determine that question is, is the fact that they are not seeing any sort of substantial um, arguments to release and exonerate these men and say that these men are not guilty based on the process. Yeah, and what, people, what, what, what a lot of people is overlooking. The, remember, no, the court did nothing wrong no, because what proceeding with the case is actually legal. People don't understand that. Proceeding with the case is actually legal enough. It's just a privy council said, well, it was a judgment call. It was a judgment call when I had to send home the jury. And the privy council said, well, in our opinion, maybe this guy wouldn't get a fair trial. and should have sent home the jury. But it wasn't it, anything it, illegal the court did. You see, for me, there's no way that you can answer that question 14 years after. It's most the judge on the ground can determine whether or not the jury. In front, if it's a judgment call for the jury to move forward with, the, with a tainted juror, then... It's only the man on the ground can make that judgment to determine if the jury tainted or not. How some people 14 years from, <laughs> from that decision? Yeah, exactly, that's what I'm saying. They did nothing They did nothing illegal. It was just a judgment call, and that's why the, 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 the appeals court in Jamaica upheld the conviction. The no, I disagree. I disagree with you when you say it was a judgment call. The Privy Council was very clear. Judge, it was a judge. It was a judge. Let me finish. No, let me finish. No, make let me finish. Hold on. Let, let me finish. finish. Read the let me finish. No, all right. Let hold on, James. Make judge make him point, man. Can you know it go? We there still. So not no wrong. Go to judge and make a point, and then James Band can respond. The privy council was very clear. The privy council said, once the jury, once they had discovered that the jury was tampered with, there was no doubt that the jury. They should have dismissed that jury. It, it wasn't a judgment call. It wasn't whether they should or should not. They were clear in saying that once the pool of the jury was tampered with, then there was no choice but to dismiss that set right. of jury and start right. over again. So there was no gray area there. Right. I mean, so, that, that so, jury so, thing, um, hold on a change, man. I'm going to allow you to respond. Um, that, that jury thing was definitely something we we ourselves in 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 on this platform you know through the dialogue we definitely pointed that out quick and fast based on our observation of of, of the the hearing as well so that is something that even though the jamaican laws james Bond is saying um it, it it did allow that juror to remain you know as long as he wasn't discharged legally and technically he was not quote unquote um you know tainted you understand me, I say? So we see the Privy Council rule against that. Um, Big up to Damien, you know. Yeah, man. Big up to Rad 11 best or Rad 2 best. Yeah, man. Big up on yourself. Big up all the ones and ones. And just drop a like on the stream. Thank you all. And those who are new to the channel, you can just hit the link at the top if you want to check in and give your perspective as well. Um, Go to James Bannon, you know, you can definitely um, respond to what, 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 what I am saying is the, the, the Constitution and the law of Jamaica allows the judge to make a judgment call whether or not to dismiss the jury and start over or go forward with the case. That's all I'm simply saying. The law of Jamaica allows them to do to make that judgment call. That's why the judge does it, did it? The case that the Privy, the Privy Council cited is a case in which their courts move forward with a tainted juror. Um, which possibly the whole jury might have been tainted. So 
the idea that they have, they remember they had made qualifying conditions to say that the, the judge could have given further directions. The judge could have separated that juror. There was qualifying conditions to say that this is a discretionary call based on their judgment. It, of, exactly, and the laws and the law of Jamaica allows for you to do that. that there is no clear black and white law nor precedence as to what must occur in that situation. No, the Jamaican court, the mm -hmm. Jamaican court, and the Privy Council, in terms of jury sex selection, the process of jury, there is no different laws for the Jamaican court when it comes to selection, operation, procedure, wait, jury. Wait, wait, George, different wait. than the Jamaican jury. Wait, George. Before you understand me? The courts. George, no, man. Let's make George finish, man. Me, put, I respond put, the, the, the courts, the courts are wait, set up. Let me, let me finish, George. What you're saying here is that in a situation where there is a bribe, the UK courts have no position to send away the jury and continue the matter in judge chambers. UK, the UK don't have that in the criminal justice system established where a judge can hear a matter and dismiss the jurors. That's what you're saying? Because we surely no, don't have... that's not what I'm saying. If you listen, we don't you'll have hear that what I'm saying. That. If that you listen, you hear what I'm saying. Mm -hmm. What I am saying is this. The procedure of selection and the jury tampering and the process all those procedural process across all the courts in the Caribbean and in UK that use the system, they have the same systems in terms of what the procedures are. They are clear. It's not you are find out, say, if the jury tamper, whether we must do this or not. Those procedures are highlighted throughout just... and our precedents wait, and our wait, precedents. Wait, wait, let wait. me finish. Let me finish. And our precedents in the courts. So it's not me need to do this or me need to do that. They are clear. They are just no going to out a different areas area there. In the structure of the law with dealing with this situation. The privy council. The difference with the privy the councils court. and the Jamaican court is that look, some court might use 12. Some court might use seven, some courts might use none. But in terms of what when a jury is tampered wait, with, wait, in terms wait. of when a jury is contaminated, wait. there is no gray area in how you wait. operate from there on. All wait, right, wait, hold it up, Blacklight, for a that second. A broad a broad hold on, Blacklight. The, black the, light, the, hold on the UK it. courts have at their disposal. Hold on, black light here more me? than one jurors, two, three. They might dismissing all of them, black judge light, chambers. Yeah. The UK courts have a different procedural setup because you have procedural laws that we don't have to follow here because we have different Supreme Court procedural laws and civil procedures. Now, what I'm saying to you is that where there is no black and white and clear statute that speak on a particular situation, that is when precedents take effect. You can't just look at their court or their legal system and say, because they have procedural laws that set up like this, all of us have the mirrored thing. That's not how it works. Because don't we have Supreme Court rules that pass into law that is black and white that govern all of this that we're speaking about? Don't? Yes, 100%. Um, Blacklight, are you hearing me? Yeah, yeah, hearing okay, you. Okay, cool. All right, we have two, two, two people in. That's a trifecta. Um, big up to Colin Burton. Yeah, man. Big up to Lali Bella. Yeah, big up to all the ones and ones that we check in, you know. Um, respect to the ones and ones that we check in. All right, so pretty much, George, do you want to respond um, to what Blacklight said? Yes. All right, go what ahead. I will, yeah, what I will say is this. If a jury pool in Trinidad is contaminated, if a jury pool in the UK is tam contaminated, if a jury pool in Jamaica is contaminated, once the contamination is identified then the procedure is to dismiss the jury if there's the, no gray the, areas the idea of contamination is not a black and white no, like, no i'm george george but hold on the black light we're talking about you know, and, but, um based on the, what hold on there based on what even james bond and and black light are saying and and i i am gonna agree with them because i have held that position even prior to the privy council's um adjudication on the matter right the law, the Jamaican law, right, allows the judge to, one, get rid of the quote-unquote tainted juror, right? That juror is only tainted upon what? Discharge. Once they are discharged, 
that's when they are legally tainted. All right. Right? No, the it. judge you decided. Well, on there, um, judge, the, the law also do what? Allows the judge to keep that quote-unquote juror, right? To maintain the quorum. And as long as he's not discharged, he's not considered tainted. And that's what the judge did as well. So the law in this scenario of the jury issue, the law didn't make one thing absolute. The law gave options. And Thank you. That is where it was problematic, Judge. Thank you. you. Say? Because the I law did, did afford did you, the judge that option to keep you. that juror. And did you hear what the Lord Lords from England? Yes, but remember, the judge, I agree. Let me but just let me finish. Just let me finish now. All right, yeah, got you. Did you hear what the law Lord says that the judge should have done? He said that the judge did not um, give enough, in other words, and um deal Direct. with the issue in other words and assemble the, the jury sp um spoke to them give them enough direction mm -hmm. and find out how far this contamination went that's in their discretion that is within no, the listen now listen now listen now that mm -hmm. is not in the discussion he's saying that what they should have <laughs> done this is what you should have do, done you should have assembled the jury find the level of the contamination and see where it is. And if you have not done that, then you have failed. That is what they did. So that in other words, in, in the his, that is in his discretion. Let me just say this, George. No, let me just finish. You don't let people finish now. Let me finish. All right, so Jazz, Jazz, words, but Jazz, 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 you stop. Black light thought you were finished. You no, should pause. Just me. continue. So, so the reason is some time. If you then pass the judge, we now then gonna know if you're finished. So, right. got you. so in other words, then when the judge says that the the privy count um the error, he told them what they why they error and what they should have done. So it's not it no left to them discretion. He told them why they error and what they should have done. It was clear there was no gray areas there. So why our court of appeal get it absolutely wrong then? Is beer idiots up there in that in that yeah, high? Yeah, scold them. He scold them and told them he's what them. they should have done. <laughs> yes. All right, all right. So <laughs> let me say a thing quick and fast right. on that one. Um, big up to constable, constable. You know, Soji. Big up yourself, my general. Manners and respect. I don't know um the name con c o n s t. Probably you have to kind of clarify that with me, no Soji. I don't really understand it. Sometimes I just see it and I say constable. But um, what I'm saying is this, George, right? And um, before me give a little bit of a piece of the mic, and you know, James Banner can just make me know when he wants to say a thing too. George and Blacklight, I'm not gonna ask the question if the court of appeal erred, because the court of appeal in that context with the juror stood with the Jamaican law. So the court of appeal did nothing wrong right there. It, with that juror situation, what exactly. George has to understand is that it wasn't a one-off decision that is absolute. There were multiple options on the table as it relates to that tainted juror. Even though the Privy Council, remember, you know, during the hearing, the Privy Council was actually asking for what? Precedence, right? Had, had this ever occurred in Jamaica? Um, No. All right. What they did, they present some cases around the world, right? They yeah. went to Australia, I think they went to Canada, I think they did um in England as well. But long story short, there was none in Jamaica um based on what they presented. Now the Privy Council um judge is do what their ruling is in keeping with what British law, because under British law, so to speak, that is a tainted juror under Jamaican law. As long as the judge does not discharge that person, he is not, in the eyes of the law, a tainted juror. So that is where the Jamaican laws were really exposed to be problematic as it relates to juror misconduct. Um, I just want to say that. You know, um, Lali Bella, yeah, man, you can unmute your mic and go to me, General. Let me hear what you say. Yeah, man, salute, Emotep. Yeah, Max Romy, yeah, big up yourself. Big up the ones and ones. Go to Lali Bella. Yeah. Yeah, salute Imhotep, salute George, James Bannon, Blacklight, and ones and ones in the chat. I mean, Big up George, up. you're disagreeing with James Bannon and Blacklight and Imhotep. 
but my listening to your reasoning, you're really saying what they're saying with a, while still disagreeing. You see, the, the, the Privy Council, you know, their argument is that the judge wasn't judicious enough by way of engaging the jurors when he found it out, when he discovered that the jurors were tainted or could have been tainted. That was a concern, you know. The, 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 the Privy Council didn't argue that the judge was precluded based on statutes uh, as it relates to continuing with, with the trial. That's not what was argued by the Privy Council. And when the Privy Council made reference to a particular statute in UK and England, that was just conjecture to say that if this were UK and Wales, rather. Thank you. Thank you. That this is what would have, this is what would have transpired. And Thank Black you. Light is talking about a black and white reference. So that was just conjecture. They weren't relying on that statute to inform their judgment. What their right. concern is, right. it pertains to the fact that the judge could have or should have done more in their view, and the judge did not. And for those who are saying that the Privy Council admonished the presiding judge, that wasn't the case. He commended them for otherwise having having presiding over a very good um, trial. George, yeah, background kind of nice, a little bit. Yeah, he like, commended them for yeah. otherwise having a, have, for him otherwise having presiding over a good trial, with the exception of how he engaged jurors after discovering about the tainted or uh, potentially tainted juror. Uh, the judge gave three directions, you know. The judge right. said in the first direction, mm -hmm. he said that um, the first, he said this for this reason, the direction one, the direction to the jury on the final day were inadequate. Yes, but it was not against the law. Hold on, no? notice that, you know, being inadequate does it second your judgment, you know. I'm going to give you back the mic to a judge. Discretion. Listen to me. Them saying that the judge, right, and what he did was inadequate does not mean that the judge acted right. outside the law. So let us establish that very clearly here, okay, judge. Exactly, go exactly. Through. I agree with you on that. Okay, again, that, then, that, all right. Then, then we have to make it be clear, though. And and again, the said because the Privy Council said that it means that it's an indictment and the judge not following the law or going against the law, you know? Secondly, second, the trial continue with the alleged corrupt jury serving as one of its 11 members. Thirdly, the judge should have considered whether the remaining jurors might have become conscious or unconscious, prejudice for or against one or more of the appellant as a result of jury X behavior. So, so that George. is what they are saying that. So the judge is saying that the, the judge in the appellant court should have considered these three variables. Right. The prison right. calls can't decide, the, the calls can't decide they didn't consider it. That's all right. You're, you're reading mine there now. All right. Um, hold on to the Lollibella, please. I mean, um, big yeah, up to... Yeah, yeah, man. Big up to the fire starter. Yeah, man. Big up to Baxadan 123 Vendetta. Yeah, big up Ruan Noble, all of the ones and ones, and big up on yourself. All right, so go to Lali Bella and answer so yeah, with us. Yeah, that was James Bond. Wait, right. man. Wait, I'm sorry, Black Light? Yeah, um, it's to the point that both um, the judge directions not being enough. I'm going to say this again. That is more than a reach legally because that is a problematic reach for me as it relates to telling a judge that his instructions, that his regular instructions and usual instructions to the jury is not enough to handle any situation. Is either mean that Will Laws is seriously incompetent or these guys are reaching for an argument? All right, so let me just allow Lali Bella to respond as well. Because one I second, know, one second. Judge, no, no judge, judge, well, on a judge. Remember, Lali Bella was supposed to respond, you know. I, I interjected, so let's allow him to respond, judge, and then you can respond. But I still want to say something based on, on what you said as well. Um, go so, to Lali Bella. So uh, it was James Bond who was talking. I want to respond, but James Bond was the one who was uh, in line. Go, go ahead, Lali Bella. Okay. okay. Cool. cool, cool. So, 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 so George, what, what you've argued there amounts to being roughly the same concern. You know what I mean? The, again, I think what James Bond, Imhotep, and Blacklight are saying is that 
the issue that the Privy Council has doesn't have to do with the fact that a particular statute was violated. And I, and I, it seems as if you are, that's how you see it. I, I don't think there was a categorical admonishment of the presiding judge. The issue is just with the engagement of the jurors. And based on what Blacklight is saying, he's of the view that the Privy Council is overreaching. Lalibella, your boss called in your office. You, you deal with a case and your boss called in your office and said, Lalibella, you should have done A, B, and C. What is he telling you? So here's the problem with that reason. That's a false equivalent because the Privy Council isn't per se, as it were, the boss of the appellate court in Jamaica. It's just a, just a hierarchy. Of course they are. Of course well, they are. All right. Well, so you that. Judge, in that sense. no, but Judge, I, 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 I do agree because what they have ruled is, is final and absolute, right? right. And no Jamaican right. court can go against it. But I just want to say this real quick, though. I just want to say this real quick, right? Big up to Summer. Kenny Marshall, big up yourself, me general. Yeah, man. Wait. So, so let, let me just say this real quick, right? As it relates to the, the word, you see, remember, you know, when, it, when it, we're talking about laws, you know, our statutes, our ordinances, right? You, you, you see, the key word is shall, not true. Yes, shall. Yes, because yes. should should is a recommendation, right? Yes, yes. Shall is yes. It should. Yeah. Mandate, so it mandate. must be done. Yes. Now the privy council said the judge should have. It's not an indictment on the judge. It's it's no. based on their interpretation. So yes. again, now you know, right? The judge, the Privy Council did not point out the judge breaking any laws, you know, or any procedures, you know. It's just that what? In reality, based on laws, and laws are based on morals and ethics, if you had a, have a tainted juror, you can keep him on the, on the panel, to maintain the quorum, finish the case, and then charge him right after. How that for look? How that look? In the eyes you. of the law. Right. That, that, that just look how weird. That look how weird either way too. It no, look how we wait. One second, black light. One second, black light. See, I, I view these folks as being custodians of the law versus a hierarchy of boss and subordinate. But I get where you guys are coming from. But I, I, I view it slightly different. I, I, I agree with you, you know, Annie, but because uh, I was going to see so that analogy that George draw and saying that I walk into my boss's office and I'm a compliance manager and I walk into my boss's office and then tell me if I file something that is unlawful, I'm going to ask him to give his reasons in black and white. Before I even consider it, <laughs> because I may reject it as well, because I don't need to do anything illegal and lawful in my capacity. You understand what I mean, my brother? So if you say Understood. that, my father tell me, say, to do something or make a recommendation, if he can't justify it and it's not legally sound, if I just follow it, it's rubbish I'm doing. It, with that being said, no, the Privy Council made a recommendation in terms of their discretion in reviewing a matter 14 years after to determine if a Jew retained it or not. And my common sense tell me, say, the judge on the ground is the best person you're going to make that discretionary call. Is the best uh, person I, available. That's an error. Like, to make um, discretionary no, hold on, judge. Judge, please. Just, yeah, man, just make black light finish. And then now um, you respond. And then after, yeah, Miss Julia is here. So we can just make sure you wet our. Hi, feet. good evening, everybody. Yeah, hold on, Miss Julia. Make us make yeah. um, black light finish. Judge, respond. And then it's over to Miss Julia. So finish your point, black light. Um, Miss Julia voice threw me off a while ago. Oh, Good sorry. Right. That, that's what I always say, holding the task. Uh, but, um, I was just telling you. <laughs> me too. Yeah. That was not even a nice, sweet voice. Yeah. Yeah. Me too, <laughs> Rose. Me too, me too, me too, me too. Yeah. Go All right. You. So it's, it sounds like the, gent the, the, the great gentleman will acquiesce to Mrs. Miss Julia. So, yeah. yeah. Go through that, Miss so Julia. So what, what, what are we talking I, I just hopped on. So we're talking about the Vibes Cartel case. What are we arguing about this time, about it? Whether it, would the, the retrial will happen or not? Yeah, the question is whether yes. or not uh, is is likely to be recalled or not. Well, I mean, I mean, the evidence is still admissible according to the prosecution, and we still don't know, you know, if there's any more, you know, forensic evidence that coming like with experts, like we, yeah. we were talking about before, with fresh evidence, right? So we don't know exactly what they have. We know that she's being tight-lipped, and we know that she's pursuing a retrial. So if she actually see you know, if they if they actually see that, you know, it 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 holds weight to have a retrial, they probably have something. That's how I see. That's how I see it. I mean, I don't understand. What what is the, the so 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 the argument is that you don't think that the retrial will go through? 
why would they pursue it if if they didn't have a good a good chance well the the, the I, I believe um well, mm. well the, the dpp would be in a position where they would need to save face they would submit a submission regardless of even if they didn't feel that it was um favorable to pursue a retrial um because so they wouldn't just um, default hands down, not have a submission into the ring here. Because I would believe that if the deadline passes and they do not submit any arguments for a retrial, I believe that that's a default win for the, mm -hmm. the, other, for the defense. Um, but it or, seemed like they were aggressive with that though, you know, because that was like the first thing. They're like, well, you know what? Before, before even the, the Privy Council been, um, came through with their decision, they said that they said, listen, if these things fall through, we're using our prosecutor prosecutorial discretion, sorry, to mm -hmm. basically pursue the retrial. So they it came off as if they believe that they still have sufficient ev evidence, right? To so, support their charges against the man. So I mean, that's how I'm seeing it. I agree. So, yeah. so 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 we currently mm -hmm. do not know if the state is going to pursue a retrial at this point, right? right? Right, we but they asked know. for it. The prosecutors asked for right. it. Right. They have to and be I granted think, it. And I think they did that as a recourse in the event that they didn't, uh, they weren't, uh, they didn't get what they wanted. So that was, I think that was a recourse. Our, 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 uh, and here's a question that I have for you guys, right? Mm -hmm. Can it be argued that I sat, having gone on the record stating that he intends to sue the government? For perceived damage or damage damages, right? Could that have informed or forced the hands of the DPP to pursue a retrial, hopefully, to get Cartel to acquiesce to a plea deal versus categorically electing not to go with a retrial? Where is Cartel would then have the, the, that, the, that, the, would the be, that would be a, a good strategic legal move if, if that's the case. Um mm -hmm. right. But the question I'm asking, right? Is that mm -hmm. the rather verbose, verbose ISAT having gone on the record? If he hadn't gone on the record, chances are the DPP would have elected not to pursue a retrial. But with ISAT pointing to the, in, their intentions to sue the government, my argument is my question is could that have informed ultimately what action, actions would be taken by the government? You know what? I let me tell you why. I, I it, thought about that, you know, Lalibella. But let me tell you why um, I doubt it. And I'm not saying that I'm 100% right. We don't know because I, I don't have a, a crystal ball in front of me. But the reason why I doubt that is because the fact that they continued with the trial in the first place, right, without with, with that juror, means that he thought that the, ev the evidence it, it, it itself was enough to carry the case, right? Right. And right. remember that that was also their argument. They basically said that, you know, we can't, this will not mis result in a miscarriage of justice because the evidence is so overwhelming, right? And it's still pertinent, right? Still admissible. So we can still find him guilty based on this. So, we, so, so they had enough. You understand what I'm saying? They had enough um, faith in what they had secured against him. Right? right, so not continue. To so to clearly, to they feel like they still have a case against them. I don't mm -hmm. think the privy council. I don't think the privy council necessarily disagree with that notion either. No. But my question mm -hmm. is that subsequently, mm -hmm. after going to the privy council, mm -hmm. what Isaac has said on the record. My mm -hmm. question is, if he if he was more discreet. Couldn't one argue that that would have been beneficial for cartel? Of course. You, of you course. Ask a great question you ask. Is there no possible way that him being public about those intentions can help his client in any exactly. way? Exactly. Exactly right. right. Uh, right. Hello. Good night. Can I ask a question? Sure. Yeah. I really call in. Bless up, I'm a type. I really just call yeah, in. I was listening because I just want to get the facts straight because I read the, the reasoning panel. Um, mm. Do you have... Any record, as you said, he went on record. Um, do you have any receipt to prove that Isaac actually said this out as his mouth? That he yes, intended to sue course. the government? Of course. Because Not there's multiple interviews of him and the fix saying that Cartel is so blessed as making money on his own. He's not even thinking about suing the government. I could swear I watched countless interviews as that as the fix 
and the other interview he went on. So that's why I'm just trying to clarify. Okay, sure. So, I so, watch so, that one. Right. Hold on, there. hold on, there. hold on. There. All right, so I'm gonna just allow um Lali Bella to respond. Yeah, Lali Bella, Lali Bella respond. Oh, hold on, we, we have 260 people there here, you know. Respect to each and everyone. Mm -hmm. Godfather, FIFA Dan, um, quick sip with fee, big up yourself, you know. Quick sip with fee, drop your channel link, you know, um, sister. Drop your channel link, people. Yeah, please. Um, just check out um quick sip with fee and just drop a little, you know, subscription over there. Please and thank you. And make with us so support the ones them where you know I build them thing and I try to make a difference in the space. So people, yeah, man, just support um quick sip with fee there. Um well on there. Yeah, so go to Lali Bell and respond. And then teeth yeah. is here as well. Teeth is yeah. here as well, people. So we can make teeth say a little thing, soji there too, and then we can do circulate the mic after. So go to Lali Bella. Yeah. What the name of the virgin who asked the question? Is it is it George or no no no? It is I, I It's I I Q Mets. I Q Mets. Hello, see? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I Q Mets. Do you agree that though perception and reality are not necessarily the same, perception matter? R repeat that question. Do you agree that though perception and reality might not necessarily be one in the same? that perception matters not necessarily no i don't agree because there's different stages of, of things you know what i mean so because... you're saying a person so you're saying a person that doesn't necessarily matter no not necessarily not all the time okay 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 fine so here's what i'm going to say to you right there are two there are two interviews or two parts to the interview that he did on the fix right yeah and when they initially asked him if he intended to sue the government he filibustered. He stiff armed them. He didn't answer. However, once once they got him to talk and he was being properly verbose, he made a statement that we wouldn't have sued the government if we were able to sue folks like myself and others who are on this panel. Um, um, and what I will say to you, I will I will kindly suggest you go back and watch the interview because what you're saying happened in the interview that he digests the question isn't facts again. You know, he, I mean, he, question, actually, oh, oh, oh. He, he actually stated that someone is so blessed can make so much money on their own. They're okay. not thinking about to sue okay. the government because who is going to pay for that? He actually quoted that. It's the taxpayers, it's the, the, the Jamaican okay. people is going okay. to pay for that. They're not seeking okay. that opportunity. He actually stated that, you know what okay. I mean? I, oh, okay. And I am actually 100% I'm sure that I even watched that interview last night. So I am talking okay. about and um, of confidence that he actually said that, you know, and he said so, that oftentimes, even on his own YouTube channel, people ask so, him the same question. So All right. hold on a lot of Bella. Um hold it a lot of Bella. I'm gonna make a respond to him. Um I remember I said that teeth there and so today as well. So you don't know anything. Yeah, go. Um I'll be real quick. I'll be all real right, quick. yeah, man, no problem, man. Um for those who are new to the channel and you want to join the panel as well, you can hit the link, you know. So, you see Winston Daily, you know. Winston Daily, you can hit the link to man. You know, yeah, it's a platform where we engage. So, you don't have to be in the chat um, uh, through no word or nothing like that. You can just hit the link at the top, join the panel and give a perspective. Um, because one million TikTok lawyers or Instagram lawyers no, 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 no have nothing to do with who Vibes Cartel choose to be him lawyer. So, that's the reality. But, um, people... Yeah, man. Remember, said us um sip with, um you know yeah. You wanna check out um check out quick sip with fee. Yeah, man. Just check check out our platform and do the right thing, please and thanks. Respect to to Ansel G. Respect to Cash Morning Star. All of the ones and ones them. Go to Lali Bella and then we can make tea say a thing after. Yeah, man. So we're not dealing with a binary in our bridging, and I'm not saying that I sat when he was properly focused, didn't expose what you've just referenced. In addition to what you've referenced, and I agree that he did say that, when he had a better command of his faculties. However, once he started running his mouth, he actually said that they wouldn't have sued the government if they could have sued all these folks who are surreptitiously hiding behind their avatars on social media. Yeah, I hear, I heard that. Part. So, so, so you, you, you've got to be keen, and that's why I asked you the question. I preface by asking you, does perception matter? And you're saying that perception doesn't necessarily matter. But if I were the DPP and I heard any inference to potentially sue in, 
my interest will be piqued and it would inform, inform the actions and direction that I take. Uh, well, could I quickly answer your question? I, 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 I read the reason. As I said, I read everybody's reason on the channel. Big up everybody. I am going to take my day home to the mm -hmm. So I'm going to check in early. Julia, big up. Yeah, big up, dear. Big up, love. Yeah, man. Respect. But, but one more to say to mm. everybody I say, um, to that even matter with the DPP. It's not up to the... If the DPP can want a retrial, you know, but it's not up to her. She has to submit that she wants it and then the, the defense side has to submit and then the court appeal has to go through a process. So when everybody is like, oh, there's a song out there, every DPP get this. Yeah, she could have her agenda, but it's not up to her right now, okay. you know what I mean? But, but what is now? Um, um, that is correct. That is no, correct. No, 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 Judge, Judge, Judge. No, 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 no. We're not gonna say that yes. is correct. The two and party have to submit, well, well, yeah, and then the, the court rules. Guys, well, one at a time, guys. One at a time. Yeah, because you said that is correct. So make we let me finish. Let me finish. In May, uh, in May, Sean Campbell and and DJ Palm and the other person defense of their chance to submit their thing. That's their deadline with the DPP deadline. And the June tenth. The Court of Appeal are going to accept the submission and make a decision. Right, and we understand what, everything what, what, we are saying. What we should see right now oh, is um, that this thing is happening from February 14th, March 14th, no. May, and June. It's actually taking its course. It's actually happening. It's not happening overnight. All right, so Q -Meds. Q Meds, I get what you're saying, but I, I just want you to also understand that, you see, the DPP or the prosecution has to present their argument and they have to make sure that they have the best argument. The defense have to make sure that they have the best argument. So what's this now? Is the better argument is going to influence the decision of the appeals court? No. When you're going to say that certain things might not affect or whatever because it's up to the appeals court. No. Some things can be inserted as an argument to say this is what has been done this is what has been done and things like that. So we should not dismiss um, nothing that was said or done in the public domain, even towards the DPP or anything like that. So that's just the reality. They can put that in their arguments as well. You get what I mean? Right. So we just right. want to say that real quick. But hold on there. Make we just make teeth say a thing, you know, because... No, 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 no. I'm going to just, just respond to you real quick. All right, go to quick and then teeth and soldier there too. So right. 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 Then right. then after us, I'll respond to Lalibella too. Right. Yeah. So I think what the gentleman ought to understand, you know, I am not saying that the DPP electing one way or another to pursue retrial has anything to do with the procedure. He's pointing to the protocol as far as they go forth for a retrial. That's not what we were talking about. I'm merely saying that the DPP still has the, can elect. They have the, they have the DPP is able to choose to decide whether they're going to retry Cartel or not. That's what I'm pointing to. Not mm -hmm. the procedure, not the protocol. Right. I think right. you're conflating um, or mixing up with me, sir. Right. Yeah. Because the DPP, they if they have the stronger argument, remember, I know, and they are saying yes. Um, we request you know a retrial. Then that is just where it's at. Um, teeth and mute your mic. You know, a good look over there still. Let me hear where you are, and then yeah, soldier can say a thing after. Yeah, man. Good night, finally. You understand? Good night. Good night. Yeah, man. Big yeah. up. Yeah, go and listen to the reason. You understand? So, um, Bella Bella, um, we are say you understand? You, 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 you're right, you know, you understand? We are trying to make him know, so the lawyer did say, you're right, you understand? Can I'm literally say it, you understand? Scott, come here, me, me, I think me listen to you, too, you understand? So, you're correct, you're right. Let's say, you understand, so you know, more, 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 so something to one again now. You understand one next thing more, I said to him. I listen to the brother when he, um, Jaboni, you understand? Um, Jaboni, the um, he call himself, must say, um, the mother, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Him, him, yeah. Said, him, him said, him said, him did their England, right? When the child are gone, and him say, him sit down behind exactly. the exactly. lawyer. He said, sit down behind the liar. You're not going to have a wife's car, the liar. And he said, he said, Paula, walk in with two suitcases full of, eh? He said, walk in, Paula, walk in with two suitcases full of evidence. You understand me, I say? So me don't know if I knew evidence or what kind of evidence she did go to England. We don't know. You understand me, I say? So she it, it come like she stack up herself with something for go over there, you understand? So me don't know some people I say, boy, you know, them don't know you shall not new. Boy, me don't know, me just action, you understand? Cause the man say, sit down behind the lion, she should come in with a two suitcase 
full up of evidence. You understand what I say? Right. So, <laughs> so um, <laughs> we don't even know. All right, watch this now. Yeah. <laughs> I'm going to give Soji the mic, but before me say that still, remember, yeah. you know, Jab, Jab Bunny or Badass, whatever you want him, him see the DPP with two briefcases full up of documents, <laughs> not evidence. That's why we have to be very uh -huh. mindful and apply discernment. You get what I say? You can't mm -hmm. say you see DPP with two suitcases of evidence or documents. You didn't even know if documents were in so, here. So, so the reality is that um that kind of <laughs> so nice and sandwiches. spicy, but the reality is that um what was argued at the Privy Council You don't even know what is inside argued. of the suitcase. It wasn't a transparent right. suitcase. Right. So yeah, so it kind of spicy more times. But so yeah. yeah, unmute your mic and go to me, General. <laughs> it could have been ham sandwiches. Okay, after soldier attack, man. Right, respect. <laughs> respect. Respect, come on. So, mm -hmm. all right. So, make we make we dumb it down to my level, you know. You understand? Know if me saw now we like, you know, me kind of, me kind of mm -hmm. know. Go through, man. Go through. We're listening, soldier. All right, pick up yourself, Miss. I'm doing your yourself. camera on, you know. Sorry, soldier. Let me know if you want your camera stay on before me add you, you know. Oh me. No, 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 not you, Susie. Okay. Someone am doing my color. All right, yeah, all right, cool. So, big up Roxy, um, back dime, you know, respect for the check in, sister. Yeah, man. So, mm -hmm. go to Susie. I'm sorry if I cut you. So, so, more while Mr. to the um, the YouTube and the social media thing, and everybody is she the whole lady at talk about TNT jewelry, this, that, whatnot, and whatever. Okay, me thinks every really, me thinks every really, um, we are waste with time upon the TNT jewelry full in the I'm not gonna tell you why I'm saying full in the Because if the Privy Council me no said they the the um yeah. the, the the prosecutor and the and the defense bring that argument about TNT jury. And the Privy Council, which is our final court appeal, never overturn the verdict and say, yo, look at this man because he didn't get a fair, fair trial because of a TNT jury. In my understanding the Privy Council sent it right back into the Jamaican hands. I want somebody to be wrong, I'm right. Mm -hmm. There was a question? What yeah, yeah. May I say, mm -hmm. the, 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 the argument about the TNT jury and tamper with phone and all these things, where them bring forward, where the defense bring forward to the Privy Council. Mm -hmm. And the Privy Council never overturned the verdict and say, yo, look at this man because you know, but TNT jury. Or I wanna have to go do this. The, it in a, my understanding of where the privy mm -hmm. councillor did was mm -hmm. put it right back into the courts of Jamaica. But mm -hmm. wait, 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 brother. They did speak to it, the fact it had to do that because that the so hold on, judge, hold on, judge. Um black light, um and so and then afterwards I'll say something. Yeah, my name is yeah. Julia, yeah. and then um, I know I think they, they speak to the fact and they did infer that the jury may have been tainted or may have been contaminated and that is a question that the judge at first instance should have observed or taken more um further actions like further directions outside of the jury's oath you know which is is, is one of my is my homework that out of the case i need to find other cases in which the jury's oath is not sufficient for them because i that that means that our jury oath need to it need work need updating or something you know because it's, it's it's years it's hundreds of years it's the same words for jurors you know it's a bit of a it's a bit of a shocker when i see that in the in the in the case it looked like a reach because that would suggest a lot of things you know um and that would have to mean that our judge would have to have been psychic to know that the legal understanding of the jury oath is insufficient to handle matters where the question of a contaminated juror or jury is brought up so, so can go ahead so um um yes that is true um but lalibella so um so so what you're saying was another reason or what you're thinking that the dpp might um might be pursuing this is us is because of the fact that um Vibes cartel lawyer was saying that he was going to sue the government for 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 what the client went through right no 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 answer my question so, no, not one answer. The I did. I said that the race No, he did answer your question. No, yeah. no, 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 no. You don't answer my question, brother. You want me to repeat the just, question? All right. Just hold a bit. Two and get answered. All right. So yes. just, just to respond to and remember, yeah, um, yeah, so sure. I have, I also have Dewey and Makala. So at least Miss Julia just finished the point. Yeah. Yeah. Lally no Bella man, Lali Bella still there, man. Um, just okay, finished the yeah, point, Miss Julia, right? and then 
George yeah, can so respond. I just want to make sure that I understood what you're doing. saying. Right. Lali Bella, are you still there? Yeah, man, I'm here. Go ahead, Mr. Bella. Yeah, okay. Sorry. So, 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 Lali Bella, actually, that's actually a good point. What did you ask the question? My, no, Lali. because what he said first, what Lali Bella said first was because he thinks that the reason the DPP is 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 pursuing the prosecution, and per, sorry, pursuing again, right, um, the retrial is because of the fact that um, the, the lawyer there, um, Isaac, said that he was going to sue the government. But Miss Julia, so, uh, no, but hold on, hold on, hold on. No, no, so, no, no, no. what pass, I'm saying, pass. may I ask a question or yeah, go back to where Lali Bella said? Yeah, because me I wanted a... to respond to Lali Bella. No, me I say, I mean, ask a question. Lali Bella already said, What am I say? Me, no, ask... but, uh, but no, uh, but I was responding to Lali Bella before you came on, though. Right. And the guy sufficiently answered your question, but I could get to your question after because your no, question no, no, well, hold on. Sense. Remember, say, um, remember, say, do we in there and, and right. Um, Jad say he want to respond to so Soji as much. Well. So Soji, Soji, you don't have to worry yourself, you know. Because if you think that Miss Julia might not answer, George is just waiting right. to respond and then as can, well. So can talk go about to Miss Julia and then George so, yeah, can so, respond. So, Lalibala, what you're saying is a very good point about, you know, another reason. But remember that I always say there can be more than one reason for a thing, right? right? right. To me reasons, personally, right. I feel like as if, I feel like as if, I feel like as if not only do they believe that they have sufficient evidence, right? That was the whole reason why they continued in the first place, right? They can also mm -hmm. say that, you know what? This is such a, it's for public interest, right? Because of the, the, just because of the fact that, you know, it is a public, it, is, it has been such a popular case and they want to basically show the importance of upholding the rule of law, basically, Wait. because it's so pu yeah, pu help. public, Rem right? As well as, as, yes. as well as, as well as, right, they might even be saying it this way. Because remember, I think it was Kenny before that said that, or it was Blacklight, that said that it is, which is true, because I've heard it before, where they said that the prosecutor's job is to pursue justice, right? And the defense job is to get the client off. Now, they might basically say, like, you know what? A retrial is definitely necessary to ensure that justice is served. So they are basically saying that, you know what happened? Okay, fine. To make sure that his rights were not were, were not were, were, were not hurt and you know, went to the court of appeal, fine. But to make sure that justice is served, we need to retry him. So that so that's another that's another nail in the coffin. But also, there is still egg on the face from before them even reach to the privy council. So to, to me, it seems as if one of the main reasons why they want to retry him is to basically say is to basically prove that they were right with continuing with that tainted juror because. For, for, for the reason why they continue with that tainted jury in the first place, because their argument is we had enough ev evidence and uh, the, him being tainted wouldn't affect anything. Okay, fine. Right now, they're going to prove to them, they're going to prove to the whole nation and to everybody that, you know what, we're not going to privy council was a waste of time because we could have continued anyway because he's still going to be found guilty because the evidence is that strong and the case is what we have against him is that strong. So they're going to want to see a face. And they can put all these different spins on it. And yes, it is true that maybe the fact that he opened him mouth and thought, well, he was going to sue the government. That is another reason why them that, 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 that them doing it. All I'm saying is there can be more than one reason for a thing. Right. right. And, um, and, 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 and Well, and, all right. So George, George okay. is going to respond to Suji. And then Duane has been here. So we definitely yeah. have to allow Duane to say a thing after George. So go ahead, George. Let me hear what you have to say. All right. Um, Suji. Why they never outright um throw oh, I, I think Suji got kicked off or um oh. something, you know, he's you, not here right now. Listening. But I mean you can oh. go ahead and respond. Maybe he's listening. Maybe he's listening. Right. Yeah. Oh yeah, he's, he's back here. So okay. yeah, go to yeah. what we must understand and the context is this. There were three matters put forward to the Privy Council. They were to rule on three matters. One, the trial judge failed properly to inquire into allegations of jury misconduct. That is one. Two, the trial judge departs from standard practice in inviting the jury to retire to consider their verdict so late in the day, putting undue pressure on them to reach a verdict. Three, the trial judge erred in admitting the telecommunication evidence data because it had been obtained in breach of the interception of the Communication Act and the charter. Those were the three issues before the Privy Council. So the pre they didn't say, and because and the, the defendant, they didn't say, because of these three issues, we want you to dismiss the case. 
They didn't add that. These were the three matters before the Privy Council. They looked at it and they take out one in terms of the jury, the tampering of the jury. They said, this is so grievous that we don't even need to look at the other things, but they are substantial for we to look at. So there mm -hmm. were three things before the Privy Council. So the Privy Council not going to go dig into other things that don't concern them. So that is why they refer it to the, the lower court said, these are the issues. This is how we rule. Go and sort it out. Because what the Privy Council um, do, you know, the Privy Council don't tell the appeal court how to rule, but they give them, they gave them instructions in terms of what they need to follow. The right. precedence, and, um, procedures, and so forth. And um, and um, just to add to that, George, um, you know, just for context as well, too, the listening audience, you know, it go. Um, the, they were what about 40 or more, right? For 40 or more, quote unquote, issues throughout the right. trial that was submitted, right. and the, the Privy Council decided say they're going to hear those three. All that right, so um, so do we in Makala? Um, oh, hold on, one second, one second, do big up to Michelle Clark, respect, big up to the ones and ones and people. 301 people are here. Just drop a like on the stream. Thank you all for being here. Um, do we and Makala? Just make sure that your device is not um, you know, there's nothing in the background. All right. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Can no you hear me now? Can you hear me? You. Yeah, you're good. Can got you. Me? Okay, good. See, what more have to talk about more on cut it short, but you know, I said everybody around from the the the, 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 the other co-defendant, them that more have to talk about because if them go, if them lose. And the case got to trial. When me a year, me a year, so one of the guys them up for parole either next year, you know, and the other couple them up for parole like five years later. So are they gonna sit down and get a retrial when they know they can lose? I end up spending the next 30 years behind bar with cartel, or them are gonna just take a deal and walk. One thing, mm -hmm. that more no more. Assuming, mm -hmm. assuming that they're given, they're offered a deal. Right. Okay. Mm -hmm. It's kind of too late for that, you know, my brother, in terms of the question, yeah, in terms of where they are right now. Remember that they're all waiting on whether or not a retrial is going to be ordered in a more general. So yeah, that all makes sense. It's on the same appeal, and so that they're all available for that if the option is, cho is chosen by the Supreme Court, by the Court of Appeals to send it back to the Supreme Court, they're all going to be going with him. So it's a case against all of them. So at that point yeah. in time, at that point in time, you're saying that if their defense lawyers can reach out and say that they're willing to comply or they're looking forward to a deal with the state? Yeah, yeah, because one of them, for him, I forgot the name of the guy, him parole up, him for him parole is next year. So you're going to tell me, say, you're going to sit down. When you know you can't come around and you're going to sit down and try, when you know you're going to spend the next 30 years behind bar with cartel. And that no, more but, no. so, but I'm doing that. That's not how that would work, though, you know, because either way, even with this reach, even if they go to retrial and whatever, right? And yeah. um, let's say for argument, say the DPP or the prosecution, they won. Time serve has to be factored in the yeah. decision. So you see, whoever um is awaiting, I think it's Andre St. John, I want them. Yeah, he's awaiting what two him about two years left or whatever. Yeah, time yeah. serve has to be factored in as well. And at the end of the day, too, remember, you know, even though it is centered around the group, Andre St. John have the two years left. So no matter what happened, him still have the two years left. True. But That's Cartel got about 15. Yeah, but Cartel got about 15 left, so... Yeah, but that's why he's fighting, yes. And I understand that they are appealing it. So what I'm saying mm -hmm. is that person that has two years left, I think it's Andre St. John, I stand corrected, right? Whatever transpires, that sentencing will remain. And mm. unless unless the DPP can present new evidence and the appeals court accept it, it's a year ago. Andre St. John, in yes, responsible for so and so body, and so and so body is a different scenario. But, yeah. but if it is as it is right now, it's gonna stand. I'm going to James Bond. Um yeah. that's actually not factually correct because when you have a retrial. The judge is now, the judge, the, 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 there's, uh, everything is thrown out and the judge can now sentence it to whatever. 
the set the sent what they have to factor in time sir yeah. in this oh, oh, context yeah, yeah. right yeah they will have to factor in time sir so let's right. say you know, i really try to get 40 years now now they have to take out 15 years out of it so you go under 25 more and secondly when they're up for parole that doesn't mean all that means that they put it to parole board or if you're fit to go road, that don't guarantee you're going to road yeah so two years you can go to the parole board so but remember the parole is off the books now you know everything is, everything is off the books right now they're not, they're not charged that's why i said the judge that's why they said their sentencing doesn't stand anymore but so i think if, the point if, if if they go to court now mm -hmm. and they're found guilty the judge can now issue new sentencing for them what will happen the judge say get 30 year now we're going to give it instead of 20 we're giving a 30. you already did 15 so you have 15 more to do right but james bond and unless there is new evidence against um that person andre st john or whatever it don't matter right? new evidence once they found guilty again no right new type of sentences your old sentence doesn't stand anymore no i right. understand that but i'm just saying they have to factor in time serves what i'm saying is if if they proceed to the new trial and whatever let's say for argument's sake and um you know the prosecution has won if there is nothing new against um st john like what else can you use to extend this time you mean new counts in terms of the sentencing guidelines? Does, does, does it doesn't matter? The judge can still <laughs> send the judge can give him once it once it's within the sentence the guidelines. Yeah, once the judge can give whatever the judge sees. Right, and he, and he and he got what? He got 14 years? If he got right, 14, well, the judge can still give him 28 if it's within the sentencing guideline. Well, right, uh, well it doesn't, it doesn't guarantee him. Well, I I, I understand that point. I understand that point that um him getting 14 years doesn't mean it was the maximum he could have gotten. I get that. You get what right. I said? But 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 if there is not nothing new against him, you know, I understand again that it's the judge's discretion where they can use whatever guidelines are there and go the maximum if he never get it and whatever. But my, my point was though, chances are as well, you know, him having two more years left, <laughs> that could also be a factor where, you know, yeah, in the judgment, yeah, man, if, if no new evidence is presented against him, then they can say, all right, make this stay right there. Maybe yeah, because what? previous proceed, but hold on there. Previous proceedings are actually they are actually considered in a retrial, because right, in well, a retrial, even though it is a new hold on, even though they're treating it as like a new legal proceeding, you know, even though they're treating it like a new legal case, the judge and the legal team they can still refer to the transcripts, they can still re refer to evidence and any kind of rulings from the previous trial for, from the previous trial. Sorry for guidance, or to clarify certain issues, so they can still go but even though they're going to re-examine the evidence and all of that stuff right and go through that fairness and due process all of that they can still refer to transcripts and evidence and any kind of rulings from the past trial before right they you don't have to throw right. the baby with the okay. bad water it's right. all right. dependent it's, it's all dependent it's, it's all dependent on the judge we don't even know if they get about the same judge. that's right yeah, yeah, yeah. that's right and, and, and so that's where so I'm it's, going. so it's all dependent on the judge because it's the first case are you found guilty now the only thing that is a must is your time served so whatever time the judge give you now you already did 15 here all right if yes 15 now or the judge decides the time yes, served the already or whatever that's the only yes, that's right. your time can, right. can i say right one, 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 sorry the, one, gentleman, so the gentleman raised a good a good point a while ago and the point i want to support it with is that you see um predominantly over all jurisdictions when a court when a prosecution team is pushing for a retrial of a matter is usually a slam dunk case. When mm -hmm. matters are, are thrown back to a court for a retrial and the prosecution team is willing and ready to jump right. up, well, it usually gives the notion that these people are concretely sure. Yes, there you go. Gonna, you see, most retrials, yes. most retrials everywhere is yes. usually a conviction. It re, <laughs> it's very usually, true. So let me just say this, uh, you see, for all of the men that's tied into the matter, that is the issue that they're all facing. But the issue is another, is a financial one as well, because most likely the person with the most at stake and the most at risk is the person that is paying all of the lawyer fees. Mm -hmm. When you look at the team. Of and people. also, look right, at this, um, right? Oh, sorry. Big Let's up to Bridget. Bridget. Sorry, I forgot yeah, to Miss Julia. Bridget. Big up Bridget. Bridget my sister. Yeah, got to Miss Julia. Yeah, no, no, no. But but Blacklight also, just to piggyback from what you said, right? I don't remember exactly what you said because it, it just caught me. But um, remember that also the inf any kind of legal precedents from any from the higher courts, right? From the appellate courts or from the from from, from the from, from England, basically, right? The, the 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 defense 
or the pros or, or the prosecution they can use that argument you know to influence the argument to, to influence to influence their arguments when them go there to basically say you know what we do want a retrial because remember what they said what did the highest what the high court said they said there is still a case here basically go back and try him if you have a case if you don't have a case then you have to make him walk because his rights were were, were, were hurt right so they are going to use that the, the impact of that of that trial right they're going to use all of that to basically help to influence their argument because that 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 and i won't call it an admonition but that instruction came from the higher court right are you there right right, right. So, right. so they're going to use that. The, 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 the prosecution, they're, they're going to use that to help to strengthen their argument for a retrial also to make sure that justice is actually served. Yeah. All right. So, so um, one second, Lali Bella. All right. More magnetic entertainment. Is that Remember that Andre said that even though the court of appeal is reviewing the murder. Black Lives Matter, you hear me? The DPP office is the office that is responsible for administering justice. Yes. Is Black Light hearing us? I, I hear think he was hearing. We're saying the same thing, Black Light. We're right. Same I, thing. I'm saying that um, Mo Magnet Entertainment is saying that, remember, that Andre St. John was sentenced on a different, um, you know, murder, different from the lizard one know. while in prison. So I guess he's saying that hmm. even if that, that, that 14 year they went and get whatever, um, hmm. if even if that passed, he might still have more to deal with on a different matter. But, you know, respect Mo Magnet. We don't speak in the context of this particular case still. So, you know, if him depend on the next one, at least we know say after 14 years, chances are he might know say that one he are done with. And then go focus by the next one. Go to Lali Bella. Yeah, right. yeah, but I, I think what more magnet is saying still matter, right? Because if Andre is of the view that being victorious in this regard won't necessarily help him materially down the road, he might not be as in, inspired to pursue any deal that could be a potential risk for him. But I agree with Miss Julia and James Bond. Well, we don't know. Well, well that I would say that will help him more. That will that that will be more appetizing for him to make a deal because if you already do your time on that and then you have a next murder case to the face, then you can probably put in out your two cents in other case to get a leading on yes. the case you have ahead of you. Right, right. I agree, right? And that's a very good counterpoint. Where if he has a good lawyer and if he's of the view of that, I mean that gives him leverage. I agree. And, and, and I agree with what both you and Ms. Julia were saying. We don't know if mm -hmm. this new judge, if the judge today, if they were to go to retrial, we mm -hmm. chances are they're not going to use the same judge. Mm -hmm. and, and I agree, uh, James Bond, that everything has been discarded. I believe everything right. has been discarded. New In jury too. Brand new right. jury, and, yeah. And then the last thing, Ms. Julia, right? Even though they may mm -hmm. consider certain things, mm -hmm. That doesn't necessarily mean that they they're bound. Right, they're not bound. Right, but so, it would behoove them to consider it. Right, definitely. Yeah, I agree. yeah, it would behoove them to consider it for them to win, right, and for them to continue. I was saying is right. on the table again for consideration at the new trial. I'm Pardon? Sorry? What was that? I said basically, Miss Julia was saying that everything was on the table again in, for consideration at the new trial. That and we don't know what else may be more, right? Because listen, right. the prosecution and also the, the 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 defense have the same amount of the same amount of um the same what do you call it uh what do you call I'm it not, opportunity opportunity. The prosecution and the defense both can present evidence, right, relevant to the case as the first thing that which can include anything, a physical evidence, witness statements, testimony, the expert opinions that we were talking about from before, right? Any kind right. of any kind of them them can them can make any kind of legal arguments, both of them, based on yeah, the, 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 the 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 previous channel, um um the 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 pre the press sorry the precedents that they have and the previous um the the, the previous trials that, that they had, right? That, uh, yeah, it's going to be brand new with a brand new jury selection. That's that's definitely for sure, right? But really and truly. The retrial going to follow the same procedural steps as the as beginning, which is basically opening statements. Then I'm going to present them evidence, witness examination if them can't find any, cross examination if them can't find it, people to cross examine. Then closing arguments, right? And then of course, them not going to slip on this jury instructions, right? That's that's right. how I learned it is it is laid out, and that's how it's going to be. You understand? But of right. course, they're going to use the instructions of the higher court to basically strengthen their arguments. And the only for, for the instructions that we heard from the higher court, to me, 
it seems as if only the prosecution can use that to strengthen their argument because what? I don't see where the defense could uh, use anything from right. the because you know what I mean because the defense would okay what did the what did the what did the higher court agree with the defense that that vibes cartel his his um his his rights were 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 were, were, were hurt okay so so everybody agree with that and I'm saying that but they also said there is a case here and if you can try him then go forth and try him. So Thank I you. don't see how you understand what I'm saying. I'm seeing the prosecution using that to strengthen right. their uh, uh, strengthen their argument from the upper court. Go ahead. What are you saying to me? Right. Um, hold on there, please. Uh, one second. Yeah. Then. Yeah, man. Big up to L to Air. You know, respect for the check in. Um, the Godfather. Big up yourself, man. Respect for the subscription as well. Big up yourself. You know what the thing go. Um, mm -hmm. Bridget is saying that um the likes definitely not matching up to the numbers. You know. Yeah, man. Mm -hmm. Hundred and forty five likes and three hundred and eleven people. So just drop a like on the stream, people, please, and thanks. For those who might not know how to do it, just exit the chat. Click the X at the top right hand of, of, of your screen. Just hit the like button, which is a thumbs button, and then you can just come back in the chat. So nothing wrong with that. Respect for the likes. Um, Go to Lala Bella. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah I, I agree, I agree with Julia. Uh, for the most part, the, the, the Privy Council, in some respects, tacitly and in other respects, mm -hmm. explicitly strong man the efficacy of the, the the proceedings yes yes all the, and they showed they gave a pathway reconcile mm -hmm. this concern and wink wink you ought to be fine mm -hmm. we, didn't, mm -hmm. we didn't have any major concerns or they didn't point to any major concerns right independent of the the jury related concerns right right there were there were um procedural concerns the way how they continued with the case but there weren't necessarily any factual issues then basically so i'm saying so there were more legal issues than the way how the, the case was was handled than anything else you see what i'm saying yeah, yeah. i agree so, i have um, advantage prosecution mm -hmm. right um nikki willie thank you for the super Big chat up, nikki willie yeah man nikki willie said thumb <laughs> up the live stream people thank you thank so you. respect mm -hmm. nikki willie man and ones and ones you know a solid potent reasoning this you know reasoning of the highest Leveling at the YouTube streets, the whole heap of quote unquote village lawyers present, and <laughs> we don't take it as an insult, you know. It's just how we can reason. I wouldn't consider stuff. myself, a yeah, man. So, the ones and ones, them can just leave a like on, on the stream, and you can hit the link at the top as well if you want to join the panel and share your perspective. Big up and respect to everyone. Let me comment on that, my brother. The village lawyer um notion that is being spread by attorneys. Let, let's let's first say this. This is law. Right. Um, is a code that is written in in the native language of wherever it's governing. So the first thing is that if we can read and write and we can translate our own and comprehend our own language, we have the we have the capacity of understanding what there is. There you go. Thank you. First thing is go us the regular people. And this is the reason why we need to understand it so that when we go, let's just like when we go to the mechanic, I know most of us men trying to understand the problem before we reach there because we don't want somebody to just take us for There you go. See? So, mm -hmm. right. so the law is to govern our lives. So we, all of us deserve to be village lawyers and should appoint ourselves as village lawyers. Thank so, you. Exactly. I, exactly. I love that. I love well, that. Well, I, mean, I am fully... I feel his lawyer still, so I just they say they still. I love you know? that, but you know, um, remember, remember the first. Remember the text eight seven six. Respect me, general. Respect. Me, general. Remember the first no, direction from oh. the court. You know, I, is that say one ignorance thing. of the law is not yeah. a defense. Exactly, it's not. Oh, well it's no an excuse. And, and, and you know what else, though? Listen, listen. And sometimes people study something because they love it, and they don't necessarily want to make a living off of it. Okay, and that does, and you right now with the age of information, you should not use school as an excuse to not to not be edified on certain topics. Okay, talk, and not only talk. that, but it, and a, a, a resource is only a resource as, as as long as you see it as that. So if you know lawyers and if you know judges and you have people in your circle, then tap their minds and get some things from behind them ears because twelve years whatever them spend on them school fee, they can impart that to you easily in a conversation. So it's Make so it's good for you to 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 be learned. Don't wait for school or think that oh, but I forgot the law school, blah blah blah. I love the law and I study it just out of loving it. I don't love it enough to make money from it to actually make a living from it. You understand what I'm saying? And the same thing with Lalibola, same thing with 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 with, with Imatep. So I don't. I, can I, I, I say don't one? Can I say this to Miss Julia? I went yes, to school sir. and there are a lot of teachers who are prominent who don't even understand the subjects that they were teaching. So <laughs> That's see? true. Yo. <laughs> All right. You see, so, you see black light? To, to, to black your point, light. to your point, uh -huh. black light, to your point, black light. Why the business teachers are school over business? <laughs> yeah. JP, big up yourself in the general. 
Black Light. It's when, <laughs> yeah, you, read, it's when, it's when you read the first page of H. L. A. Hart's uh, The Concept of Law book. Mm-hmm. The two points that you've put forward, you know. People seem to have a command of things and they're never able to explain it. There you and go. Also, and he also points to the fact that the lay person should have the capacity to discern law within reason. There you go. You know what I mean? And yeah. and he and he wrote that book from the perspective of the lay person being able to understand what he was saying by having a basic and like he's of the view that any 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 average person should be able to understand law. There, there you go. There and I'm of that same view too. There and you know what else to black light? If you <clears throat> understand a concept and you cannot explain it to a six year old child, you do not understand that concept. But you yep, say, and that's what you yep. say, um, Lalibella. Uh-huh. Remember, said yeah. us, even Miss Julia was advocating for civics being taught, right? Yes, um, yes. Mr. Vegas in there, and he has even said it. And yes. I agree of that, of course, probably of course. 95% of Jamaicans have never read the constitution before, which is madness. You get what I'm saying? But, but and it's imagine. a legal document, so imagine. I think I think this okay. is a step in the right direction where yeah, more that, people right. should focus on understanding the laws because it is beneficial, even in their. Um, social environment as well. Um, in, in the, hold on, Imhotep, yeah. you're being too ambitious. Those people, that 95%, they probably have never heard of the Constitution. Much as um, to read it. Wait, right. uh, Bella, let us get this clear too. Lawyers don't have any sort of special inept intellect that is their core. <laughs> exactly. Let's exactly right. There, there, is, there is one thing to that. There is, this, there is this notion that once you go through law school that you're, you're an intellect, you know what I mean? Right. That's, right. that's absolute rubbish. And let's just get rubbish. this clear. Oh, well, it, yeah, I mean, they're speaking legalese. That's the only well, thing. Yeah, wait, right. no, brother. Wait, no, wait, no. Let me finish. There are two states, I believe, are sure about one California, mm-hmm. where there's an open bar for everybody. You never have to go to no law school. You mm-hmm. never have to do no law degree. You never have to do nothing. You never even have to go to high school for register and sit it. See? And I can tell you this every year, there are a few people that are marvel those persons that are marking those exams yeah so so, yeah. so miss julia and i spoke already you know um yeah LSAT is not a prerequisite for all our schools nowadays. no it's not so, no so, it's so, not so so, so, so uh, we agree with you definitely yeah definitely definitely but you know what let me just say one last thing before miss vegas go listen people on the chat and ladies in the chat everybody in the chat everybody on the panel don't let these people project their inept ways on you don't make them feel make you feel bad for 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 forgetting information or wanting information or wanting to be learned you don't have to have a degree behind your name to be to to be able to talk on a subject okay or you don't have to have studied it in an institution to 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 to, to, to be versed on a subject you hear so don't make them make you feel bad with village lawyer and all kind of foolishness that's but that's because of their own insecurity and because they are comfortable in their ignorance don't make them drag it down. Really. But but a quick question. You yeah. know, the last time I checked, though, or maybe that's just a statement. The last time I checked, I wasn't aware of the term village lawyer having a negative connotation to it. Well, the way it was I mean, used it was, was a negative, term that though. was used to say, well, when somebody talks a lot, but um, most of the people who speak a lot were the ones who, you know, them didn't know a thing or two and them talk about it. So well, sometimes they get a nine. I would well, say them talk too much like them have been Yeah, but how it's been used though, Imatep, uh, yes. it was not for a complicant. The complicant. No, I understand, I understand. Yeah. But I'm saying, yeah, I do agree with you that the way yeah. it was the, it was used. Right. But the reality is that village lawyers, you know, yeah, you never carry a negative oh, emo. I think, but, to it. but it is being used to discredit people's arguments. So there you go. Exactly. To the argument rather than the substance of the argument. That exactly. is right. No, I, I agree. agree. I agree. Yeah. I agree. It's being used At by least we are not ambulance chasers. Oh my god, <laughs> I haven't heard that one in a long right. time. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> it's being used by it's being used by attorneys, and I'm going to draw back to the same mechanic analogy. You see, the bad, yeah. the bad mechanic, when you go to the shop and while you stay around at the front, and you can't see nothing around at the back, which mm. you can't work for, and you have nothing for set to you more than you are done or this again problem, and it's done. See? Right, right. Um, the mechanic will make you see, will make you understand, discuss the problem. Will <laughs> you see what I say? Mm-hmm. Exactly. So, right. Um. Yeah. Right. So, um, big up to, listen to me, ones and ones. Drop, drop a like on the stream, please and thanks. Big up Uptown TV. Respect our manners. Um, mm-hmm. Subi, yeah, man. I don't know if you're ready to say a thing now. You can make you know where I go on. I'm mute. All right. So Subi so still checking. mute. So he's not yeah. ready yet. Um, George mm-hmm. James Bond. You guys want to chime in? Oh, no. Oh, and George, I need to correct you from the other night, too. You, um, being a, um, Still here. Still here. 
being a Queen's Council, do not. That doesn't authorize you to argue your case in this. In the no, case. man, but, but, but James, man, you did it I, the same night, bro. Come on, man. You did it yeah, the same I, night, And I man. put my information in the chat. Right, right, see. right. But oh, you, did, you did it, James, man. So nothing wrong with that. I, um, I, I didn't see it. Well, they probably might not remember you. They do it still. <laughs> no, <laughs> man. I, I somebody else to do it. I didn't remember. I told it who I was reaching out to. So we Hold on. Is it you or I'm Kenny? George, who was it that I'm correct? Was it him or I'm Kenny? I think Kenny. No, it was I, you, James Bond. Come no, on, bro. I told him I was waiting. But to I can post back mine one. again. Right, <laughs> but, but <laughs> when you said the same thing, team, he posted it in the chat. But anyways, the little joke mm. better than Quarrel. Um, so bless up, bless up, bless up, bless up, bless up. Yeah, yeah man, got you. Yes, I. Heal up all village liars. <laughs> yeah, man, fully, fully. Heal up all <laughs> bush doctors. <laughs> yes, I. Yes, I. We can attest. That's right. Yeah. I yeah. remember saying, you know, heal up all vloggers and bloggers. Um, I can remember say, people just use these these words or these titles because they cannot. It's like you know a deflection from mm -hmm. how to deflect from what you're really saying. Mm -hmm. So in time, I, I um I was in a store yesterday, and I healed up the security when I was passing him, and he just sort of out when I passed. He was like. And my response to him was like, blagger. You said so? <laughs> yeah. Wow. You said blagger. And I was like, this is the mindset where people have. They think that because you said blagger, I supposed to take it as a disrespect when I used to write blogs. Before there were any Facebook and Instagram and all them things there, I used to write blogs on Google. Mm. So this is not something that you're going to throw at me and think it's um, going to impact me negatively. I was going to spoil my dear. I'm going to turn on and say, go, S your mother are, mm -hmm. you know, I know you're trying to disrespect me. Right. But you don't even realize it. Uh, it's actually big, yeah, big me up. Mm -hmm. Because vlogging is something that people actually do and people um, get paid to oh, vlog. Yeah. People get, people um, working. Mass, mass communication as an era where people blog mm -hmm. for a living. Yeah. You see what I say? Mm -hmm. um, village lawyer, <clears throat> that name is negative, been negatively used. Why? Because when one person that is influential and um, um, discredits something, then yeah, this, the, the, the base are the people that follow that one thing is going to use it in a negative way. But we have, we, have, we have come so far to the point where we can have anonymous people being very popular on social media, um, where people tune into them without hearing a, an authentic voice or seeing a face, you know, because mm -hmm. you know um, the, 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 the times, the times that we're living in. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. So I don't look at these things as as I think it's just people trying to throw a tantrum, mm -hmm. kind of and really get to deal with what I deal with. Yeah, but we've seen we've seen these are eras where, where people are studied in, our people are learned into becoming bloggers and vloggers and village liars and you know, because to be a village liar, obviously you have to read up on the information. Obviously, right. to speak on the information, you have to do some research. Understand the matter? Mm -hmm. So these are the things. Now, regarding Carter's case, becoming an university. Oh, first thing, I forgot my, my, my intro. Mm -hmm. It's good to see Lalibella and, and everybody having such a good conversation. Oh, yeah. To yeah. show the public that even though we may disagree on some subject matter, that not change where we are reason for other subject matter and the respect we, 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 we share with each other. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So, I agree. so I appreciate yeah, man, the fact that you know, we can hear Lalibella and Imhotep for reason and everything. That's because, how we do it, man. We don't have to agree yeah. for everything, I agree. you know? I everything, yeah. I agree. And, and, and people like Lalibella, um is needed on, on this platform to bring diversity mm -hmm. so must diversify the argument yeah because sometimes yeah. we need a one person of a challenge or two you know people are even skeptic even though skeptic are like on jamaica but we, we, we know so you know very <laughs> well, smart we forgive, we forgive. <laughs> the man and he push us to go do research. Yeah, 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 big up skeptic, man. Big up skeptic. A reason yeah. more time, and we can move past things, you know. Yeah, yeah man. So exactly. he push you to go to further checks and further research and all them things. So he yes. skeptic said, you know, man, I walk on the moon. We have to go find the evidence and look it up. He said, man, he forced us the other day to even go look up the thing about the eclipse, and we realized that people were 
where people believed what he was saying, people actually yeah. believed it. Is a matter. And on, on, on the issue of Vibes Cartel, um, mm -hmm. I think my, 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 my percentage of him coming out actually increased. Based on what? I think, that, I think it has increased. Based on just doing further checks and looking mm -hmm. at the Charter of Rights and all them things here and speaking to great minds like people that have, um, uh, and this is not as for, for the guys up to go, go, go celebrate and say Vegas did say. But it's just me talking to great minds who have won cases, um, um, hard cases. And um, the feedback, I think, I think, I think he has an 80% or 80 something percent chance to come out. Based on um, what? One, one, I think um, it was on the prosecution side that, 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 that um, he was not given a fair trial um, um, with the time the amount of time with um he is spent in jail because the constitution still tells us you must be tried in a reasonable amount of time so the reasonable amount of time i think it, it can be argued now that you know it has passed a reasonable amount of time here and you can point back to it and say oh but he was tried because that basically is like it's, it's basically quashed like what in quash like i say yo that not even count because you know the, the trial was 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 he, he did not get a fair trial um and, and secondly i think his health um and, and so forth i think that's going to play a role um because you cannot treat the um the 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 the, 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 the people who are charged or the people who are arrested or the people who are locked up in an inhumane manner so there are grounds to argue i think there's some some so so many areas where we can the, the his defense team can actually argue from the charter of rights um the, the charter of fundamental rights for jamaicans and i think i think that is where the prosecution is going to have issue with, with arguing that they should go back to trial. Those, I, want to those, I want to respond to that. Yeah, I wait, want to respond wait, to wait, that. Wait, wait, wait. Those, one point to, one point those to, um, reasons that you give, like, especially even with health, because I was saying that in the beginning, but that would be based, that would be more likely on him getting bail if they decide to go continue with it. If they, can't, if they decide that, yes, a retrial will be granted, okay, fine. Then they're going to ask for bail then, so that he knows stay there, so that while they're retrying, while they're gathering before the, before, before the, before the um the the retrial come up, he can actually get care and be in a healthier environment outside and give him bail. So I don't think his health situation would necessarily be. I, I, I think I think it, I think it I, I think it retrial. does I think it does because as as I said before as I, as as I said before, it's like basically like we said, him not get a trial yet, and for him you know we can't we, it's basically yeah 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 say yo this man have been sitting in jail until he got sick. Well, that would be and a, 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 a fair trial. So to try and know. Is that Mr. Vegas? No, no, in break yeah, 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 is more of an argument for bail as as for the pushback right, for six, exactly for bail. Wait, 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 wait. As for the pushback yeah. for six, the defense have a, a solid argument because this gentleman has been refused in medical assistance. So the fact that if, if you're gravely injured or if you're right. gravely ill, if you're gravely ill, there is no possible way you can refuse medical refuse assistance. medical assistance. There you go. Exactly That's right. That's exactly where I was gonna go. That's exactly, That's exactly right. Go. That's exactly right. Exactly right. Thank you for bringing that up again. Defense. Listen, is, is it my phone or is somebody else's phone? Can you guys hear me? Yeah, I hear you loud and clear. Oh, okay, I'm hearing sure. you clear. Okay. One I, I, of the I, I, biggest issues was what um what um mm -hmm. Imotep had raised earlier. The biggest challenge, I believe, for the whole state in this issue is the, the, the criteria for determining the impartiality of the jury based on the public exposure to the, 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 the whole matter. Right. Yours. So that's a very important point in terms of the criteria of establishing impartiality and finding jurors to, to match that criteria. That's that's going to be very interesting. Um, and that's going to be very challenging. Right. Um, big up to Big Spliff, you know. Um, big up to all of the ones and ones over there. Mm -hmm. Big up. Um, all yeah. right. So who was making a point now? Um, was it Miss Julia? Yeah, no, I finished making my point already. All right. Go to Lala Bella. Yeah. yeah. So Mr. Vega, shout out here, sir. Um, yeah, look, I can check out gone, because gone, problem signal. Gone. Will it stay away, you know? So cool, mm -hmm. cool. Maybe so we'll check back in still. Who knows? Yes, you, you see the point that Mr. Vegas was talking about this idea that he's been held 
mm-hmm. longer than is reasonable. Right. Yeah. Um, to the extent that he technically is being retried, right? Mm-hmm. And clearly, you know, uh, the, the, the principles that preclude retrying someone for the same case, right? Yes. But there are always exceptions. There are conditions wherein the, 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 that's overlooked. That's, you know I mean, right. and a case like this where his case was quashed, the, them reset the clock per se. So you won't have double jeopardy. Right. So to the extent that things have been reset, as it were, I mean, we start can't, everything. Yeah, right. we can't necessarily argue that he's been held beyond a reasonable time. Yeah. Right. Or being held exactly. without. One, one point too as well is that um the fact that um that that um wait there I lose track go on go on no go through man you are yeah. you are right out you are right on the money yeah I, I was saying before that um the 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 impartiality of the jury mm-hmm. is a challenge for the state overall which is something that not only um is is a prosecution really that is, is going to have to bear that on the state in terms of their responsibility and it's their challenge. The defense is going to be, going to have an easier time to raise questions as to the impartiality of any juror that is called. You understand what I mean? They're yes, going to have yes. raise arguments while the prosecution will have a harder time to establish that impartiality criteria that the person would have satisfied to be called as a juror. That is true. But and, and right time, now, to, but since you say that black light, one but, second, Ms. Okay, I'm going to give you the mic real quick. Um, since they said that black light, right? Mm-hmm. Right now, right, and I stand corrected, it's only in a case where it's capital, um, you know, yeah, capital dirtings, um, where you know, yes, there there has to be like you know, a 12 member juror. Mm-hmm. But in this case, I am not aware of I know with the with the with the one done, you know, the clansman trial thing. It was like one judge, the chief justice that did it, but that was in keeping with the anti-gang legislation that was recently implemented. You get what I'm saying? So if if them not if them not identify cartel them as being a member of a gang and throwing that in the mix and whatever, for you the chief justice for be the one judge will deal with the matter. Them are gonna have problem pick to get jurors. So so let me ask you a question, Emma do you think, based on the fact that several individuals are being tried for murder, that I just want to say that I'll to... uh-huh. say, say that this oh, what this cartel case is the first clansman case to be honest with you, right? That's what I was gonna, that's but exactly you what guys are forgetting public interest, okay, and also the new policy considerations, which is which is which always, regardless of what people say, is an unwritten rule. It 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 holds some weight, okay. Great point, so, Julia. Right, right, all right, all right. have to be balanced against the public interest and the threat to the public. Exactly. Once the public is perceived to be um to trump the right, then that individual because just remember, you know, remember that hapus corpus is a legal instrument. Facts. That's all of us rights immediately as soon Facts. as it's so just right. remember, constitutional right. right it's not something that first thing, once rights are permitted to you, that means the, the same mechanism that permitted to you can take it away. That's a very real scary talk. Facts. Re- real talk. But Facts. You, have, you, exactly. you, have, you might have laid out the yeah. case for the DPP. Wherein they might be of the view to re, to approach it from a gang perspective, because we're trying multiple individuals of murder, right? And they might be able to argue that cartel is the kingpin. Yes, they, they would be, they would have a position to argue that everybody is under the, the the management or the leadership of that individual based on the prominence of the individual. Right. Yeah, and I mean, <laughs> and, and I mean, but also to you know, a certain way, they have to be be, be very you know mindful of meaning say. Whatever arguments they're gonna present, they have to show enough to convince the, the, the judges on the panel. Because remember, right. you know, are, are the judges them they might try for what convince you know, so them have to whichever way them approach it, them have to know say you know them reasoning solid. Richard Patriots, big up yourself, Miss Julia. You were saying something, yeah. No, 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 I was also saying that the prosecution will also use the privy council's decision to bolster them their argument for a retrial because they're going to clearly say look they didn't make him walk they said there's a clear case here they are the higher court right, who right. we left who we left this all up to so we have to take into consideration their judgment right even after looking at the case so they they, they clearly didn't say that no this whole thing is garbage right they said that if you have a case to retry 
So basically, they will use that to to bolster their argument. Yeah. Right, and 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 if and if the defense pushes too far, by way of saying that Carter cannot get an impartial juror, mm -hmm. clearly, clearly, I could see where the DPP, you know, I mean, the, the prosecutors are thinking. Well, say they were to sell that to the judge, then we clearly will have to have these recourses, right? Wherein we'll, we we will represent the case wherein we show Carter as a kingpin. And we can use these new statutes to get him even a lot more firmer than even before. Yeah, but Lally Bella. Lally that's, Bella. A difficult, that's a difficult thing for them to do. Lally Bella. Lally so, Bella. Um, go to Lally soup. Lally, Lally Bella. Yeah. Um, I'm going to be quick. I'm going to argue for the point. So because my wife can handle two videos from there. I'm kind of the old. But, but yeah. you, can't, you can't up the charges. You can't change the charges at this point. They can't no, no. come now and say no. you're charging based on like an anti gang based on the anti gang legislation. They can't bring that in now. No, no. Uh, okay. Not so I'm not sure if that's what like what you were saying. No, 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 not at all. Not at all, Mr. Vegas. Not to change the charges, you know. Right. But to argue it from a different vantage point. They can't, they cannot yeah, argue it, you know. He's a member of no. a gang, but members are really listening. Them. thing. I really right. like they Lisa cannot, Williams that, and them are focused on still. That you know? argument, they make the argument because we know what's mm -hmm. on. Like, it's a massive, that cannot, that cannot happen. I cannot yeah, argue so, from that point. Uh, so, so here's what I'm going to say. I don't know if they precluded from arguing from that position. I'm not they cannot, they, can't, they, 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 they would have to bring new charges and pro provide evidence on that to prove right. that he's so, part of a right. game. I remember I said that's, um, what oh, is oh, now? Uh, okay. No, hold on. Hold I, I'm no, sorry. Hold on, yeah, go to that. Go to Right, Mr. Vegas. Right. Yeah, so are they precluded from presenting new evidence? I I'm don't not sure. I'm not sure about that in this trial. Yeah, but I know they, they I, I, I know they have to present um, arguments, um, 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 but I'm not sure if, if, if they can come with like new, uh, like like when you're talking about a gang trial and everything, that's a whole different ball game. Then, them that them that are something them that they go charge him for yes, yes, they reading and right on um, anti gang um, anti gang Ray Ray. No, it boils down uh, to no, it boils down to a sentencing guideline or kind of thing. It's a whole different ball game. Now. But what I'm right, saying you know, is too. Sorry. What I was saying no, too. Uh, uh, what, what, what I was saying to um, Miss Julie is not just mm -hmm. about getting bail because he's sick. I'm basically saying that it can be argued that he has been held in jail, has gotten sick in jail, so his his constitutional rights have already been violated because being being locked up um, either enhances his sickness. So it has already, it, it can already be argued that they have been cruel to him already. Because so, I don't, again, I don't remember, you know. That, I don't agree right, with right, that. We, right, and we mm. might not agree. We're not no, not agree. I, I, agree I, 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 I may not agree. Yeah. I may not agree with the premise either because what I'm mm. saying is the way the different angle can be argued from where it's going to be left up to the court to decide. Okay. You understand okay. what I'm saying? So, so I may not even agree with that argument, but based yeah, on his no. fundamental rights, his fundamental rights were already violated. And, and 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 in the sense where yeah it, he it, it was look away it a look away still and no and no they would answer the system really if he um, don't get bail so, so, that is biased so, now you so know it's not it's not in bail it's not in bail bail no, I think it's past argument, bail what, no oh, but oh, what I'm oh, trying to say that. is that argument that you just gave it will right. hold more weight if they're arguing for bail than for him to walk free because that it it is it's not heavy enough. It's but, not heavy enough to, 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 to justify him walking free because he's sick. It's, it's, it's heavy enough to justify him getting bail. No, 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 no. Not, not justify the point to walk because he's sick. He, he got sick on the, on, um, on, in an institution where he has been held for so many years with yeah, no because they thought he was a trial. Because on, remember, on, remember, on, on, remember, on, on, he's a prosecutor. Is the prosecution basically um, um watch the the, 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 the the whole thing? But, but Mr. So don't forget is that. It the, is it the condition of the facility that got him? Mm -mm. Thank you. That's where I'm going. Right. So no, no, no. Yeah, no that's has, not has it been established that him being incarcerated caused him to be ill? Right. It can, it can, it can, it can be argued that it enhances his sickness. Because I remember no. when his attorney was arguing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That can so be argued. Attorney, that the conditions. His attorney was arguing yeah. that he was held in in in, in certain um situation. Um, um, locked up in, in heat, all of them things that he was subjected to. Um, Those are weak. Not just confinement, so, they put it when they place him in, the, in, in, in other other parts of the, the, the prison where it was so, extremely. So, yeah, go ahead, so, let me right. so let me say this real quick, right? Two things. Imagine the precedent set if a person can argue that 
the facilities is adversely impacting his health, so he ought to be freed. I, imagine that. And remember, you know, the, the problem for cartel is that, if I'm not mistaken, the prosecution, the state is of the view that they could have offered him the health services that he needed, the treatment. Right. But he and elected he no. not to. Right. Exactly. So they're going to put No, no, we, no, but we know in Jamaica, we know in Jamaica, the treatment that they're going to offer him and the, and the, and the, and the, and the um, it's, it's like, case in point, like me go to the doctor and then tell me, say, everything all right with me. I may have to go all the way to Turkey to find out what really wrong with me. So, so based on, so, so it can, what I'm saying, you know, there are so um, many different angles where this can be argued from. Um, and, and all this can be argued. Why? Because the prosecution messed up. Boy, all of us, I think, can agree on this. The so, prosecution messed up the whole thing. They should have retried the case. Um, mis, mis, um, 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 mm. Dismissed the, 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 the juror. Retry the case from day one. And we wouldn't be at this point now. So they fine, cannot... Fine. Fine. Yeah, right. but well, you know what, what though? One moment, Jula, one, one moment. One moment. Oh, yeah, sorry, go ahead. Sorry, one moment. I'm sorry, Mr. Vegas. So my virgin wife just became the chief medical officer for Andrews Hospital, right? Right. What if the prosecutor were to get that person within reason to say that, listen, yes, the treatment that Cartel needs, he could have received it while being incarcerated. What if right. they can establish that what Cartel is saying is not valid? It's still gonna be it's still gonna boil down to the facts versus the hypotheticals. The fact is no, is gravely exactly. the yes. fact is yes. the fact yes. the fact is 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 gravely ill. That's the fact. And, and right. the fact and is attention. and the fact is he did not receive a fair trial. Remember, we're not talking about whether there's a there's a little echo um from so, here so, and so um, Mr. Vegas, right? Double check that please. Mr. Vegas, right? You what if what if I were to employ you to do something for me, right? And you weren't compensated for the fact that you didn't submit an invoice over to me. Is it enough to argue that you weren't compensated, or can it be established that you were derelict? Exactly. And submitted an invoice. Exactly. No, because 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 guess what? Guess what? This is not. But this is not the case here. This is not the case here. But the Mr. case Mr. here is the case. It don't make no sense. It don't make no sense because so what? He elected not to go the treatment that's available to him. And not only that. No, 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 no. Hold on a second. Not only did he deny it. Okay, same of grave disease and it's getting worse as you go in there. Okay, there are legal options that his lawyer could have take while he's in there. That's why them have grievances. The lawyer could have said basically saying that you know what happened. My 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 client, his health is being neglected there. Right. He's not receiving appropriate medical care. None of those grievances were filed uh, to, 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 to our knowledge. Okay. A matter of fact, the opposite happened where they're offering certain medical thing and refuse it. So it, 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 so for, for, for that to hold water, they would have to go through everything and, and say, okay. Hold on, 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 one minute. Is there, um, is there um, evidence out there that he received is medical there attention? Evidence? What do you mean? There because is, where, where is that? Where, where that, is that the was, evidence that, that his was, lawyer filed a grievance that my that my that my that my client, right, who is gravely ill, right, is not receiving appropriate medical care? No, 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 no. I'm asking if if, if 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 it's put if it if it's out there that he refused if he refused treatment. That's what I'm asking. Him. Well, that is what that. Well, to be honest, that is what. No, that, no, that, no, because um, the, right, so, so we can't get that, that is allowed so, to go. So, and, so, and, so, so, yeah, right, so we can't get up. medical care. I've, I've heard that. Yeah, I've but that no, but you can't. But there is no what, but what evidence does Mr. Vegas have, or what? No, 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 no we're not. No, we're have? Deep, No, we're saying but, no. But we're saying no. There, that there was a grievance f um filed by 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 the lawyer that would cover. No, 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 Miss Julie, we're talking no, going forward. I think what, the, but remember June that um, remember when out. they move him in at the rain, him lawyer did um forward out and and he right. file a grievance um when right. they move out yes. and spend, right, but and I'm then right. they have him in a solitary. Miss Julie, Miss Julie, Miss Julie, what we're talking about, you know. I'm talking about preparing. I'm talking about the argument that the arguments that can be presented. Yeah, but I'm saying that argument will not hold no weight because no, we don't know say, that. No, 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 we don't know that. We don't know no, that because no these are hold, valid. No, no, weight, no you can't. You can't know that Let yet. Let me tell you, you why. Know that yet. Let me tell you why I know so that argument not hold no weight. Let me tell you why. Just you're going to be surprised. Words. You're going to be surprised. Why, why you're going to owe me a drink. You're going to owe me a drink. You're going to owe me a drink. All right. No problem. 
the reason why it's not going well no wait, right? But when I'm say, oh, be, because he's because he's sick, you know, them should just throw it out or he shouldn't be retried or he shouldn't be convicted. No, because anybody who is convicted, even if you're one month pregnant, too bad, too, 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 too bad for you. You're going to bring the baby to term to nine months and then they went to the, the state going to take your pity. Unless you're in certain parts of Canada where they actually have child care for, 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 for people. Well, I'm going to do the but, but, but is it is important for you not to misrepresent the argument. No, but hold on. No, I'm we're not, not we're not saying, hold on, hold on, what you have to say, the way what that's what I said. Right, what we're not saying because I'm sick. If right. it gets thrown out, okay, we're well, saying based on its fundamental rights, because the Charter of Fundamental Rights yeah. states that, that was... you cannot um, hold somebody in confinement and treat them inhumanely. Right, but this is and the it thing, can no, be this is argued, not... it can be, well, it can be yeah. argued that he has been held in prison for so long, mm. his constitutional rights No, 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 no. Was so let abused. me tell you why you're wrong. Let me tell you why. Let me tell you why. Let me tell you why. No, it's not first wrong. All, it's interpretation. No, yeah. but first of all, his rights, the, the part of him rights has already been dealt with. The Privy Council already found that, okay, his rights, based off of this and this jury tape, this jury tape, his rights were, 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 were not, were, were not given the proper weight. That's the first thing, right? No, 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 violated, it's, violated, violated. We're violated. Okay, fine. Yes. The, 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 and that, same and thing. that's the same thing. And that's it. So, and so that's they, the president. No, that's the president. Vegas, that's they the president to make the argument. Mr. Vegas, listen now. They dealt with his rights already. So right now, right? For 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 only to say, oh, you know what? They held him so long, they shouldn't do a retrial. If the DPP, which is her, which is their job to seek justice and ensure justice, especially for 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 for, for the public, especially for, for such a great case, him having sickness, it it, it 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 really don't matter to them, right? Because him have a grave disease, him have ears, him have cancer, uh, whatever. Uh, Miss Julie, Miss Julie, Miss Julie, Miss Julie, Miss Julie, Miss Julie, take cartel out time. Can't cartel on the punch trial. Right? Let's just take sickness out of it. Let's just deal with the other gentleman then. Right? The fact oh, that the prosecution... No, I'm not the other accused them. Let's okay. throw sickness out of it. I was just throwing that in based on the argument that can be presented. Oh, like, okay. But let's let's go with the other gentleman because more people involved. Well, no, the argument changed. So what's the argument? Right. No. So what I'm saying to you is mm -hmm. the fact that the prosecution mm -hmm. messed up, mm -hmm. did not give these men a fair trial, mm -hmm. It's going to be argued that their constitutional rights was violated and has been violated for such a long time. To so now say you're going to try them, right? You'd not get a second opportunity to violate, further violate their constitutional rights. Yeah, but and no, that, think that's going to be to, No, but to counter that argument, what they're going to say is the Privy Council ruled. The higher court, the highest court in the land ruled. And what did they rule? If you can try them, go forth and try them. He didn't right. say that. He didn't right. say that. He didn't say that. He didn't say that. He didn't say that. That's what they said. Miss Julie, they didn't say um, it should be thrown out. No, it's a, right. it's, it's in your, your hand. hand. Right. Let me just say a quick thing. That there's a case here. Roberto. Yeah, man. Big up to the ones and ones. Even people just drop a like on the stream, please and thanks. Um, big up to Gregory as well. You know, big up to the ones and ones. Them. Um, George. Yeah, I think you want to interject. Um, yeah. Um, big up Gregory. Agree. Yeah, Miss Julie. Yes, dear. Remember, you know, this the Privy Council only look at his constitutional rights. Mm -hmm. They didn't examine the condition that he was held in or anything like that. That was so, not under consideration. So, so George. what Mr. Vegas is saying, no, <laughs> this might be a point of the defense to put forward no based on the condition that he is in no so that was never a consideration before but, but this is what i'm saying to you though no. george the reason why that's not when the whole water you know why you know what they're gonna say okay if it was so aggrievous where are the where are the the the, the, the things that your lawyer is supposed to find where are the grievances other from the rain what him get wet up in where are the other grievances that your lawyer was supposed to file since it was so aggrievous right where is first of all this is what i'm going to say where is the note taking Show me, show me where him actually show where them was actually because when you when a lawyer go through this and when a lawyer doing that grievance, what them do, them actually take very very detailed notes, right? Them take notes of 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 your case of you trying to get medical medical help, not getting it, of your condition worsening on Thursday, blah blah blah. He had shortness of breath. He tried to go to the nurse. They they, they turned him back. They they gonna they gonna they gonna ask. All of these things. Where are all of these things? If if you know, if this you know what the case. you know you know what I also learned, Miss Julie. Yeah, I'm I'm you know what I also learned. 
you know what I also learned once, once again, I'm going to quickly wrap. Yeah, what, yeah. what I also learned, I also yeah. learned that he can sue the state. Well, that's a different argument, but it's not because of him sickness or because of the the the, the, the place he can where he No, him. based on based on the violation of his fundamental rights, which is I'm why they went you, to the Privy Council. The, for the listen, of the, I think, I think, I think, I think, and just for the record, mm -hmm. I think the prosecution is a, as a very tumultuous task of bringing back Carter to, and what they're going to do is they're going to present an argument and even if they say okay let's go to retrial they're going to just bluff and bluff and hope for a plea deal so they can have a conviction but trust me well, let's wait and they, see because they, we don't know what them have i'm leaning mm -hmm. for Carter to come out 90 percent to 10 percent mm -hmm. can i get one um, and you're on record saying first, that. Uh, so black all black you people, on record, that, on record, all, you, on record all, all of you people who say Mr. Mi, mi, um, Mr. Vegas don't want cartel to come out, he's on record now saying that him really leaning for for for, for him to come out ninety percent, ninety percent, ninety percent. And this and this actually increased after reading the fundamental the, the, the <laughs> chart of fundamental rights. Okay, so you, you're on record. Yeah. Uh, you're in your I don't and, agree. And the and, and, and the constitution. And the constitution. Let me yeah. in, terms of, in terms of medical grounds, right? What yeah. they would do, remember, you know, the prison have a medical doctor, you know? Yes. So the prison medical doctor would have a file on cartel. There you cartel go. Cartel personal doctor would have a file on him. There and you they go. would now bring in an independent medical doctor to evaluate right. the two things and see if there is grounds. But, but hear this, though, Judge. Hear so this. that would this have to be established. No, but hear this, Judge. You know what else? You know what else is going to take into consideration the past. So they're going to say, huh? Did he notify any jail any jail staff about his worsening health condition? Did his lawyer do that? Huh? Did his lawyer seek for 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 uh, extended medical attention or even a, a heightened medical attention than than just going to the nurse? Huh? Oh, did he follow the medical advice? Like, did he was he taking all his medication? Did he refuse any help given to him? Oh no. Oh well, did did he also advocate for himself in a written grievance as well as did his lawyer do that? Did he also document his condition getting worse? And did he also Miss, Miss Julie, the Miss Julie, options? Yeah. Miss no, Julie, no, Miss Julie, no, Miss Julie, the fact that me, no, me. gentlemen, these are these are things that are provided to the defense during all, his tenure there. All, all that, all that, all that doesn't matter. Yes, all it does. Just, no, yes, it, it does not matter. It fact. does not matter. You know why? Check it. Look at it this way, Miss Julie. Look at it this way. Me and you can argue that they actually, um, I right, look at it from this way not the exact words of Melipa still, but he was held basically against his constitutional rights. Not true. He was held basically like he was not held basically like a captive, not, in a, okay. not, not really words, Melipa. It was like he was held like in a like a duress. captive. You're saying, duress. But there was no, no not duress, not duress, not duress. No, yes, 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 Mr. The Julie. Yes, then them so, sending him to a prison and based on the violation of the constitutional rights, they sent him to prison for 13 years and he did no, not. No, Mr. They Mr. did Mr. not. Mr. They Mr. One, Mr. one, one. Listen, listen, oh, oh, listen. Oh, listen, oh, listen, oh, listen. No, 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 no. Listen, yeah, they finish. did not, they did not follow the guidelines of the, um, because, remember, so we are looking for, you know, how, what happened? What happened, we know, is they basically abused his constitutional rights. They violated his constitutional rights. And that oh. is that has to be taken in account by, by continuing the case, send him to prison with um, a juror that was 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 uh um, no, was, was tainted no 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 I am taking drinks. You are going I am to taking a, drinks. You're, you are going to be dry because you have <laughs> zero drinks. Anybody, uh, I'm going. I'm going now. I'm going now. I'm going now. Who who, who <laughs> going drinks? Who going drinks? I don't want to know right now. And that. I'm on record. I'm on record. Who's going drinks? Who's going? Miss Julie, I know I have you. One drink. Yeah, right. I'm drinking up all of one, drinks. One Guinness. One Guinness, Miss Julie. Who else? Imo tap you one. Give me a Guinness too. <laughs> well, 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 no, you know, you know, so I go and observe though. Lally belly, you're putting guineas on. May I get you something from over daddy, right? 
<laughs> all right, all right. So that's a two, two all, all right. So, so Subi, so um, Soma is asking if if you are being for real. One hundred percent. You actually say what you say. I ask, 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 I'm taking drinks. If you can't put a chat, you know, come, 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 me no for fun. I'm an IT, I'm an IT, IT specialist. Can't find you know, say, if you know, say drinks, I'm gonna find you know, I soon know. If you don't give me the drinks, drinks, Mr. Bond. So I have five people saying drinks, I have five people saying drinks, and I'm gonna save this live. Why are you pushing me? You're pushing me. You're pushing me. Why are you pushing me? Why are you pushing me? The judge did not do anything wrong. Because they, what, when they proceeded, yes. the that was yes, a he did. Done. Yes, no, he did. Hold, yes, he did. On, yes, he did. No, hold on, Subi. Subi, make, make. No, I'm out. I'm out. I'm out. Me just tell you, say yes, he did. Bye. Yeah, man. Big up, Subi, man. Big up, Subi. When the judge proceeded with the case, mm. it's not like they broke any law. It was up to discretion, and they decided that they want to go forward with the case. What is mm. so hard to understand in that? Um, yeah. yeah, man. I agree. I agree. Yeah. I said that Mr. Mr. Vegas' arguments are flawed. The first area mm. of it flawed is that is to say that he's being wrongfully held or he's being held unlawfully against, you know, that 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 is rubbish. Um mm. I'm wrong for this. Yeah, that is technically flawed. Even after the conviction is quashed, he, he for, being you, here for for all is to the suit is still the wrongful. For, wrongful, for wrongful conviction. He wasn't convicted wrongfully. That's why you can't sue the state for wrongful conviction. Yeah, exactly. mm -hmm. That's it. Um, so that, that is one. Too. The next thing is that, that, remember that the state made all sorts of facilities to make, make it a speedier process in terms of this gentleman. Even mm -hmm. the fact that, even though it was reported, because Mega said this now, is his lawyer I hear talk about when, when asked on the fix about him refusing medical attention because it was in mm -hmm. the cleaner first. And then him lawyer go up on the fix and go answer that question and say, people must understand, say the hospital, the same people that lock you up, you, you, you won't trust them for. For, for giving you the best medical attention or something to that effect, he, mm -hmm. he made it. Right, right. I was trying right. to remember where right. I heard it. I was trying to remember I heard there it. There you go. He, he did not. And reject. also remember that there are provisions wait, 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 there. Wait. Sorry there. Go ahead. Yeah. So the lawyer did not reject the position that this gentleman refused medical attention while he was in custody. There so you let's go. The, way. So we're not, the court don't have to have any extra sympathy for his medical condition. There you go. a very pretentious stance in terms of the gentleman refusing medical yeah. attention if he's gravely ill. The there you go. That the court and also the facilitated evidence, black light of procedural of what was, jumps sorry. to skip cases because we have to remember the Privy Council says three cases per year on average over the last 30 years is not no more than three, probably one or two years is four. You know what that means? There's a bunch of cases that backed up because, as I explained before, once people are convicted of murder and are going to sit down for the worst of them life, the only option for you right there so, is to appeal. Am I right, right or am I right? You are right. right. You and, and you, you get a conviction where say you're going to sit down on the rest of your life, 25 to, to life. You're not going to look for your lawyer and say, appeal this no, appeal right. for me, please, and not right only away. That, so everybody coming out of a murder conviction, yeah. their lawyer write one whole heap of bag of foolishness. I went, no, with not no gossip. Even the privy council not, not have to review exactly. those matters. Our court of appeal review most of them, but some of them are granted leave to go to the privy council the privy council is bogged down and don't have no holy for resources and look upon all of us matters up. right the privy council said that is a lie and say that more, wait hold on and further they more are black light. furthermore black light the, what, not only that but mm -hmm. even if they bring that argument the first thing i'm going to say is what evidence are what evidence is there that there were certain steps taken right if his health was was indeed worsening while he was in, incarcerated. That's so they're going to look, and, and there are provisions there for the defense to actually do all those, as again, the grievances, notifying jail staff. Grievances filed, but I never heard any grievances filed over I can't hear you. I said there were a few grievances what? filed. Did he go? Can you guys hear me? I'm hearing you. Oh, okay. What you did you say? Sorry. Yeah, yeah I'm we're hearing yeah, you. Yeah, yeah. I'm yeah, saying, yeah, yeah. So basically, they're going to look for anything. You see, if there is any kind of paperwork or even any kind of any kind of grievance, um, that, trail. There are a few grievances filed by Isaac. As yeah, but for, uh, for, for about his condition being wait, about no. him not getting proper medical help. Wait, no, no. I've not seen any or heard any that speak about health. I've heard about there you go. I've heard about mistreatment. I've heard mistreatment. about twenty-four hours. I've right. Not, Anything. I haven't heard anything about 
I haven't heard. First of all, there is no letter of even advocation for him to say, okay, he advocated for himself here, right? Because his medical needs were not being addressed adequately, right? None of that. No kind of documentation of him condition to where he, he, him keeping a diary because that's the first thing that the, the, that, 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 that the lawyers then going to tell you they're behind the, the judge. He said, keep a diary, document the condition, worsen it, worsening, document every time time stamp oh. every time you go to the nurse you try to ask for the for for, for the nurse oh, right oh, notifying the jail staff all that there's no good, evidence good, Julia. Yeah. Julia. what didn't yeah, cartel sorry. wasn't a cartel letter published in the newspaper pertaining to his health but it wasn't something basically like a, like saying grievance saying like okay my 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 I've tried to get medical assistance and it's worsening because of because of the deep neglect that they're that they're that they're giving me yeah. against my right. There's just nothing like that saying that. Nothing like yeah, that. I think that's what it was. Uh, I think from a but that is yet to be established. That is yet to be established. But I'm, but I'm pretty sure I've seen Carter at the University of Hospital maybe one or yep. two times since he has he been locked up. Out. It, he got he got medical attention at various times, you know, for yeah. chest pains, all kind of things. Mm. But what we're saying is that he had refused medical attention as well. So if you're gonna say that he's in a dire state, it's like a it's like for instance you're in an accident. Zine? Right. One party turning, one party overtaking. Those are contributory, you call contributory liabilities. There you go. So one party would have get like a 60% wrong, and the next party would have be like a 40% wrong. See? Right. So you, so you have a particular situation in law where you need to mitigate your damage where you're suffering a loss at the hands of another person. So mm. say for instance, I lick you with a big stone, and you can go get medical attention, and for weeks you neglect it. See? Mm. For weeks you neglect it. Black but Janima, Janima music. The reason, the reason why his his eyes are bulging out of his head there is because of the part of the Graves disease. Them give him a certain steroid, right? And them actually call it the, 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 the call it big head big head syndrome. You can Google it. So the steroid that them give them to to deal with the Graves disease make them head swell up. But because of the water retention, it also make him eyes bulge out even more too with the Graves disease. Because Graves right, disease right. does make your um, eyes bulge out like that because of your pressure, right? right? Um, so all right, that's so why it's because of the steroids that he's on. Why right, so, so, so George was yeah. George was saying a thing, right? Oh, sorry, so, George. Yeah, okay, we're gonna let George say a thing, and then sorry. after George, we have Astro, Astro mm. check in as well, so we can hear Astro say. So go to George. All right, black light again. Pushback. You keep bringing up this argument about discretion. There is no discretion where jury contamination is concerned. True. Drive, in other words, if you drive in a car and it have a flat tire, the car can't go any further. Black, um, hold on, George. Saying, hold on, George. I'm Astro. You know what I'm saying? You think so now, we in general. Um, just check back out and check back in. Yes, yeah, Astro? Just check back out and just check back in. Yeah, man, you sound bad. You sound bad, bad, bad. Yeah, you bad Astro. Just check back out and check back in. You are probably reboot yeah. your device or something like that, my general, and check back in. I'm um, sorry for cut your jazz. Got you. Yeah. The Privy Council is saying that once you reach a stage where you have this flat tire, you have to stop and change your tire. You cannot rim the car to the destination. There is no, what you, what you call it? Discussion or that you use, I'm not sure of the word. But there's uh, once the jury is tampered, it, 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 you it's are me. on it, 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 it at that point and change it. There's no Josh, discussion. I would, employ, I would employ to read the laws of Jamaica before you really talk on the facts. Because what you right. say is the laws. Hold on, Josh. Hold on, Josh. Josh, hold on there. What this is where, that? This is where I go. All right, James Bond, I got responding on you. I get for, for pushback, so to speak. So, finish, to James finish Band. first. And, all right, finish then. Finish then, George, and then James Bond can respond. The law of conduct and operation of jury in Trinidad, any Caribbean that, that's prescribed to the People Council is no different. What? The laws that govern all jury is configured. <laughs> how they operate. The only thing that is different between the courts is that you can, you may have seven, or you may have 12, or you can have two. But in Judge. terms of their conduct and, ton, and contamination, there's Judge. all across, all the courts, they are the same. That's all right, right. Well, 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 because I um, got allow James Bond to respond yeah. Lally and then you can yeah, go man, ahead yeah. after. Yeah. Um, yeah, man, big up to Fully Gaza. You, team, I am, respect me, general, for the check in. Got you, James Bond. 
Uh, this is the last time I'm responding to George concerning this issue because same way, the other night him wrong and strong, tonight him wrong and strong again. The, the, for the last time, what the judge did, the law allowed them to use their discretion. And that's just where that at. And George had employed, go and read the laws before you start. Right, and, and we did say that earlier too. And, and we did say that earlier too. Yeah, back and forth again. Yeah, so, George, 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 no, no this one, judge. This one, this no one, this one, this one, went over this so many times. Yeah, yeah, yeah the law does, the law does. Don't worry, judge. You cannot use discretion once. No, hold on, it's not discretion, judge. The law... The law allowed the judge to one either kick him off, meaning discharge him, or two allow him to remain to maintain the quorum because they had 11. And if it went down to 10, whatever, whatever, we understand, say, yes, there is some degree of bias perceived there, so but the law <laughs> did allow him to make those decisions. So we now going to say he acted outside the law with those decisions. So, so him attend. No, only thing what the law have him to do is that what, what, he cannot what, 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 go what, what, below what, what, 11. That is what the law allow him. What, but once what, the law what, what, says, once you find out that a jury is contaminated, once you find out that the car tire is punctured, once you find out that the jury's contamination, you have no discretion but to dismiss but the judge, entire exactly. jury. Judge, that hold, on, hold, on. hold on, people. Let us speak on the law. I want, I want not to our no, opinion I mean, because, here. hold on now, we're moving away from what the Jamaican law at the time was to, the to Jamaican law our... Can't oh, judge, I just hold on, numbers. judge. Imagine judge. Just numbers. <laughs> no, R12. judge, hold on now. Judge. The reality is, you know, me general, at that time... The jury act allowed the judge to keep that tainted juror. That's the reality, yeah. my general. We can't go around okay. the law at There's the time. No that was the law. But, but I... Imotet, but Imotet, that violate that violate the man's right to a fair trial, though. Okay, I, I don't disagree right. with it. I agree. Oh, I agree right. with what you're saying. Okay. But oh, what I'm saying is right. astro. But the oh, law at right. the time it was legal. For the yes. judge, to yes, no, but it's the illegal. There's no but, but, law but, but, in the Commonwealth that there's judge, no please, law please, in the judge, whole judge, Commonwealth. Stop, judge, 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 please, stop, judge, please, okay, judge, okay. judge. Okay. I don't think. Judge, hold on, judge, judge, judge. Watch this now. Yes, Emotet. What you see that 1898 Jury Act? Yeah, man. Yeah, we definitely need to look at it because, judge, this argument. Yeah, I, I honestly don't see you winning this one at all because no. that judge was the law. Was. It was judge the law, judge. judge. It's not my opinion. We cited the law at the time. All right, judge, judge, you cite. You cite. You cite. Hold on, give, give me a third, law please. Law said. You saw what the law lord said. Hold on, yes, but but the but, but court. They yeah, but said, judge, judge. Once you ascertain. That the jury was contaminated. This is what you should have done. Should, they should, not shall. Shall. Now. This is should, not shall. They didn't this, use shall, so that's key. Yeah, but um, so you know, I'm not clear on that. No, no, no. Yes, yes, yes. But but that's a recommendation, yeah. and not and not them. So, so imitate, the law. Imitate. One more ask you. More ask yeah. you something. More ask you something. So what about the law we protect? Vice cartel right to a fair to trial. a fair trial. I agree yes. with that. Hold on, I don't disagree with Astro. Hold on, no. Astro. what about the law? Astro, hold what on, about no. the privacy law? Yeah, so hold on, Astro. We don't phone? disagree, no. Hold on, no. What them, what them get the information off my phone illegally? No, what about Astro, that? hold on, no, man. Astro, don't throw in one bag of things same time. Make with us focus on the jury, yeah. no, man. Hold on, no, man. So, my response hold to on, real quick. See? Yeah, yeah, hold yeah. on. And then I'm um, Kenny there too. My, my point yeah, is Astro. Because, because everybody has said Astro. it. The, the on, Astro, man. Man. Mm -hmm. Yeah, man. No, no, no move too fast, man. We're there, man. What may I say is that? I agree with you that that jury thing is an issue. What we are saying is the law at the time Yes, but you said, me, you look at the same the law, the law, but what about the law where protect vice cartel, right? What yes, but, 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 but what about that law? Well, well, let, let me chime in right here. Astro, well, I know. That's the reason why it well, is well, a conversation now, you know. Because one, everyone is what? Has the right to a fair trial. And exactly. there's also a law in the jury act at the time that allowed it to happen. So I just saw that. Go, no, ah, but the man, all right. You see the law to a fair trial? That should have trump. No, the law, I, I, I that agree with that. The next law. I agree with so, that. So, I agree with that to a certain extent that it's two different laws, you know. They are not like interconnected like that. But at the end of the day, so, one of the the jury act and one of the with the right to a fair trial. Maybe I allow Lali Bella to say what I said. Then Kenny yeah, Marshall. Yeah, I can go to you after. 
Yeah, I'm going to be quick so the jury can speak. Uh, yeah, mm-hmm. yeah. So, so you, you're the thing about it, George. If you read the chart of the Privy Council, right, there isn't a categorical body of statutes that they adhere to. They adhere to the statute of the country where the kids came from. And, and, and you are making this, what, the argument that you made right into Trinidad is flawed because there are certain statutes in Trinidad that can choose statutes in Jamaica, right? And, and your thought experiment, let me say this real quick. We're talking about the flat tire. You're not factoring that some cars actually have run flat tires, right? So, have, you know what I mean? Having a punctured tire doesn't mean you have to stop if you have a run flat tire. You didn't factor that in. All right, let me, let me finish the argument for you. Gentlemen. Huh? Wait, no, wait, 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 the only way he can be tainted was if he was discharged. Exactly. No, right. No, so Imotet. I'm not saying Paul Paul Imotet. No, Imotet. Imotet. That is wrong, Imotet. You can't say that. Imotet, that's wrong, Imotet. No, hold on, no, hold on. Please. please. The lawyer hold on, man. I, 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 Kenya, talk. Hold on. What's this now? The lawyer does agree with Imotet. Hold on, man. The man them need to understand the law at the time, you know. The law at the time, you know. As long as that juror was not discharged, in the eyes of the law, he was not tainted. That's the reality. We can't go wrong. No, they're going to prison. Well, they're going to charge him right after the case. Hold on, hold on. 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 Wait. Hold well, on, no, man. We can't Guys, read the time, no, man. What's the problem? What yeah, man. We will get too noisy with the reasoning, no, man. Right. As we are saying, when I do all again, okay. I'm going to say something. Oh, hold on, Mr. Julia. There's an echo on your background, too. Okay. I don't know why. We just can yeah. finish. Yeah, make Kenny finish in point, and then we can circulate the mic. We need another race. So, the, everybody look at the issue. The way, uh, let, let, let me say, there's no law that support a tainted. Jura that says tainted Jura must stay there. No, true, true. The, the true. blunder was on the judge and the prosecutor's side, right? But what, what they did is like when they become aware now that they, 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 when the judge became aware that there's a tainted person sitting on the jury, right? <laughs> he overlooked it and just said, Okay, you know what? It's too late. I just, yes. So then pretend like, Okay. They're not, it's like you're, you're not charged until after. Then they found him guilty, even though they know he was guilty. So that's where they just uh, overlook it. All right. Can I respond to George now, like how his meme call out with this nonsense? Let me, go, let me go through. First thing, we're talking about law. We're talking about words that can be interpreted or have different sorts of interpretation, varying degrees of interpretation and perception. We're not talking about math problems. We're not talking about scientific reasoning. We're talking about people with their perception using words to discuss points and making arguments on the, on the words. So when it's here, you hear a word of tainted in law or you hear contaminated, those are not defined like says two plus two equals tainted. Right. The perception of tainted and your perception of tainted and this amount of perception of tainted is guided by some principles, but they may all be different perceptions. Right. You understand what I mean? Because it's law we're talking about. We're not talking about formulas that give you a direct, absolute position. That's why you always have two sides arguing a point in law. Because right. I'm black light. I'm black light. In, in this context, as long as that person wasn't discharged or convicted or charged, good. good. But they, they would have to discharge him first and then charge him after. That's All what right. they did, right? All as right. long as that person was not discharged. He's in the eyes technical. of the law, they are not tainted, and we exactly. can't dismiss that. Exactly. So I just want to point so that out to the judge who, who I'm making it look like, say, the, the law at the time, right, did not have him tainted when he commit the bribe. The right. law is saying is when the, the judge discharge him, that's when he's tainted. No, that's the problem with the law at the time. Well, you the I, I don't that. agree with it. Hold on, no, hold on, no. I don't agree with it. Let's be clear here because me no yeah, want to feel like say we, we agree with it. We are we are talking about it. 
being the law at the time, we can't overlook that. That's all I'm saying. So, um, all right. So, remember me just, George, sure, hold it up. Sure. Me, George, hold it up. Remember just allow Astro to make him points. And now we know nobody no over talk him, so he not over talk nobody. So, make your point, Astro, and then no, George. No, me just, me just want, I just, I just questions me want to ask, you know. Because I'm confused right now. I'm confused. Because everybody has talk about the law. Everybody has talk about this. You know which law you know, you know, I talk about you know, I talk about a jury act. Everybody has said the jury act because it, the judge not do nothing wrong because the jury act allow the judge to keep the man from the jury because it's not supposed to be less than eleven. But oh nobody not no me not hear nobody emphasize upon the man right to a fair child. There's a law we protect that, you know. Yeah, but Wait that's name. why he Tell went to the name. privy. But you're, that is what's the him. point, you know. Um, but Astro, you're that's the point, took him to the privy council. I think you're missing the point because yeah. you are arguing as if said, "Well, are we there? Are, are, we, are we not recognize that? What we're talking about a particular subject matter. Right. It's not as if we are for or against. We're talking about it as it is. That's just where we at. Right. Right. And we're talking about the the jury act at the time. So oh, no, when no, when no, Roy Smith is saying that. Did they, they judge, right? Did they, they judge um, okay. made made a, a, a quote unquote decision based on um whatever? It so, was so the law that afforded him to 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 keep that you, that true. Hold on, hold on, one second, one second. He's because. not considered tainted. That's Imotet. the problem with the law. I I see the problem. It's probably all your word it. I, I, that's why them y'all get the pushback. When because we have. We can't consider the guy tainted, even though we know it, don't consider. Once we put say he's tainted before the um he was charged, it will get messy, right? And that's where the human rights side come in. It was clearly violated, so it's just I just that's there's a little confusion. Never, never right push back again. Right. Hold on, oh, hold on, oh, 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 hold on, my turn, my turn, hold on, yeah, hold on, my because God wants that thing. Big up to Gong Beam, you know. Man, as I respect me, general. Um, so what is the I'm Kelly? Let me say this real quick. You see, you, you see, when when it comes on to what is there, you understand, in terms of um the, the jury act, all we are saying is when they were at the privy council, that was when the privy council saw the matter and said, But wait, no man, irrespective of the man, the judge keeping him or not. Once he committed the act or go against his oath of, of, of office as a juror, he is tainted. The Jamaican right. law right. at the time did not see it that way. The Jamaican law even afforded the judge the option to keep him. Under the Privy Council observation, the must say is what? Immediately, that man should have been gone. Wait the evil. So, so, so we, we right, do agree right. with that. Wait the judge. Wait the judge. Um, no, don't call him. No, 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 a good point you, you raised, um, Imotet. At the point that they knew that the ju um, the jury was tainted, they should have it. Because that is a specific right. instruction right. that the Privy Council said. The Privy Council said, the trial continue with the alleged corrupt jury serving as one of its 11 members. In the board view, that the Privy Council view, there should have been no question of allowing jury X to continue to serve on in the, the jury. board view, it's not allowing, a law. In the allowing board jury view, X, not a law. This is an instruction leader. Please let me finish. Allowing jury X to continue on the jury is fatal to the safety of the conviction which follows. Right, it and that's why it's on the privy council judge. Because guess what? The flawed Jamaican <laughs> law. Was in place to um, facilitate the judge's decision there. I so address that. In, so, um, it was it was an, an infringement of the appellant fundamental rights to exactly. a fair hearing under under exactly. under the Jamaica Constitution. Exactly. No, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Exactly. Hold on, on, judge. Hold on. Under, so there's no law that can be higher than the Jamaican Constitution. No, hold on, exactly. on judge. Under hold on. the Ask Jamaican please. Constitution. Hold on, hold on, guys. End my case. All right, hold on there. Let us not forget that um, <laughs> we don't disagree. You know, I, I think I think we're misunderstanding each other because at the end of the day, judge. 
our disagreement is where you are saying that what the judge did in keeping that juror was not legal. But it wasn't, Imotet. Hold on, Astro, please. Hold on. The law at the time did allow him to do it. So what, 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 how can but, we argue? All right, all right. So, all right, so, on, so, Astro, all right, so please. Astro, you'll get your time to speak, my general. So hold on, man. I am saying, can we agree that the law at the time did allow the judge to make that decision? But what about okay. the man constitution? Well, right? Lana, that's not the point, Astro. Yeah, well, Lana, man. That. well, Lana, that's not the agree. point, Astro, man. Stop conflating the thing, man. Just well, Lana, man. Because you ask a question where you make it look like, say, where they are disagreed where you are semi general. Just listen, man. No one is arguing about it. Say, well, what about his rights? We know, say, here we go now. The fact that um the, the court in England look at it, they are saying what? That juror was automatically tainted there and then. The Jamaican law never looked upon him there and then. No, as but you know, you hear the man say, under the Jamaican constitution. Yes, hold on, hold on. It hold was on, wrong. Right, hold on. The right to a fair trial. And I don't disagree, so let's not... Let's stop conflicting. All right, well, I'm not finished. Can I, can I say something when I'm done? Yeah, it got to so Miss Julia. This to end? All right, I don't know how we're still here. Will somebody background noise it. Uh, no, can you hear me? No, can you hear me? Winston. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 You can okay. have some device oh. on. Well, I'm Miss Julia. Yeah. Make sure you don't have the device on, Winston. Make sure you come out of YouTube. I only I use the stream yard because if you have both of them on same time, you will get an echo. Go to Miss Julia. All right, again. The options were, according to Jamaican law, either one, dismiss dismissal of the juror, right? Replace the juror, okay? Cautionary instructions, that's also an option. This is where the judge, right, issue cautionary statements and, and instructions to the rest of the jurors them that leave, right? Reminding them about their duty up to be to remain impartial and to only base their verdict solely on the evidence that's presented okay that cautionary instruction and then there's also the judge what he's what they are saying is through his assessment of prejudice which is also another term right the judge assessed the extent to which the tainted jurors actions influence the pre the, 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 the our prejudice the trial okay the, the judge went through his ad assessment of prejudice and said, you know what? No, I am not going to take option one to dismiss the to, to dismiss the, uh, the whole of them or replace one of them. The, the the next thing what he was supposed to do was to with with cautionary instructions. Now, what the privy council said was basically, if it was under their jurisdiction, they have the clear law that says that okay. If once you have found that this person has been tampered with, even before you call them tainted, before you dismiss them, once you found that he has been tampered with, then you need to have an investigation, right? Where the the, the, the judge or that investigation into the circumstances surrounding the the, the, the the tainting of the juror, right? And then gather evidence and then do and then interview the witnesses and then do all of that and then and then after that, them 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 will start it over. Since there was no clear cut thing in Jamaica where there was option one dismissal of the juror option two replacement of the whole jury or option three cautionary instructions what they're saying was if you are going to continue with the case the way you handled it for continuing with the case without you going to actually reprimand and actually talk to the rest of the jurors right we found that insufficient but he did choose one of the options which were legal in Jamaica, right, which was right. continuing with it, right? But he did not safeguard it. So it's basically like as if to say, all right, in Jamaica, you can leave a nine-year-old nine at home. But guess what? If you're going to leave a nine-year-old at home, nine-year-old at home, make sure you lock the grill. Make sure you lock the gate. Make sure you lock the bottom of the grill. Yeah, okay? I just, yeah, These right. are just safeguards. So if you're going to continue all, along this path, and not dismiss the juror or the or or the end or, or the jury or replace the jury, then these are safeguards that we expect you to take. And you didn't take that. So because of that, if there is a, if you guys still have a case, go and try him because there's still a case here. But because you didn't go through with this, we cannot say that his his rights were upheld. Right. And the reality is that um that law at the time was problematic and, and it is proven to be right. so. Um Winston, 
Yeah, unmute your mic and let me hear what you have I to say. I hope it's clear now, you know. I hope it's clear. Is it clear, Astro? Or it's, you still it's, disagree? It's still, it's, it's still disagree. All right. All right, hold on, Astro. Winston, unmute your mic. Got to yes, anyway. sir. Good night to the panel. Bless up, Winston. Have, don't have to go to prison. Yeah, yeah what, on, what, Astro, what I'm asking? Listen, Astro, just, Astro, just, Astro, just listen Astro. up. Just listen up. Question here. What I'm saying, what happened to the juror after the case? Them discharge him and charge him. So why did they charge him? Yeah, man, yeah, man, we know. We know the same thing going with something wrong. That's why so I if it was not tainted, why did they charge him? Right, right. I agree with that too. I agree with that with that. I agree with you. You know, you know, you know my whole feeling Nobody's about this case. With him, Nobody's Hold disagreeing on. with you. Right. What we are saying is that the law at the time is all right. Oh, really we are saying the law one. at the time. Did the law change? Yes, 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 Two things about this, what I'm gonna say, because I'm not gonna say long. One judge, please the judge, read the information. Listen, one, one, the judge was afraid of the DPP. And two, the judge was scared that if he did not hold the juror, then he would have left and they wouldn't have got to charge him. Well, That's well, all well, I'm general, well, Winston, you know, sir, <laughs> you know, sir, me not see them arguments they presented are argued. Right, so no, they don't, the but they are but not going to because it's on their side. No, Winston, Winston, yeah, but you are muddy up the waters now by two, you know. No, it's, it's, it's just the truth. No, Winston, well, on the man is a legal conversation we have, right? So we're talking about what was done and what is out there. We now say, Oh, me feel are my assertion, so make we just keep it in the context of what is out there. What we are speaking on is what is out there, what was said, and what was done. I think you are bringing your um you know perception of the situation and with, with, a, with my honest, perception you know? with a million other people no you know, but what well, i know a million other people saying it goes to in jamaica tomorrow no make it true so at the end right. of the day it's about the truth of, of the matter you know not, you know, not listen the, man not listen of opinion. Yeah. yeah and it's my opinion we all are scared Winston. of this lady called the dpp she don't grow hard and she don't grow tail and Winston. she's not above the law but we are Winston. making it out it's like it's like I I can't tell alone it's, it's the Astro, DPP. Please. The I'm DPP, the DPP is the one. Did you hear she said to National Radio that she have had problem with the jury contamination before and she had gone ahead with the case? What does that say to you? All right, Winston. hold on, Winston. All right, that says the law allow her to go forward with the case. Oh, no, she did not say. She said use her discretion. She did not say the law allow. The law allow her to use the her law. The law does not. She did not say. do something wrong. The law does oh, not. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. She said she used her discretion. She said she used her discretion. Discretion should not be in a court in a case in a court of law. Winston, hold on, hold on. Judge, if you hear Winston attack, you know, just make Winston finish. And Winston, if you hear judge attack or anybody's attack, just make them finish them point, please. So we don't up the reasoning. So um winston you finish up yeah. because george want to respond and then astro More no, all right what i'm saying I'm, I'm not gonna say for too long why are we making this case so like it's it's just about vibes cartel what about where the dpr can't can that be used against her in the court of law she because she's a dp plant well, hmm? I'm, I'm just asking that know. she you know, openly so admitted on nationwide really that there was one case one before and right, she so go on ahead and you get this question. All right, hold on, Winston. All right, so go to Lalibella and make Lalibella respond to that day because at the end of the day, I'm not sure if you if you catch the life from the get go because we walk. Yes, I was here. Good. So you are saying that um why. Is everyone afraid of the DPP and what should be done? We're talking about what? The, the, the whole deliberations and the reality is that um, the Court of Appeal right now is listening to arguments from both sides. So I write the them in general. I don't think it's the DPP and trial because remember the DPP represent the state. So I decided the Crown versus... Um, yes. So and why did they send the case back? And what ground did they send back the case to Jamaica? 
the, court the, of appeal. It, it, it was the right to a fair trial. It, the, the juror, they should have, um, yeah, got rid of that juror at the moment. Yes. Him and, they, and, what, and what was her explanation? They have gone 60 odd days and it would be whatever. No, so but she was not considered. She was not considering by Scott a legal right. She was considering her rights or whatever no, you can I understand call it. that, Winston, and I don't disagree with you on that one, all right? Because um, I should not have said that either. All right, but let me allow Lalibella to say what he must say. Go to Lalibella. Yeah, man, and Winston, again, seeing. There aren't any statutes in Jamaica that preclude the judge from... from, from, from Your mic is a bit low. Your mic is a bit low. Yeah, it's still low? Yeah, I can't hear much better now. Yeah, there, there aren't any laws that prevent the judge from acting in the manner that he has. But you want me to understand still, seeing? Just like how you understand the, 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 the principle that a person is innocent until proven guilty, wherein you may assume that they're guilty, you know? You may have what you think are preponderance of evidence that that person is guilty, but that person isn't determined guilty until after the adjudication process. It's the same way when it comes to that tainted juror, right? Mm -hmm. you, you might be able to view that the person is tainted. However, that burden isn't met until, post -adjud until, adjud until the adjudication process is complete. Right. So I just want to say a thing really quick there. Um, Subi, you only asked when it was amended. Um, I stand, you know, someone can remind me, you think it was 2015, and I can give you even one amendment. Seven jurors can can be a quorum to um try someone now. Before that, you couldn't yeah. have seven. Okay, but what about if you start with 12? No, hold on, no, I understand. I don't agree with Tena Winston. I don't disagree with Tena Winston. I'm just... Okay. So we ask the question, when was the act amended? Yeah. I'm I, I did, I did, I did. 20, 2015... 2015 there and about, I think, and it does allow now seven jurors to, um you know, deal with a, 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 a trial and things like that. So ones and ones can check that out still. Um, okay, so, right. so, be a, so be a son. Hold on. Winston. Right. Okay. George, may I have to make? Yes, sir. Winston, we have a nine hour day, I'm a general. Hold on there. Um, okay. You, George? Um, all right. So, we can just um, leave this and, we, and because I think we we're going to a direction where we're not supposed to be going in terms of if we are thinking logically. The Constitution is the highest law of Jamaica. So there is no jury law or any other law that's supposed to proceed the Constitution. True. Okay. The discretion that the judge have, in other words, then, the difference between our jury act and maybe other jury act is was that we had to use between 12, no less than 11. So the judge can dismiss and have 11 and 12. It has since now reduced to seven. So those are the only difference concerning the jury act. In terms of the performance of the jury and a tainted jury, whether you're in Jamaica, whether you're in England, whether you're in Trinidad, they are saying that once a tainted jury, this is across the board. This is the blackboard. This is the blueprint. I can't change this. Once a tainted jury is established, you have to throw that out and come. So our judge only have discussion as to discussion as to the number of jury, 7, 12, no 7. In can't have no discretion when it come to a tainted jury. When it come to a tainted jury, he has to follow the procedure that are followed in all the Yeah, but, yeah, but as um, Kenny saying a judge, as Kenny saying a judge, that judge. word tainted, right? And as me are saying, um, that's why that's why it is it is problematic, and that's why even sometimes there's misunderstanding between us. We are all in agreement to say that it no look good. <laughs> wherever way you put it but what we are also saying that at that time that law allows the judge to do that and that not look good that's all we're saying so i think the word tainted is putting the the, the cart um in front of the arse door because legally at the time according to the jamaica law he was not tainted that's why he was allowed to even cast him vote so what me say is that he should have been removed i agree with that but they allowed him based on the law, the provisions of the law. That's all we are saying. 
And I think that's where the misunderstanding right. is coming from. Exactly. George, when was the burden legally? Um, James Bond, it's on low. James, talk, James talk Bond. Order. No, it's not James Bond. I mean, I mean, Lali Bella. So. Oh, no. oh, go to Lali Bella. No, yeah, I want George to answer to when when was the legal bird of Tainted Jura met? That's an excellent question, Lali. June, June summarization. When it was met? Yes, yeah. legally. When it was brought to the attention of the judge, at the point when it was brought to the attention of the judge. That's not that, true. Was when it, it, that was when it was established. In other words, eh, that was when some evidence of contamination was brought forward. He did not dig deeper to find out how far the contamination went. But at the point that it was brought to him, he should have established that. Yeah, but George, Lalibella asking, when was the criteria of the tainted jura met? Me heard Kenny Marshall say a thing and you know, I think I might have a different opinion. You get well, me? I said, that's the question. We don't understand you know. that question. When no, all right. Well, all right. So let me respond to it then. The, the criteria of a tainted jury I met Lali Bella, and you guys can push back at me, was the moment um he was discharged. Right? When he, when he was discharged, that is when um he became tainted because guess what? That's the time when they arrest him right after. They never arrest him before him um do him 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 boating or whatever. Or no time before that, even when they knew. And that's why again I agree everything does look muddy. But the moment he became tainted in the eyes of the law, according to the jury act, was when he was discharged. So Bro, that had the problem with the law. Hold on, Imotep. I me understood what I say, but me disagree. Yes, because the yes. judge knew of the tainting when doing his summarization, right? So the judge shouldn't turn a blind eye to it. No, right I, I, I agree right with you. On, I agree with you. Yeah. So where the so right there, you should just say, okay, dismiss this guy. You can't have the police outside of the, the jury room. Right. And I, I agree with you. But, yeah, but, but I'm but, Kenny. But, I'm Kenny. Isn't it the case where prior prior to him being Prior to him being um, discharged, there's somebody background. Prior to him being discharged, he was quote unquote in the eyes of the law according to the jury act, clean as a whistle. Mirang are me right? Quote unquote. Right. Yeah, no, so, you know, in the eyes of the law. In the eyes of the law. But you know, no, I say Kenny, quote unquote. We talk about the jury Kenny. act at the time. But, and and Kenny don't he was clean it. as a whistle until discharge, and, and I think that is where the disconnect is. Yeah, yeah. And Kenny, the, hold on the, there. The you said turn. Well, hold on there, Kenny. Kenny, you said turn a blind eye, you know, which a lot of people can say that maybe that's what he did. But at the same time, it's still his assessment of prejudice, which he had the right to do. So right, this is where the judge assessed the the the, the extent to which the tainted jurors' action or the supposedly tainted jurors' actions influenced or may have influenced or prejudiced the trial right so in I his think, um, assessment Kenny, um, of prejudice I think, uh, Kenny your, your device a feedback yeah kind of in his in his assessment of prejudice which was his right to do or her right to do right his right to do right he found that you know what this does not this does not hurt the case in, in, in yay or nay let's just continue with it that that was his assessment of prejudice which is his right to do right so what there so 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 he was not tainted until he was actually dismissed. No, discharge. after that, no, after that, after they must discharge. No, then then we have the content procedure and that the, they already had that the content procedure. Right, and see. it's just it's just the legal right? aspect so of it. Just a, it's just a name, right? Because really and truly, that can't look right from right. the moment him offer a bribe, him to leave. Once the judge find out, him to leave. We agree mm. with that. Remember them, them, remember them, a woman from tape, you know. No, well, and I don't want us to be disconnected. Um, you know, as if you say we don't agree with that. But what we are saying is right. that um, the, the law did allow the judge to keep him on. Um, go to exactly. Astro. Let me hear what I say, and then Q Meds can say a thing. James Bond, don't say a word in general. We, we yeah, don't say you next to a judge mm -hmm. and Paul Alwin. Two of them, the judge should not get 30 years, Paul Alwin get the 20. <laughs> Because they, because oh. them them value the them value the form and them right to a fair trial. Oh, uno continue and say it just not do nothing wrong. It's like uno had disregard the constitution. Well, on no, Astro, no, Astro, 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 Astro. You sound like yeah, talk for 
appeal to emotions, me no, 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 man, I just well don't on, man. Well on, no, trust me. Well on, but but you make it a sound like say we disagree mm. with what you say. So yeah. let us not, let us reason. No, but me hear me hear no can't. Well on, no man. What me mm. say? We agree on the fact that everything looks shady. But we don't want your reason, like say the whole of we disagree. We agree, so make a reason. Yes, no, but you know, you know, continue as me. I feel push back at you, no, can you say? Push back at what? 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 The privy council rule and say the judge wrong. Where we are say is that everything looks shaky with the juror. Once him deal with the bribe, yes, automatically him forget cut off the so. We not disagree. So me don't know where you gonna push back with. Remember, make a point, make it's, a point, it's not man. just it's not just one thing in the wrong. Do you know? I'm more than one thing in judge the wrong. Not the wrong. Just make a point, man. You not even push back, man. We agree, man. We just that's the remember reason. Him allow, like remember him allow. Remember him allow. Him allow the phone the the the, the phone evidence. You know where I'm sure do you know. That if the privy council man them said that you know, so that was against the man, right? The privy the council man, man right them about the phone, Astro. Yes, yes. Um, well on, judge. Yes, Timothy. Yes. Um, no, no. They only said that um the appeal um the the appeal about the evidence that were, they submitted, it must be considered. That means that uh, the court of appeal must look at it. That is all they said about it. Right. They never said well, yes, right now it's wrong. But they said that it, it yes, worked. Yes, them it. did say the way all them obtained the information. No, they never the go into the details. Astro, no, never no, Astro, details. Astro, no. They no, never go into details, Astro. No. No, Astro. Astro, <laughs> Astro you, 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 you have to go double check about that. that Astro, that, that, you have to things, my G. Well, no, I'm not sure. I don't know if you're listening, but good. No, well, I'm an astro man, astro. Well, yeah, I'm a general. I'm saying astro, they need to look at it, but they never go into details and say right. anything right. outside of that. They made no mention of it like that in, in their summation. So, I don't remember when the man was talking about the charter. But, but the phone thing. Know, we, we are talking about the summation by the Privy Council. You are talking about the the, 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 the the arguments being presented. This is the way we are um disconnecting. So you are misunderstand what we are talking about. We are talking about what the privy council them say. You are talking about when the man them are present the arguments. Ugh. So that is where the disconnect is. So make with us kind of just listen, not to respond, but to really understand each other. So we don't have to disconnect. No, uh, I'm, I'm, I'm listening. May I listen clearly? I mean, no, but what I'm saying is that the privy, council, the privy council in their summation did not mention nothing about the phone evidence. You are saying it was mentioned at the privy council when the arguments were being presented. We all going to agree with that. So we will not going to disagree with what you say. But what we are saying is that the privy council in their ruling did not mention about the cell phone thing. That's all George is saying, mm -hmm. and that's all we're saying. Yes, they didn't make a ruling on that specifically, but they did say, they did make it clear, say, the way all them get, obtained the information from the man's phone was against the man's right. So, so you're they saying that, say that the Privy Council, well, I know, so you're saying that the Privy Council in their ruling said that? Of course. No, they never said uh, no, that. No, Astro, I'm sorry. Astro, they what's this Astro, Astro, man? We can't Astro, just Astro, talk Astro, because Astro. of how we feel it, brother. That, yeah, we're not going to do that, brother, they man. Just, that. All right, just, all right. So the people come to the mention Astro, not about the phone. Him, him never, no. They never mention not about how the police them get the information from the man. Astro, Astro, from the Astro, digital no. place. No, no, Astro. What they said? Jad Smith, what are you Jad Smith, Jad Smith, we're not going to try to split ears and all, you know. Astro, go check out the thing, me general, before... Me feel say engaging at the argument so strongly because mm. at the end of the day, yeah, man, you have to be speaking from an informed position. No. Nothing wrong if you want to put forward your argument, you know, but to push back at us who no, are talking about the facts of the me. argument, no, me I don't think facts. that is the right thing to me do. May I ask you something? Yeah, no, no, if no, people no, come to judge them. Not like that was meant, at all. No, dear. A matter of fact, a matter of not like that. No, let's not ask you. Hold on, man. Ask you. Ask you. Astro, Astro go watch back the something in general, listen, and then we, we can have a, a reason. Fact, the, the Astro, that, they didn't guess what they, they, they didn't still have like, still a pushback, brother. 
Listen, no Astro, reason. the reason why they didn't even mention that stuff about the phone is because they didn't have to, because they found that his rights were definitely, definitely not, 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 so not, 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 not upheld. So, so, so I'm here hear things in my mind then. No, listen now. So I'm here, I'm here, I'm here. Astro, you're not listening, man. You just are nice. Okay. Listen now. So all I'm saying is, right, mm -hmm. they found that it's so egregious that you allowed this tainted juror to continue, right? That this is enough for us to send it back to you. And and to and to basically say if we don't if we can retrial and retrial if if we're not going to make him want to make him want that was enough so they didn't even have to look at anything else that is what and they actually said it they said that this yeah. is enough we're going to consider the other things yeah right, let me tell him Ju um, yeah. Julie let me just yeah. tell him the, what yeah. they said is this um, Astro in yeah. view of its conclusion on the issues of jury misconduct the yes. board the board's holds that this that it is not necessary there you go express a concluded view on the other two grounds of a there plea. you go the other two grounds the, what is what yeah yeah, yeah, yeah but they didn't even look this at one it is so what is what what right. is what what are the other two Astro, grounds they never look at it though astro the phone, they 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 have to, no, the yeah, phone no. yeah the remember the phone, question the phone, astro exactly so yes, remember the question no. remember the question astro but don't don't be disconnected from the reasoning though what we are saying is that the privy county in their summation made no reference of the right. cell phone. You are adamant that they did. What George is reading is that they are focusing on the tainted juror. They made no reference about right. um, the phone. So we are talking about what the privy council said in their ruling. You are talking about when the man them are present their arguments. Right. Yes, Imote. Me understand, you know. Me understand when they say, me understand what the man they mean. Me understand what they Yeah, yeah. The they make a ruling based off a, a jury situation alone. Right, right. Based off that alone, they make them ruling. Right. But that not mean say two other issues not did it. But they no, never but, look at but it. But that's they not the argument though, Astro. You are arguing that the phone was mentioned by the privy council right. in their deliberation. It's a different argument you are bring different, forward. Different no, total so, thing. Yeah, so you can't move the goalpost now. Um Q meds. Unmute my account, let me hear what you have said to the comments. Can you do your way to? Yeah, man, we did uh, what I listened to from earlier. Big up, big up. Yeah, man, may I say, um, from what we're all summarizing all of this, like, what we summarize, like, this platform and everything, and the topics that we have about this, about this dance artist because of the conviction. What we all summarize, and we all agree, which I'm a tip would say, that we now push back or disagree that everything went wrong, you know. In the protocols or the judge or the DPP follow, then won't we agree that there's a track record that there's an unprofessionality with the DPP and our department? Won't we agree on that then? Because that's what it all summarized to you know the DPP and our department, the DPP and our department. Because don't you remember if a Kentucky kid, remember what Kentucky kid people are saying exposing cartel and can this use back against the DPP showing that our department have a track record of unprofessionality, of playing dirty, of abusing, of power, that, that, that can be used against her too and her department in this whole matter? Because there ain't nobody talking about these things neither, you know what I mean? Like old Kentucky kid, you know, there was all these things, surveillance, videos, everything, and what happened to Kentucky kid? She, she, she completely ignored all of that evidence, you know what I mean? So that's why I'm glad for them platform when we hear everybody a reason because out of everything we pick all of the sense out of nonsense and we just get everything and we just research and there is a clear track record of unprofessionality and playing dirty with the DPP and our department. That's all I have to say, you know? Mm. Big up. Well, big up, big up. Well, in that case, the, the, listen, it, anybody, they're free to, to, to bring any kind of civil suit against the DPP. But the thing is this, the prosecution, the prosecutors, as well as the, the, the director of public prosecution, DPP, right? They have certain immunities, let's call it, certain immunities, okay? And protections from civil lawsuits, right? But this is what, this is how you can, this is what, this is, this is what would be a good term to, 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 to file a lawsuit against her or her, or her department, basically. If they, if they can find malicious prosecution, right? 
if that if a person believed that they were either prosecuted without any kind of reasonable cause right or if there was any prosecutorial misconduct right like yeah. basically like withholding evidence or presenting false evidence or making any kind of inflammatory statements to the jury right if there's any yeah. violation of rights which is what cartel lawyer basically brought up right right so basically basically so basically saying like the right to a fair trial or any kind of protection against any kind of un unlawful like seizure or even search of of your person or your or, or your property right that 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 could be brought as a, as a civil lawsuit and also negligence right so there are certain things that people can bring a lawsuit a civil lawsuit but it can be very very complex and it can be very challenging but it's not impossible you understand because of the fact that there's a lot of legal immunities don't ask me why I know these things, but there's a lot of legal immunities that are afforded to prosecutors, especially the DPP. Right, yeah, yeah, definitely, because right. DPP I re represent the Crown. So there you go. it's not our personal capacity. So right. at the end of right. the day, um, you should definitely have that. Um, right. UTG, yeah, unmute your mic. Your background is so nice, it's hard to mute you for a second. Um, unmute your mic, UTG, and let me, me hear where I said it. Yeah, man, blessings, blessings. Blessings, Yeah, man, bless up. Yeah, but, man, this is Mr. Vegas, man, man. I think, man, I give you Mr. Vegas the number boss. Mm. Yeah, man, because what Mr. Vegas really was saying that he is, or he did 13 years in prison on a conviction that was from an impartial jury. And a juror was on the jury who was contaminated and he, you know, his constitutional mm. rights were violated, so. You know, I agree. He did 13 years from that impartial conviction, you know what I mean? Secondly, the telecommunication evidence was also mentioned that they breached his constitutional rights to gather the evidence when they went to digital without a warrant or did it the accurate or correct way to gather the information, you know what I mean? So his rights were also breached there. And if it goes to the retrial, then the defense would have the expert who went to the Jamaica and you know examine the phone to confirm that there was tampering with the phone. You know what I mean? So I don't know. Oh. Crazy. Right. Um. What? Well, well, who was it? James Bond. Yeah, I, I mean, like, I don't have much, not much respect. We're, yeah. we're, we're, we're spinning wheels we're here. We're spinning with the thing. We're, we're going we're, over. We're, over. We're, 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 right. we're, we're spinning wheels here because. Right. Even with Mr. Vegas' argument, it was in, in the laws of Jamaica, and that is why the, 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 um, the appeal courts of Jamaica also upheld the, the, the local court ruling as well. Because right. in the laws of Jamaica, everything was followed through procedure and they did nothing wrong. Right. Right. The council looked at it now and said, boy, you know, say, based on what is happening here in the UK or wherever, whatever they, they draw, the, draw the judgment on. We don't think, we the Privy Council don't think that would allow this man a, a fair trial. So right. you know what? Oh no, decide if no one do it over again. Because there you they go. could have also said, all right, that's where the case here. It's just like in it's just like in America. Facts. When the state charges for a crime or the state have a case against you, sometimes the case can't prove it enough because of the laws of the case. You know what the case, you know what the state do? Turns mm -hmm. over to the feds. Yes. That's because right. the federal has different guidelines and different laws to use and charge you under. So the, the feds might pick, the, the state might pick up on a case and say, we can't charge him or we don't have enough evidence or we don't have enough laws in our in our toolbox. We have enough tools in our box to charge him. So you know what we do? Turn it over the feds because the feds are more lean and they have a wider variety and can also charge you for certain that we can't charge you from. It's the same thing. It's the so same I mean, thing. Like, we're just spinning wheels here. Yeah, that's what I feel like. But you said everything what I was saying so simply. No, Perfect. what's in wrong? In dead wrong. Then All right, so what? so let me hear Astro if he said it. Go to Astro, can you know anything? In, in dead wrong, in continue. Wrong, in, wrong about no, that. because him, him, him say the same thing again. In continue, I say them him, the judge and uh, uh, the prosecutor, them they do not wrong. There was within there, there was within the law. That's wrong. That's so wrong. All right, James Bond. You see the reason why we really have to I, I really have to iron this out though. <laughs> no, well, it, it needs to be ironed wrong. out, you know. No, but they were they but, uh, but, 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 yes, right. Astro right when he said that. Astro, hold on. Astro right when he said that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah, y
You hold know on, why no, Astro George. is right? George, hold on. James Bond and Astro are going to iron this out. So, yes, please. So Astro said it's wrong. All right? So, and him present him argument. So allow James Bond to respond and then Astro have a thing to say and then no. George can chime in. No, more ask James Bond something. James Bond. So, yeah, yeah I said them. Wait, I lose. We lose in, Astro. In Bond? Is it my phone? You break up Astro. Astro, what you right, saying? Let me say this real quick. Yeah, go to George. Quick, quick. The mere fact that the constitutional right was breached, that means the people who breached that right are in error and they were wrong. Yes, yeah. but guess what going now? As, as James Bond saying, a judge, and we can't move it from where James Bond have it, you know, because I we have most of us. Hold on, there's somebody device. Um, well, on the Astro, yeah, you, you, you echo. Yeah, just, just check your own Astro. Probably check out and check back in or something. Right, so George, remember, you know, until the Privy Council ruling, right, quote unquote, in the eyes of the law, according to the rulings, right, no infringement was committed. You get what me I say? Remember, say his lawyers were uh, definitely fighting for that, you know, but I'm talking in the eyes of the law at the time, right? The appeals court did not see that. Remember, because remember, say the defense put that to the appeals court, you know. You understand right. me? I say, but I what the appeals court did do, the appeals court did give, gave them the, the room for, for, for them to say, um, go to the privy council. The appeals court correct. never try to black nothing like that or whatever. So, exactly. Um, so, 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 the, so, so the appeals court probably look at it just how we look at it and say, no, so boy, this look muddy, you know. Make us what the, the, the um, yeah, 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 because they did make a recommendation right. of you, that. You, you, can, right. you, can't exactly. have, you can't tell me you have three of the Jamaica's finest judge sitting down on a panel. And a law was break, and them and them said, Well, law was broken, but let's uphold it. That's not true. No right. law was but broken. In hindsight, it is true. But in hindsight, it is true. No, uh, but Bond. hold on. But George, George. James Bond. No, no, yeah. it is law because the privy county rule against it. And guess what go on now? Let's right. not take away the fact that if the privy council was in Jamaica, right, as Jamaicans ruling under Jamaican law. They would have sided with the previous courts. The only reason why they, they, they ruled against they, they was because attend. British law. Well, you know? sided with them. Well, well, you know, different. Judge, yeah, hold on. Different. Yeah, but Judge, we all agree that it not look good. The optics not look good. It can't look good. Right after you discharge the man and lock him up on him something there. From him coming, the, the act, right? Yeah, him tainted. What we're saying is, under British law, the moment the person commit the bribe, Yes, they are tainted. Jamaican law. Oh, um, we, oh, we have eleven. We cannot have ten, so we can. We have that option to continue. Okay, cool. Let us go with that option. That was an option, and we can't dismiss it. Right. We're not saying it I was the right thing, but it was an option. That's exactly. all we're saying. But in the law, right. it was right. In, in the law, it was right. What I don't want right. you to do is to imitate. Yes. What I don't want you to do is to separate the courts in terms of jamaican law and english law but you have because, to because because the context there's just one court not really but you know so why you know why no, I judge if that the case where, where there are one thing you could have gone straight to the privy council and filed an appeal by yourself that is why you have to get a lawyer no that is not how the court structure work all right but the privy is the the court. Court. Let's stay upon the reasoning yeah the privy council is the highest court and there's step to it so therefore what we are saying we can't look I at it court as a appeal. Yeah, it's just your bigger brother. And you have to refer to your bigger brother when you run into problems that you can't solve. But you can't say, and I will mother child. I will mother child and I will father child at the same. Yes, but what same. is now? What is now, George? Yes, we can agree that um, there's some degree of interconnectedness, interrelatedness with the Jamaican justice system and the Privy Council. But they are not one and the same. Yes, you get what I say? So what is now? At the hearing, they were asking for what? For for precedence, right? They were asking for the, the case laws or whatever, where it has occurred before. Jamaica, remember, you know, no one presented anything. I remember a, a couple of weeks after, a week after, PGA um, forward out and said, yes, 
when them did represent Michael Manley against the Gleaner, that occurred. No one even represented that. The man them even asked if nobody never remember that. So the, the point said, is, I'm sorry, George. But, uh, when, you must uh, just one point here. Stick up in. When there's a precedent set, you know, you know where that precedent is used. It is used in Jamaica. It is used in Trinidad. It is used in the UK. That is what I want to tell you. So it's just what in a different thing. I just one thing. Once a precedent is set, it is available to all the people who use the court in the Commonwealth. We are one. Well, well, as me say, you know, the, the, the British laws, yeah, British laws are different in, in, in many aspects as well. And we can give instances, even the whole um capital punishment thing, right? A British laws, them use, remember the man them did sue and go privy council, right? And they use British laws. So at the end of the day, um, you know, it's not to say it's one and the same. You get what I say? I'm not going to say one and the same, but at the end of the day still, the Privy Council looked at it and in their eyes, even in British laws, in American laws, European laws, whatever, that's a TNT jura. But unfortunately, in the Jamaican law code, the, the judge could have kept that person. So again, no, it just looked bad upon the law because the law is antiquated. That's just the reality as well. You get what I say? Um, true, I, true. Yeah, yeah. So um, let me just allow the reviewer to say a quick thing, then, then we can circulate the mic. Yeah, the, re the reviewer. Yeah, go through. Let me hear what you have to say now. All right. Me, me not hear nothing from the reviewer. All right. Let me just hear the last. Um, um, let me hear the last words on a topic here. Because I'm, I, I'm here. I'm uh, here. Oh, you are here. All right, hold on the reviewer. All right, so after the reviewer, um, say what you must say. Yeah, ma'am, I definitely want to talk about this um this matter here with the bank executive, right? Yeah, yeah, well, a 85 million worth of the white lady and them something there. So oh, I know how she, she get off scotch free and them something there. So we can talk about it. But go through the reviewer. The um, reviewer. Yeah, go through. Yes. Um. Um. Does the panel agree that um the Supreme Court um the Privy Council in effect overruled Jamaican law? Um. Anyone want to respond to that? Um. Sure. Yes. Yeah. Got you. Last point. You want to form a cut because we'll push go work shortly. All right. So. Oh. Uh, um. Yeah. You hear me? Yeah, yeah, hold on there, hold on there, yes. um, reviewer. Because I'm saying Mark Cox still, so at least I can ask back our next question. Yeah, man, so I said, Isaac Buchanan and the defense, they achieve what they set out for at the Privy Council, you know what I mean? Because even if you listen to Isaac Buchanan, mm -hmm. you know, last mm -hmm. few words, his words to the judges were, you know, ask for the conviction to be quashed or ought to be quashed. <laughs> And I trust their wisdom on that. And they got what they wanted. And then they remit the case to the Court of Appeal in Jamaica to determine if they want to order a retrial or not. But based on how complex this case is, I think a retrial is going to be pretty complex. You know what I mean? Can but, I ask you guys a question? Yeah. Yes. Not sure. I, I uh, segue, sir. Um. Yeah, hold on. I allow Lalibella to, to make his point. Go to Lalibella. Say you want to say Yeah, yeah. Can I step over for a split? So, uh, quick question. I'm, I'm not sure if you guys touch on this. Can I step over for a split second? Do you guys think that if the appellate court deemed that a retrial is merited and granted, do you guys think that Cartel will keep Isaac as his lead attorney or will he restructure his legal team? Think you will keep him and use others. Mm. No, you um you mean as, as the lead Lali Bella? Yeah. That's like a question, think... right? Okay, so, yeah. so you're asking if you think Carter will keep him as the lead. Uh hold well, on, whose background is that? Um no, uh, not mine. Let me see. Yeah, so, one second there. Um yeah, yeah, yeah. So maybe let's allow everyone to respond, no? Yeah, so let, 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 let me profess why I asked the question. I spoke with someone, yeah. right? And they they posited that it might make more sense for Carter to work with someone like the, 
Princess of Ours, right? Where based on his position in Jamaica, as far as you know, what I mean, his legal relationships and other relationships, where it might bode well, it might Cartel probably will get more mileage using him versus Isat on the local scene. Well, well, truth be told, you know, right now this is an hypothetical argument. You get what of I mean? Course. I say? No doubt. So we, we have to just wait and see how that play out. And then now, you know, whichever way, if it play out when them say retrial, then I think that argument would be, you know, very valid in, in this discussion. But right now, it's more of a wait and see approach. So, you know, it's more like cross the bridge there when they get to it, you know? Yeah, man, definitely. Um, Miss Duda, you, know, yes, you guys want to say here. anything in closing? Because um, I um, current, no, no, I think we'll beat that first dead already. So it's all right. I'll, I'll listen to you guys. Yeah. Uh, um, 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 uh, um, um, did you guys answer my question as to regards if the Privy Council overruled Jamaica's local laws in yes, in in, in their in its answer. ruling? UTDG did answer and said that um yes they did um La Libella Miss Julia do you guys agree and, with that? And, well, the conviction didn't stand, so I mean right, right. right. So yes, they, right. they, they, I agree so, with that. So yes, yes, we all agree. And, 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 and as a people, are we okay with foreigners making our laws and overruling our laws, our local laws? So hold on. Are foreigners making our laws? Listen, the Privy Council, right? They're not considered. No, 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 can you guys if, hear if, me? If, 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 if the Privy me? Council overrule our law, their ruling is no law. Yeah, yeah I'm, I'm here, Miss Julia. But, but, um, hold on, the but, reviewer. But Let Miss Julia not, respond, please. Yeah, they're not okay. The privy call. <clears throat> oh, Miss Julia got kicked off. Miss Julia, I think it kicked you off, you know. So, um, yeah, Bella, you are responding. Yeah, um, uh, uh, so you see what I hear this argument, right? When I hear this argument, as it relates to far a foreign reference, um being in a position to inform our laws and make certain determination within within the framework of Jamaica's judicial uh there isn't a logical independence between the Privy Council and the local reference that in Jamaica. Logically they are one unit. So to to, to argue that it is um foreign... um go ahead sir um, um, logically, it is foreign. Um, the, 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 uh, um, the, the privy council is not in Kingston. It's in London. The, the, so, so, um, so, so it's it's not on our mean? soil. So, so, yeah. so, there, so <laughs> that, that mean our people... Uh, that that, that means okay. mean foreigners who are not our people can rule over us and make law that we have to obey. No, and, no, and, no, and I am personally not, not Can you hear me comfortable now? with that. I got cut off. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry, yeah, Miss Julia, we hear you now. So, 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 so real quick, so oh, okay. real quick, brother. L okay, listen, you. listen. Um, again, logically, as we see the current framework as it's currently constituted, the Privy Council is not, for all intents and purposes, independent of the Jamaican judicial. It's right. it's, it's it's a function of the, it's within it's a part of the Jamaican judicial. It's you, a, you have be, to. Sorry, sorry, sorry. sorry little bit. You might not be okay with it, but you cannot conflict prescriptive and descriptive. If you have a problem with it, you you you, you can then within within your capacity as an individual or the collective agitate f for a change and chance that you're successful. But you've got to acknowledge what is versus what you want. And not only that, but you have to look at the the, the privy council and its functions. Um, um right? what it is. Was, can is you, that no, 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 the Privy listen. Council Hello. is in London. Hello, can um, you hear me? They oh, are not our people. Me not Kim can, me not they they are me. like eight... They, 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 yeah. Hello, yeah. can you hear me? Yeah, hold on, reviewer. Um, yeah, we have to allow... Uh, um, um, especially, reviewer, can you, can especially you hear? when there is one female on the platform, we really can't overtalk her. So, yeah, can allow you, her to make her point and then you can respond. Can you hear, so could you hear me a while ago when I was talking? Yeah. One name reviewer. Yeah, yeah that's the so. okay. That's you the still there? Okay, yeah. So listen. So um, yes, what I'm trying to say to you is, 
you have to look at the Privy yes. Council and what is due to Zara and you have to look at the way how you look at the Privy Council because look at it, okay? It's the Privy Council basically is like they they put themselves as like guard guardrails, right? So they are the highest court of appeal for not all, but some Commonwealth countries and territories, right? Including Jamaica. So they are the highest court of appeal. So they are there to actually support, they're supposed, their function is supposed to be there to basically help and to basically hear appeals from the lower courts, whatever is going on in Jamaica, right? Or whatever is going on within the rest of the Commonwealth countries and the other Commonwealth um, territories, right? All of the cases, right? Them review legal decisions to make sure so basically it's kind of like a big brother then so basically like say okay we're going to try to sort this out we can't sort it out amongst ourselves because the law is not clear or maybe they're antiquated or maybe something is looked over you want to make sure that your rights being held we have to go to the big brother who is more objective so basically their their function is supposed to to, to and it worked clearly right because they review legal decisions made by the lower courts which is considered the ones here in jamaica right to ensure that they were made basically in accordance with the law right and basically in accordance to what no uh, 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 um, um, i right I, I so they are not no 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 so I, disagree, I disagree i no, disagree when, when you no, said listen, listen 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 you can disagree all you want these are facts you can't disagree with the, the facts is either is or is or either not right regardless of how we feel you these, these you, people, you are putting no, no, no. you are putting no, no, no. the jamaican you people stop. listen you are putting the jamaican yeah. people in a i am not no 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 you just people. said you just said the privy council is listen. more objective than the, 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 the jamaicans if you would listen and, 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 if and, you would listen if you, you ask the question Please, we I cannot, can we cannot reason like this. When, when we over talk, all I'm Miss Julia, one second, may I give back the mic? Yeah. Reviewer, allow Miss Julia to finish her point and you will be allowed to speak, all right? Let's not over talk each other. So okay. go to Miss Julia. So listen, so it's it's just because of how you are viewing the Privy Council, okay? They are the, again, they, we are in the Commonwealth, okay? They are the highest court of appeal, right? for some commonwealth countries and territories, which Jamaica is included of that, okay? Now, what are their functions? They hear appeals, right, from the lower courts, okay? So basically, it's not like as if we go on with self and everything is, 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 is in a vacuum in Jamaica. No, there's a safeguard here to basically say, to make sure, say, okay, if things need to be, again, appealed, or there are certain, they need to review legal decisions, or sometimes it's, sometimes it's just interpreting the law. Sometimes they have to interpret the law, or sometimes they uphold the rule of law, like what just happened with Vibes Cartel case, or, and not only that, they protect the rights. So basically, they are a safeguard for individual rights and certain individual liberties that we will say, right, regarding certain legal decisions that need to be reviewed. Okay, that might impact the fundamental rights. Okay, just like a fair trial, freedom of expression, protection against discrimination, those types. I can list off many, many more, right? And also, it, 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 they're impartial. They're supposed to be. They're supposed to be impartial, and their impartiality, right, and their independence from our political influence in Jamaica, right, that is supposed to contribute to the integrity of their judicial process which is within the commonwealth jurisdictions so it, it, they were set up as a safeguard and not to be looked at as foreigners that's all i'm saying they are and it's, it's a court of appeal but make we um right. george I, I don't think he has another device on because um, um, i would have gotten can i respond to that I, 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 i'm yes, taking please, please do hold please on do. you will hold on can i respond to hold on reviewer you will get your time and well, I'm a general. Yeah, what I'm saying, George. Yeah, me not get no, me not get an echo from him. So I'm good, man. All right. So go to review and respond. Yeah, what you saying, reviewer? Yeah, um, ma'am, you just put, um, you just put Jamaicans, and we cannot ignore the racial element in the position of children. That we need to be looked over by white people in England, um, and we cannot govern ourselves to the fullest. Okay, um, first of all, point, I point one, point two, you said 
the, the, you, you, no, 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 hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me let you, 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 you went on for no, a while. Let me, let me address a few I'm of your points. Here, you know. Point one, for, uh, 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 no, 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 point, point two, you said they are more objective. Um, the privy council is more They're objective. Some, I never said that. I never um, said that. I never said that. We are talking. I never said that. First of all, I never said that. I said uh, 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 that um, they are supposed to listen. I said the way it is being set up. First of all, I didn't put anyone anywhere because this me born and come find it. So okay, these are the these are the, these are things. Jamaica is a part of the Commonwealth. Okay, it's one of the Commonwealth countries. Okay, what is this setup? Is that the Privy Council serves as the highest court of appeal. For, 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 for the commonwealth countries i didn't put them there that's the first thing the second thing is the way they are set up that's you're, you're incorrect in that statement you, you, i'm you i'm you're incorrect Listen. you're oh, incorrect I'm, 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 you have you have, have many commonwealth countries that that, 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 that that have their own court so now that must you have so many commonwealth Jamaica countries that right, are not part know. of the we privy council yeah, but all I know. no 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 but you said you said the privy council is the highest court for the commonwealth listen to what i say again please sir no you said the privy council is the highest court for the commonwealth Virgin, have you not been listening? Have you been listening, no hold on hold on hold on reviewer hold on please take up in because when we start listen to respond we will misunderstand what people are saying not all commonwealth countries have the privy council of its final court of appeal yes but exactly. all commonwealth countries like jamaica have the privy council yes. as its final court of appeal that's exactly. what she's saying give me so, a so there's so no where confusion is the wrong there. In that? give me a run there miss jules and, yeah, and, 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 I, and, and, really want and, and I want and I want to find out and I want to find out are we are we okay with that? No, so but what's no, no, I want to find I out know, are we okay with that? What, what is no? What is no reviewer? The people have the choice, right? And they said, "Well, on the man, well, on the ask the question." That's, that's a yes or no. Well, on the general man, is not a yes or no. You get what I say? All we say is that. Yeah, I agree that um, you know, I think we should go with the CCJ, but you have other people who will argue and say, well, we know we should stick to the Privy Council for now. Um, the, the I think the JLP wants to stick to the Privy Council. The Mark Golden is saying CCJ, and there's back and forth right now. So right. I am not gonna say it's absolute when I say, oh, they should go to the CCJ. Right. No, we are speaking subjectively here. So that's just the reality. But um, give me a round of. Yeah, members allow black light to say the last thing, and then I really want to touch yeah. on that bank, that bank executive reasoning yeah. there. I really want to touch on it. Yeah, yeah, is this your sure, legal you. argument anyway? So it's a great. Yeah, yeah uh, just just a while ago, both both of you guys' points are absolutely correct. Miss Julia is right in laying out what the facts of the situation is and what the structure right. is, and your assessment of what it is or your your opinion on the efficacy of the structure is is warranted i would say even if it's not absolutely right facts what, what i can say though is that there is a bit of a, a of a gray area in all of this in terms of the final appellate court of all all common all demo, democratic countries that final appellate court will basically have in their pen stroke the ability or the capacity to interpret and reinterpret what the laws mean to the people of the land. Um, right. How democratic the stru that structure is and how what, what, what sort of exploitation that leads to or what sort of political efficacy it is in terms of creating a civil order and a proper, a, a good functioning economy and a, and a structured um, law society is, is questionable because most of the countries that have retained the Privy Council, if not all, they are the leaders in in the, in the undercrime and the, the the murder per square mile list, mm -hmm. I, I don't. Sh I'm not sure if that's a, if that's a straight coincidence or if we all have the same sort of circumstances underground politically and socially. And the Privy Council itself, the structure of our legal system itself, is just not the way to go in terms of bringing up. Well, that is an argument for it. So, remember, we weren't talking about opinions. We so, were talking so, so, about the facts. 
right? And what mm-hmm. they're supposed to be. So what I was saying to the gentleman to review, I wasn't saying that I made the rules or I put them in position. I was giving you the argument for why they are there and why they are still there. And when you say that, oh, they're not objective. I never said that they were objective. But one of the reasons why they're there, right, is it, one of their arguments is maintaining judicial independence, meaning their impartiality, and their in, in, independence from our political influence in Jamaica, right? That was supposed to basically contribute to the integrity of their judicial process. That is what, so, so, so they're saying basically, you're far enough to be objective. You're far enough to not be, to, 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 to not be corruptible, basically. There's- so that is, that is the, one of the reasons why. So no, I'm not saying that it is true. I'm not saying that all these people are objective, but I'm telling you why they use them and why they are a safe, where they are safe to, to certain countries in the Commonwealth. It's Which, just let me just say this. Let me just yes. say this. Oh, well, in us keeping well. the Privy Council, why mm-hmm. I would go for us keeping the Privy Council at this mm-hmm. time, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Amnesty 2020, uh, 2023 report state that the the influence of the political on the judiciary mm-hmm. is so much of a great concern. Mm-hmm. In other words, and it it gives you the yes the perception the person yes it gives you the perceptions that in other words it's not a look, good look side. Right. I'm feeling for words now. But in other words, they are saying that they are so intermingled. I'm going to agree with you, George. But I'm going to right. ask. But that's their no, that is, uh, that oh, is oh, an oh, independent. Oh, let me finish Black Light. That is an yeah. independent assessment from Amnesty International. Okay. I'm so going to suffer. So are not, <laughs> yeah. is, is, is not material. Yeah, yeah make, make Lali Bella say a thing, you know, please, and then Black Light up. Go to Lali Bella. Go to Lali Bella. So, 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 I'm going to be real quick. So, 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 um, George, no, I, I guess we need to look at their methodology, right? I'm right. international. We need to look at their methodology, and then we can validate. No, you're Lali Bella. You guys can't hear me? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, we are hearing you, Black Light. We don't know what's wrong with the device. We are hearing Lali Bella, you know? Yeah. Black light. Yeah, straight back in black light. Yeah, straight back in. Where is Lali Bella? Yeah, and I was gonna push. For, I was gonna ask Black Light if he thinks that the correlation that he put forward amounts to causation. You know what he was saying that uh, these nations that have the privy courts as the highest appellate court that they have the highest their crime ridden. Um, I mean, does that mean that uh, does it have anything to do with the privy council, or it's just coincidence? No. But what the the point that we're missing here now, you, you know what where the privy council come from. Mm. The Commonwealth countries were owned by England, no? right? right. We're, we're, exactly. Our, our law, our educational system, our judicial system was all crafted by the by the Queen, right? Right. So, right. Uh, and so, in actuality, since before 1962, we got independence. Even though our local courts, that's why right. you go in court. I say lords and this and that, and them wear them something upon them head, no? That's where right. it's coming from. No? It's coming from the UK. Exactly. And that's where it's all yeah. coming from. That's the Facts. point we're missing here. So that's no, it's not a matter of what we want. Or it, 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 me not miss, I didn't miss that point, my dear. Re, re, me remember, miss, me. remember before, no, uh, yeah. All Jamaicans had a, a British passport. Mm-hmm. So Be- just just like all the Jamaican, anymore? just like all the DR people has a US passport, um, Vuam or wherever, wherever US Virgin Island, wherever the US owns has a US passport. So, so James Bond, one distinction I make though, right, is that mm-hmm. though, though our, 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 our judicial derived from the British common law and so forth, there's a distinction. We have a written constitution while the British don't have a written constitution. I, I, yeah, but at times, after independence, we did have our own judicial laws we wrote, but the fundamentals of our laws and the blueprint of our laws came from the UK. And all, yeah, and but, but where are just we going to go with by, this argument? If, 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 you look at this argument if you look, if you know, Samuel, so sit yeah. back and make everybody talk where about this argument. No, going James from Bond, from no, I just Bond. ask him, where is this argument going? Because what is the prosecution so listen, rate listen in England, England, England compared to listen all to what James other countries saying, that you are no, in? No, but John, John, no, John. Judge, hold on, Judge, man. This argument is we mean to... It's discussing whether or not the efficacy or the, 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 the purpose of the privy council. Yeah, but hold on, man. This argument is going... But England have a 98... Um, judge. Where in the rate. Judge, hold on, Judge, man. 
George, well, I'm not going to say... Charles, yeah, equivalency. Well, I'm not judge, man. I'm not going to say that's your in the reason more time, you know. So, just well, I'm like a bit, man. I understand the zeal and the passion. Just make us allow um, James Bond to make him point. So, we clearly hear what he must say and we understand yeah. so we can push so, back. Yeah. Yeah. Go. A little bit. go on, James Bond. So, to the gentleman that was talking about... um. Somebody in foreign land making our uh, right. our laws. This is where I was going, George. That I'm just trying to let the gentleman know where it all is. <laughs> Not a matter of foreign laws or whatever. Right. Jamaica was once England. Just, most of the Commonwealth was once, once part England. of it. Part of it was UK, part right. of it. So that is where all of this is originated from, and that is why the Privy Council is still set today. So that right. is why we're trying to become a republic. When we become a republic, we cut all ties with the with um with the UK. Now we can go to the Caribbean Court of Appeal for our matters. Can we I can, can I can. just comment? Thank that? you, sir. There was, a, you there can. was a few points. There was a few points there that was made that there is a whole heap of arguments as pushback. The first one about the political separation and not being politically influenced by what is on the climate here, and yes. that makes a more objective court away from us yes. here. There is an argument against that that says that the people in England have often accused the House of Lords of being politically swayed and being politically biased in how they've reached their decisions. Now, when, when there is a particular chief justice of the House of Lords that is sitting as a, as, as a, a member of parliament in England, he also carries political views. So when there is an extreme left person running the court up there, the court usually tends to swing to that more is liberal, definitely true. More liberal determinations. But so, just to support your argument, please let me finish the point. I don't finish but, the point. Please let me finish okay, the point. Finish, finish, finish. Yeah. When the court is of a per perception that it's left leaning or liberal, there's a perception that any small amount of impropriety is going to cause the court to release any sort of person convicted as a criminal. Because the perception is procedural, whatever procedural excuse that can be brought up is criminals is being, is the person whose right is going to be observed more than the, the, the person who is deceased. Okay. That's the perception in England. Wait, no, again. Yeah. When it's on the right side of conservatism on our extreme right side up there, there's a perception that no matter what sort of impropriety um, is, is observed, even if it's substantial to the point of causing a miscarriage, it's not going to be recognized under that right conservative extreme political view so let's okay. just say there is no court on earth that is separate and apart from political persuasion okay. political influence that so is that's true out there that showing people because them is not on this no but but but, but wait, wait but let me finish okay. finish one sentence all right, one, all right. The one, all right. What you from this you. political climate yeah is, go ahead so is also a negative to say that they may not objectively represent the feeling and the perception of justice on the ground for here. So okay. there's, there's a two sides to that argument. I okay, so 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 that, now, so so <laughs> I heard that argument before. Remember, perception, perception, perception. You said perception around five different times. It doesn't make it so, but it is true. It's still valid. No, 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 no. Look at what they're supposed to. No, I'm going by supposed to. I'm not going by what is. Okay. When it comes on to impartiality and independence, when it comes on to the Privy Council, they're saying that the Privy Council is independent from local political influences and pressures. Say what's going on in Vibes Cartel case, what's going, but probably going with JLP, PNP. Let's just say if he, if he, if he was for a particular party, right? Which them say is supposed to help ensure the impartial administration of justice right so basically they're saying that the privy council being so far away and being so far removed right from, from from what's going on on the ground right their decisions basically are based on only the legal principles and the precedents rather than any kind of political consideration basically that is supposed to foster some kind of confidence in the fairness of their judicial process that's the one no i'm telling you what's supposed to be i know we don't live in shudland okay another thing is consistency and stability think about it if if if, if privy council basically is about <laughs> certain certain stability. commonwealth jurisdictions right <laughs> right right the privy council's decisions establish legal precedents right and it promotes <laughs> consistency and stability across the common length the commonwealth jurisdictions okay which as you know practicing law which is very important to maintain predictability 
right? And any kind of coherence in any kind of legal interpretation and any kind of legal application across the Commonwealth. So this is what should be. I know we don't live in should land, but these are the arguments for, and we cannot deny the arguments for. Can I respond to you now? No, well, yes. um, black light, black oh. light. Well, uh -huh. and, uh, 20 minutes ago, we have segue into that reasoning. Okay, you know. well, we'll, we'll talk about the same the argument, as we say, it's going to segue. So nothing no wrong with that. Big up okay. to Merkava, you know, 360. Big up Merkava. Yeah, Big man. Up. Big up the ones and ones. There are 264 people there. See, you leave a like on the stream. If you want to join the panel, the link is pinned at the top of the chat. So big up to the ones and ones. Them. So um, this, this accused, right? 38 years old. Bank executive. So you know, say, yeah, man. You know, Blacklight, a decent position that, you know, probably mm. some wealth manager and executive position. So you know that, go, right? Bank executive, we're here. Yes, yeah, man. Yeah, yeah man. Her, her name is Sheena Headley. That's who so was like arrested. Let me just read it out, the Blacklight. Who was arrested and charged in June 2022 after cocaine worth 85 million was found in the chunk of her motor vehicle at her house has been freed. She was freed last week, Friday, following a no-case submission made by King's Counsel Peter Champagny in the St. James Parish Court. So long story short is that she was caught with 85 million worth of the white lady, right? So, wait, 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 how wait. she get off of this no, now? Because this, the... hold on, a case like this, now the DPP deal with this too. Yeah, man, you drop the gun. So, so how she get off of this now? Let me hear some perspectives there because this is very interesting. Yeah, you drop the gun. She alone operated that vehicle. That's while ago. You said she was caught because it was found in her trunk. She wasn't caught, my brother. No, yeah, 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 yeah. Well, 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 I agree with it. All right, watch this now. Let me reframe it. Thank you. She was charged. Arrested and charged because it was found in her car mm -hmm. at her house on her property. So, yeah. She alone operated that vehicle? Yeah, that's another question. Who had access to the vehicle? No, her husband, Chad Headley. Okay. He had access to the vehicle? Not only did he have access, but they basically received information that the vehicle was being driven by him. And when they found her, she was mm -hmm. not in the driver's seat. She was in the passenger seat. But the driver was Were he arrested and found. charged? Who so was the, the husband now has been charged because he has been named by the police, apparently, right? So he's actually mm. being represented by a, by a different attorney at law right now, um, some something Thomas, right? But um, I believe he was also freed of the charges too earlier in the trial. But for her, she was freed. What I'm saying is because she was in the passenger seat, the reports were a man was driving, which is supposed to be her husband, right? And that the car, the, the basically how the report came in was 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 was, was him was driving the car. And she was just in the passenger seat, the passenger seat, right? So, so he's not being charged for the position. Apparently, apparently. Oh right? no, apparently. Um, I'm sorry, Miss Julia. No man, crispy. Well, on the reviewer. No, man, don't say that your mic was muted, man. I don't know where go on. You get what me I say? Yeah, man, and if your mic was muted, you unmute your mic. You get what me I say, <laughs> general? Yeah, because you see more time too. Um, Sometimes the background might be noisy. You might be getting a feedback, so we will just mute the mic. But at the mm. end of the day, yeah, man, you can unmute when you're ready and them something there, man. Yeah, That's man. how we do it, man. You you mute me all the time. Yeah, so go to so them. Question. Yeah. So question, apart yeah. from those two persons, who else was operating their vehicle, that vehicle? Anything else? Establish outside of that? Mm, boy, I mean, not, you're not else yet, still, to be honest. Well, that's strange, then. That's very strange. Mm. Hold on. Um, James Bond, you, you know, say, your device, I get a little echo today, but we know the thing more time still. Um, So, so, what is what I find very strange about this though is that why they never charge the two of them same time though. Mm. You understand me? I say because yeah, at the end of the day, not because a fear name the car in a right and a fear property. If somebody else lived there and have access, you're not supposed to investigate and charge the two of them, man. Mm. It can't be no one who got drop the charges there, so. And I got charged after I know we waste taxpayers' money and come so far and them sitting there when we never have to do it in the first place. No, apparently that they, they did hold them and charge them at the same time, but them both free now. I don't know why. The both, they both of them were free. The husband and she was charged at the same time, right? 
But look at what they were charged with. They were charged with one, possession, two, dealing because of the amount, three, mm -hmm. trafficking, three, trafficking because it was in a car, which is a moving vehicle, moving. Mm -hmm. right? And, 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 um, basically it, it them say it was worth what 85 million dollars mm. right so them charge both of them at the same time right but they both have been freed so i don't know what on what premise that is interesting so, to me so is the both of them get no no submission cases yes the both of them the both of them yes. one time both of them so both there is them. nobody else charged what is this worth of cocaine right now in terms no of one else there not not yet no one else has yet so maybe them know something we don't know we don't know well, I, I am I am not a hundred percent aware of that one. I'm gonna take Miss Julia mm. word for it and then I go check it out still. Yeah, man. Yeah, but I just know of her being um you know freed of it right now, you know. But for wait, Emma, until the Court of Appeal or this I mean the Supreme Court website posts the transcript of that no submission mm -hmm. um, judgment, and then we will take it from there in terms of what was the issues that was raised and why the prosecution never have enough information or enough evidence to support the right. updates that they made very curious i'm so curious but, about but, this um, black life but yeah right because at the end of the day right it is contingent on one the police collecting the evidence properly to not true yeah mm -hmm. but the prosecution must assess what they have in their hands before they make any charges so true. if the police didn't do enough work it's for the prosecution to send them back and not jump the gun and get people um of the matters in terms of mm -hmm. the in a, in a but, but if the police let's say let's say the police search the car without a warrant the case dead yeah man that dead that's a mm -hmm. yeah, or them, they they my house don't or read the people them rights all them something they read their rights and not because it's in her car if she says she don't know about it and let's say the car key put up on the counter is a house that multiple people pass through or whatever whatever that's a case you don't know if somebody take a key and put the put whatever in the car trunk and but and, but but james man you you know say the search in the car without a warrant part there. Um, you, you know, say so I I will beg to differ. And let, let, let me just tell you why, you know, when I'm beg to differ. Big up to Poseidon, you know. Yeah, man, big up to ones and ones. Them. Big up Poseidon. You, you see, watch this now, um, James Van. I will see this craft use all the time. You see, yes, they should have a warrant to search a car, but them use what quote unquote probable cause in the sense what you see them find nothing. Watch me. If them don't find nothing, all is well. You go and buy your business. I didn't make a fuss about it, right? Mm -hmm. But if them find sitting now, even though they never have no warrant, them say probable cause and reasonable suspicion, blah blah blah. And this is what we found. So right there, so now we know them have a little loophole where they well, can breach the constitutional rights well, 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 and use America, the guys America. and say. Um, you know, probably because are suspicious and in, America, in America, you can't use probable cause. No, I'm talking about Jamaica because we're no, no, talking about this, you know. Yeah, but what I'm saying is, and, and I can't speak on it because I'm not 100% sure if that's how the law works over there. But here, let's say him, him, him smell weed, never care. Him can't mm. search me care because I smell weed. I'm go for your dog, and the dog have to say, okay, cool. And then him, him can then him get then him get a chance to search my car. But him can them smell weed or him see this. I'm going to ask for your consent. No, but he will ask you though. Yeah, and I can and I want to do that. I have to get a warrant. No, yeah, 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 yeah. But what get a warrant. Right, what is now? The common law. Yeah, you know what the craft for them are going to use? Them are going to say what? You were acting suspiciously suspicious, and the call for the dog. Suspicious is not a crime. The common law. Yeah, I, I, I know, but what is now? Reason. Reasonable suspicion, it gives them reasonable suspicion. Yes. So at them argument and them use and win um, yeah, yes. it's, st it's still warrant a, it's out of all of that. No, I'm not saying no, but everything what them going and say, but all right, so you can just go to a judge and say more want a warrant or no. You have to no, give them agree, reason agree. for a warrant. So them are gonna use all them probable cause I would smell and the dog say this and the dog. Yeah, there's gonna be arguments for the both sides. Um, yeah, to, to get a warrant. To, so, what reasonable suspicion was there. we don't know if a man drive up to the yard, them get most of the time, them thing in Jamaica is information, man, them, them working off. So police can just jump the gun and say, yo, somebody tell us a rain or the car and whatever. People them don't know them right. Make the police search them car and them find it. And as experienced lawyer like Mr. Champagne himself now, yeah. they can say mash up quick and easy. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. If, if there's no reasonable suspicion and it was on their the property that is trespassing it. So you yeah, yeah, have a big hurdle for pass, my brother. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. If there's no reasonable suggestion, well, yeah, 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 no to the public. 
or in a public There's danger. a number of reasons why it could have get thrown out though. A num number of reasons. Number of reasons, yeah. Yeah, we need more information. We need a transcript. Yeah, we need some more information. We need the transcripts of the court to say what them see, what them review, and what them 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 agree to as to why this is no case, why there is not enough material presented with the charges to say that there's a case against these people. Or the people that say, uh, say, our first people report, that said it looks spooky. Our, our, <laughs> first, our first, report, first report could have been a hundred, a hundred million dollar worth when it when it boiled on out. Now it has a eighty five. Mm -hmm. right. and, and 85. I remember the one last year, the billion <laughs> dollar one, um, down at Ian Fleming there. We mm -hmm. all know that. Where we yeah, are that is the one I want to find out about the Ian Fleming. The man is a killer. <laughs> you don't hear nothing about that again. You don't hear nothing about that again. You don't hear nothing about that again. That gun. <laughs> yeah, the money that gone. Ah, <laughs> oh, boy. Lee and Lana, Jamaican pilots, Miss Nanny sitting there. Mm. All, type, all oh, types of shagri. <laughs> but, but Ian Fleming, but with, with, Ian Fleming, with Ian Fleming Airport, it's not far-fetched, though, because it's not like a Norman man there. Yeah, Sam, so you, you land there, so I'm man, I wait for you to jump the fence and gamble your business. It's not, a, it's not, it's not far. No, no, James Bond. No, 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 James Bond. What's this now? You see, yeah. you, you see, you see Ian Fleming? They, they have to be FAA certified, TSA certified, mm -hmm. JCAA certified, and they, they, they are under the airport authority of Jamaica and the Jamaica Civil Aviation Authority. So, mm -hmm. what's this now? The same procedures that are applied to like NMIA and Montego Bay. They have mm -hmm. to adhere to it as well. You get what I say? So um, nothing can at, just throw over at, things at like that. At the time when that happened, no. But what, what, one at the time when that happened, no, because that airport just came up to standard the other day. In no, terms, but but hold well on. At the time when it was um found, it was up to that standard. No, no, yes, that happened. James, yes, it was. It was. It was that, James, happened, James. that happened three years ago. That airport. No, just, what do you mean by three years ago? That happened in the middle of Corona, brother. Trust me, I am very familiar with the case. But now. hold on, no, but hold on, hold on. Let me tell you something, um, James Bond. You see, Tinsipen, Tinsipen has to adhere to JCAA um, regulations. You see, Ian Fleming have to adhere to JCAA regulations. JCAA, yes. I said international. And I was talking about the Jamaica said, Civil I said, Aviation I said, Authority. I said international standard, my brother. Yeah, but hold on, no, what I'm saying is, at that time, the security had to be in compliance with JCAA regulations. So it's not something where, um, you know, a man can chew or over an fence like that. No. As I said to you, all the man of it is land the plane, run across the field and jump the fence. No, but not no go so. Not, not go so. James Bond, remember you have a contest. No, no, no. Hold on, James Bond. Hold on, James Bond. No, hold on, Jad. No, you have a contest. Hold on, the contest. Hold on, 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 hold so no, 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 context, no. James Bond. It was about, it was about 50 bars. No, no, hold on, Jads. Hold on, Jads. Hold on, Jads. Make with us, make James Bond. Make it part. No, but I mean, that finish that thing. No, but can I not throw the fence? There were 50 bags. I don't want to hear what this is, Jads. In a warehouse. No, hold on. In a main, in the main, in one of the main areas of the airport. No, hold on, Jads. Jads, hold on, man. James Bond make him part. Because my argument is, my argument is, you know, and me tell you, say, in a matter where James Bond wants to say, you know, brother, the reality is that that airport is not no airport in a plane can just land a man pick up nothing like that. It is under air traffic, JCAA air traffic controllers. Yeah, they, they might track everything. They might see what I on. Security is there. They might have to go through all of the surveillance procedures, cameras, they everywhere, lighting around the airfield and them something there. So I don't like no Vernon field where sitting just land and man pick up and drop off and gone. I wouldn't know. No, judge, the Ian claim um, is a different thing. Um, so go to the James Bond and then judge can start thing. Have you been to the? Have you, have you been? To, you, you, you know, you know that airport setup, right? You have been to the structure of the airport, right? You know, it's me. Right? Yeah. Yeah, of course. Okay, cool. And all I'm simply saying is, for a plane to land, of course you have to go through all whatever calling, whatever um runway them giving you, whatever blah blah blah. Remember, they found whatever they found there. And everybody got more than business. You know, like a man take up a bag and run away with it. Obviously, obviously, if a man find out say whoever is calling to get in or whatever, him close that clear. Him can land the plane and go about in business. That's what I'm saying to you. Him never carry no bag with him and nothing. Them find everything there. That's what I'm simply saying. Because you know, they're saying no, they're gonna find the body and, and people disappear. And I'm telling you what the possibility of what could happen is not a 
is not a one little shed you go through for immigration. It's not a normal man you have to go through this and go through that. It's a little shed you go through, brother. Oh, yeah, man, I understand, man. But it wasn't a That's case like where it. people disappeared. I mean, I mean, I use a case like in right. you know, a um, Rocky Point, them place there, and you know. But like yes, over the Ian Fleming, I just find them fine. It wasn't like say exactly what I'm saying. That's, that's, that's but what I'm but saying. I smuggling right. I go on. But my, my point yes, was man. though, my point was though, those things are, are smuggled onto the compound, and it's not like say plain land, and a man just throw it over the fence, and in two minutes it load up, pick and fast and gone. We're talking about uh, you say nobody never get charged, and I'm saying is that ch a chance why nobody never get charged? Them find the plane or no? The plane was there. That's what I'm saying to you. So it's easy for a, a, an individual to get away from that airport. That's all I'm simply saying. And if man run out of Miami airport, what the hell if man run out of Indian Fleming? Man run out of Miami airport already, you know? <laughs> <laughs> man run out of Miami airport already. What, what is Ian Fleming for? A man run out of one fence today. Right. right. I mean, John, once, once you jump the fence, you know, it's a the highway there. So if a man run out of the highway, I wait for him. James Bond. I got him down. James Bond. Let me give you some context. There were about 49 to 50 bags, black duffel bags. And you see them, it was just on, it was just on, you see where you walk through the airport, one of the room joining that same walk through. They were stuck there. <laughs> one man couldn't carry 49 bags weighing 50 pounds. So you'd have to have a, a team at least three, four, five men stuck in those bags in one of those rooms. So on an hypothetical man, a jump fence and a throw bag over fence and load it. Again, the George, you missed the whole point, but okay. <laughs> no, go ahead. Let me see the point of my miss. Come on, give you some context. So on a man jump fence. All right, let me slow it down for you. Emotion said no one was charged, and them all them did them find bag and plane and whatever. And I am saying it is very easy for someone to suspect something going on and get away. It is very easy. If man run out of Miami airport, man can run out of Ian Fleming. That's all I'm saying. I'm not saying no one man carry 50 bag and throw the bag on a fence and a this and a that and a rare and all that kind of stuff. I am not saying that. I am alluded to the first argument that says no one got charged. And that's all I'm saying. It's very easy for any one individual to take with himself from that airport. That's all I'm saying. James Bond is, is, is right to some extent. It is easier than, than the other established airports. Both it and things happen is where most of these activities have been caught in the last couple of last few years. Um, black that um black light. Mm -hmm. so I find it of whatever. But have, 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 have any have any have any have any other flu private into Jamaica? If if there is private airstrips here. No, if any of you on the panel have ever flew private into Jamaica. Um, when a, a no, um, um what is now J James it is Band? so easy yeah but james man yeah but i heard Band, oh, what is now me yeah um i have i have yeah in-depth knowledge about you know yeah man certain things still you know yeah man yeah, you can't talk about certain things james man yeah man me know me know the airport them like me and me so that's the reality so yeah. The reality is, if you want to about NMIA, so, yeah, man, I can walk you through it. If you want to about so, so you, here, you should, you, you should know what I am saying. Make yeah, but but the thing is, with the Ian Fleming situation, right? We mm -hmm. we, we all agree that something shake here go on. But yeah, what we're saying is that it's not no plain land and things through over the fence and in in two minutes. I, I have still not said, and gone. I, I still haven't said nothing through the fence. I said the person could have escaped easily. We are not missing the point. That's what I am saying. Oh, oh, so you're yes, talking about the escape and the not the introduction of the Ganja man. can jump the fence and go about in business. That's okay, I got right. you, I got you. I thought you meant that he was going over the fence. No, but James Bond, what I'm trying to tell language. you is that one Spiritual man, language. one man could not carry 49 bags, we earn 50 pounds each. And that may I try to tell you what I'm trying to tell Figurative language, bro. Figurative language. We're not arguing that point, there, George. No, you might use hypothetical that, when we are that, real, that, that, real black, circumstances. That, what that happened? Your black light. Again, I George. Use real thing I, George, George again. No, George, 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 uh, George. We, we. <laughs> I, I think. I think. Well, when when um James Bond was saying jump over the fence, I thought he meant by them introducing the contraband over the fence. But he must say no. A pilot run gun over the fence. So. If I, that's the case, I was speaking about introduction of um the, the, those those parcels. You get what I say? And you know, I said as 
how them reach in the 49 bags at 50 pounds. Mm-hmm. So the so one man can't walk in there. So we, we right. do understand that still, is yeah. it? One Somebody thing we know though. The one thing we know though. You see the people them will take those type of risks and have that type of aviation skills. Is some people were very special in terms of this this industry. They don't come every day. They're not easy to find. And it's, it's not every day you find one of these people that have the right type of skills to maneuver these type of planes in all sorts of weathers and terrains. You understand what I mean? So that is why usually these people are well protected in that respect. Because their, their work is very valuable and they get paid a lot too. So if it go wrong, it might be allowed to leave the scene. And usually when them thing you go wrong is one man never get paid. Usually everybody, especially a load like that, everybody's in accordance in, at the airport, especially a small airport like that where there's a very limited amount of people works there. Hey, I remember saying, you know, remember saying in real life, you know, um, Jamaica cannot make them sitting there, you know. So what's this now? What's no. some transshipment that go on there, you know? It exactly. Drop off, it drop so, off the move, go somewhere else, you know, man. That is what I was going to say too about this case here, why it is so, it is, even though we have to wait for some more information, it looked kind of murky to me because to me, okay, because, okay, non, and uh, submitting basically a, 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 a no case submission, right? You mm-hmm. know, so the prosecution, them actually have chance to rebut that, you know, right? So a no case submission basically is basically them saying to the judge that, listen, you have to rule that there's no case here, right? Mm-hmm. For, for the defendant to answer, right? And so basically the trial have to be stopped or, or the defendant basically acquitted. Both of them were basically acquitted. So my thing is, who is the 85? Why, why are they stopping the money, tra- the money trail? Who is the $85 million tied to? Where was it going? So to me, some in a something, and them find a way to basically it. stop it. Was, it. was that case where them find them find some work and eighty five million dollars, or they find eighty five million dollars worth? Well, that's the thing. They have reported eighty five million dollars worth it of work. Worth. So we don't oh, know how much pocket. was actually. You understand? Yeah, the, yeah. This is the substance. The sub, okay. right of the substance. Yeah, well, once they valued it, um, you know, they valued it. Yeah, uh, that's what, what the evaluation. What is reported, right? So my thing but is that's this. a lot, though. You know, you're not true. To me, what? yeah, it is a lot. Yeah, but, I eat the five million. I will eat that still. Actually, right. actually, actually, but actually, to me, it just seems like actually, something actually, in a something, actually, guys. Yeah, but, but it seems no, we I understand, know. you know, we understand, yeah. James, man. We understand, but the listen, the reason things, why you know. it's a lot, it's, it's, yeah, it's, a it's lot. not no billion, a billion, but 85 million. Good amount, it's a lot for a banker. It's it is a lot for a 30 year old banker to be involved in, basically. Right, There's so my thing is just the professional loan, you know. This is and, <laughs> and our age, but not only that, but this is the thing, guys. Them stop the investigation. Why, why, no, why wouldn't them they want to? No why, right, but why yeah, so wouldn't they want to find out? No, but this is my thing, you know. But and this is the thing, too, because we, the fact that that we, know, how corrupt, for now. we know how corrupt Jamaica is, right? And then and them drop the ball. It, there you go, but but why? But it, could it be that because of who it's tied to? Because eighty-five million dollar worth of, worth worth of this, who is it tied to? Why did why 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 is it like so quick? Like you know, what this coming like you know, like when you don't want to go somewhere and you don't want to call your friend until they say, tell her I say you don't want to come, and then in a ten minutes she call you, she's like you know, so I'm not feeling good, and you're like, okay, cool, no problem. <laughs> you understand what I'm saying? Why is it so easy for them to just basically just say okay, it's done, let's move on? Something in you know, a something is who is where that money was going to and where that 85 million was supposed to go to. I, I, I still think that. Well, you must understand to Miss Julie. Um, when, I, I when, find when it when interesting that when the government uh, value work on it, yeah, when they well, made 85 million, it could have yeah. brought down to nickel and dime where it's really not that. You understand? So, probably half of that. So, it, I understand what you're saying, but in the yeah. context of, in the context of things, especially with those guys on that side. Mm. That's probably a joke to them. Well, um, well James Man, and it could be, um, and it could be a deterrent to the bigger thing. Yeah, but James Man, you know, say um, the government have a system of of measuring the value of it still. So, mm. but it's, it's, the it's, 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 it's not that system of measurement. It's, it's never, it's not accurate. Sometimes no, I'm not saying that's so, 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 accurate. What I'm saying, based yeah. on their valuation, and it's a system that they use based right. on the weight and things like that. Then just get the number there. So fine. Right. So I just I just that's so that there with that. So, but um the reviewer was was trying to say a thing. Um yeah. got you let me hear what I said it. Reviewer. Yes, um yeah. I find got it you. interesting that 
Yes, yes. Um, I find it I find it interesting that for for the longest while, you know, Jamaica has had problems with transnational drug trade, and they added an an an, an extra airport in Saint Mary secluded in that area that cannot be a coincidence. That airport being there cannot be a coincidence. Mm -hmm. Well. Yeah, but but um, but um, if them want to, so you really feel like so they need to build a, a, a airport and have the government register it and all kind of security measures in place and cameras and everybody I watch that the place that for them try to use that the spot there when you have a Vernon field and all kind of other place where a lot use. of private airstrips also a lot of private that, airstrips in general. You really feel the like so they need to build up Ian Fleming to a state of the art um or at least a nationally recognized and certified uh, uh, aviation a, 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 facility. A, a internationally certified airport. Right, no, I'm saying no, but I'm talking in the context of when it was found, right? Let's say, because I think um, um, American Airlines was the first, not true. They actually uh, did uh, a maiden flight there or something like that. But long story short, yeah, I'm in general, I don't think they need to build an airport um, to do them something there, because at the end of the day, you know, uh, yeah, uh, it's like you uh, you are pretty much a great service um, for you to something, no. There are many other places where them can do them thing, man. And yeah, uh, um, so uh, I'm not gonna be with that. Let me respond to that. Uh, uh, um, <laughs> let me uh, 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 um, give me a chance to respond to that. Um, I, I coupled that with Jamaica's weed drug laws, where we are car smuggling cocaine and you can get a fine. We are in a country like Singapore, you're put to death. It is clear to me that Jamaican politicians are, are encourage drug smuggling. Look on the weak laws. Look at, look at the surface area where you you know many opportunities are there for you to smuggle drugs. The, the Jamaican well, political general. class, well, 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 you know. Hold well, 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 on, review Here we go on now. We we have to go read yes, the smart yes. where we kind of go around the words them too. You know we can't just a, a echo that a echo that a echo that for the algorithm. You know. They get me asking in general, so yeah, man, they can't say white powder. Oh, white I'm, sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Yeah, man, let's be mindful of that. Yes, uh, uh, yes, the white substance. Um, they, you, you know, um, they are okay with it. They encourage it. Their friends are doing it because when you look at how weak the laws are, and and and, 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 and um, uh, um, you know, a matter of fact, um. I'm um, a prominent lawyer who um, was caught in Jamaica smuggling drugs and he, he got off with a fine. And when he was caught in the United States, he got 10 years. And if you read the transcript of, of the judge in the USA, the judge said you got off very easily in, in Jamaica. So the, the political class in Jamaica, they are behind the drug trade. Sorry, the, the white lady trade. And um, if you look at the WikiLeaks cable, Politicians were named. You know, well on, 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 well yeah, man, make it Scarra like a little piece of the mic there. Yes, review. big up Scarra. Yeah, man, Scarra. Yeah, man, big, big up, big up for your man. Well, if you just check it, I mean, you imagine a time with the drug drug trade. So, uh, me want to chime in on that. Cause me that me that say. Yeah, but <laughs> all me I say is that the ones in my field are um, be mindful with them when try some words, so they not trigger. Yeah, them. I, me not gonna say no word, but what me not add to it is uh, my local. Um, part of Jamaica, I come from to say, it's a fishing village, right? Uh, I, I'm just forward back from the yard. And most of them, and them most of the fishermen, them big old scar, everything in my test. Because they might find, they might find it funny when they see a wash up all the time. Most of them, and they find a wash up. And when they see them, they find it because I guess, you know, to, during commute, you know, they will have a, a commute, you know, a transport, a, a, a white stuff. I look like they're running into like coast guard and then think that so they are they dash them overboard more time. So if fisherman them are find them hard now and I tell it. And, and I saw, so most of them are, uh, you know build up them big house uh, and I live lavish. So I agree with the bridge you know, as far as you know 
Yeah, the drug thing, uh, that thing is a big thing down there now, more, more so than ever Every, before. They're illegal. Well, I mean, I mean, Jamaica is a very um, significant or uh, strategic transit yes. point still. Yes. So, I think Geo that's Geo all it's been that way that you know. Geographically, where Jamaica is located, we're perfect in the world for any trade. Mm. Geographically. Right. Yeah. Whether it's from Asia, South America, whatever. But that's I, why we're actually the big logistic hub of the world. I actually think the drug trade is way less now than previous days gone by. Trust me. It is you believe so? Why? Course, you don't have the... Like, trust me. I think it's way less now. Well, that's because of technology. Jamaica All right. Let me, tell you why. Let me tell you why I agree with that, James Bond. Mm -hmm. um, first thing first. No, 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 man, no, uh, ship no greens again because they're sitting there legalizing America. Right? Then, you know, and, you know, certain places... Lock it off. But long story short, there's no value in the man that try to send no, no weed over here. So. You are going to send weed to New York? No. You have all the dispensaries you know, all over the place. The man is walking and buying weed. So the, them packets sitting there with compressed and them sitting there. No. So I agree. No you man that force a shit again like that. Are the, are the white lady. The man in my focus for now. You know why I agree with James Bond? It's because of the shift between Colombia and Mexico in other area. Colum Mexico has... Hold has on, whose background is that? Don't let me see that. Mexico no, no. eclipsed Colombia as the main player in terms of the people in that pushing out this thing around the place over to North, North America and around the rest of the world. Um, what happened is that the Colombian cartels were so dependent, of, dependent upon the, on, on the Mexican cartels to to transport the, the, the items for them that the Mexican cartels actually overpower that relationship and become the, the main transporters of the of the, the thing um of the all illicit drugs in North America right now. So what happened is that the Mexicans don't necessarily would need us as a route, an alternative route to get them stuff over there. So that's why I believe we would be seeing less traffic because of that switch in who's the main player in the region. And and not only that, Jamaica has become a red flag, a, a, a flag country. So anything coming from here now is going to be flagged and go to crazy scrutiny. So I mean, like now you have to find right now for Jamaican to go to Bahamas is problem. Cause usually a money that come go Bahamas, rare it, take a in business. Right now, Jamaican, if you don't have good reason to go to Bahamas, them turn you back. Same thing with mm. Panama. So I mean, like there are things that different international agencies are putting in place that is affecting jamaica widely so i mean like mm. that's why it's not you know much coast guard ship the us um both the us um donate to jamaica that are the lowest mm. part the world. like i mean like there's a lot compared to 25 years ago when you used to hear about yeah. the bits and the dot and the bram and the this and the ram sherm and the this and the that where they might find out 500 million a man house and this and that and both mm. i was from portland you know much and this yeah and man remember the man think of being fine yeah, five, eh? yeah, yeah them something, them something yeah. Going again. when the money get locked up the money marks for um where them ask for again, man? The cheesecake and them sitting there, man, and all kind of expensive mm. things. Them ask for them. The man to go be a five, man. Ram chair and them. Exactly. And them, man, they talk tap, tap, me. Boy, boy, tap, tap, man, them in a man. Mm. Boy, I'm tell you, still at me, you know, because I say, man, I'm a judge some boat now. Man, they, man, they think up more now. I'm going to tell you. Because when they do get fed, them, them, they still are dumpy. So I'm going to say, man, I'm a funny. Even more so now than they used to. It, it will it, it will never stop, but trust me, the fines that used to come back in the days, you now hear them stop me again. That's because me, me remember, me remember when before me even like ten years back, the man they used to go, uh, uh, eat, they used to go uh, 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 swap out a green for iron, you know. Mm. That they used to do. Yeah, no, well, no, remember, no, so, uh, yeah. remember that, that did um that did expose. Long, long, long time, you know. Yeah, long, long, mm. long time, you know. Man, and now, now over, it greens, over 80 and him sitting there. So, yeah, it's not it? public knowledge still, you know. Can I say this? Yeah. It's to the black market trade. The black market trade is usually like 10 or 50 times more valuable than what is being traded on the white market, even if it's the same products. So, you say, for instance, that two countries trading oil on the black market, people in that dealing with that smuggling making 10 more the times our oil would cost. Than it being traded on the white market. See? But the reason why the black market is always cheaper though, black light. The black market the black market um initial production is always cheaper. Whether I teeth it, teeth it, 
So it don't cost oh. you much. Or without you rob somebody, so the black market. No, is but the thing is, the smuggling more, across it, borders is what. Hold on, there, James Bond. Um, <laughs> yeah, I'm getting the feedback because your mic open. So please, people, please, um, let us be mindful. Um, whenever James Bond attack, we now really interject because it's gonna echo back. All right, so we can just um make it just flow. So yeah, man, um, make a point, black light, and then I think James Bond did a respond. But yeah, I was saying that the risk and the danger of bringing it across borders is what increase that value in terms of... No, you know what, I'm, I miss Julia. I miss Julia, I know, I'm sorry. Me? What's that? Yeah. Yeah, Am I making noise? I'm not making noise. There's some echo. No, I'm saying there's some there's some echo. I don't From know why. From me? Really? Like, uh, okay. Yeah, I, I don't know why still, but... Um, okay, I'm mute yeah. then. Yeah, go to Blacklight. Yeah, I, I, my point is that even though the players may have switched, we still have we still we're still in a very strategic position for the black market overall, in any kind of a way or any kind of smuggling, and which is one of the reasons why I believe our state has never been serious about policing our waters. Not even for the fishing industry, we've had neighbors, you know, where their whole breadbasket for their economy is fishing, and all they do is fish in our waters. And our government has known that for years and has been comfortable with that. The reason why we can't have a proper customs protection system or a proper border patrol system is because it's a very valuable position to be in when the country allows smuggling on the black market. Yeah, which is true because our nature, our, one could say is our culture of smuggling, our drugs um, affiliation. Remember, Edward Siaga went on NBC, you know, NBC. Not JBC, NBC, I said there's nothing wrong with smoking. I look at marijuana. Edward Siaga went. Anyone can go on, anyone can go on YouTube and look it up. Edward Siaga went. Remember the, the Coptic Church? Mm -hmm. When them used yeah, to work America, America. And it was it, it, them build up schools, supermarkets, shipping companies, trucking companies. So it was contributing to the Jamaican economic and economic. Sorry, it was connect, it was contributing to Jamaica vastly. So I mean one could say the government turned a blind eye on it at times yes but we even indirectly the country has been benefited from it a, a lot that i won't deny you know I'm not, I'm not saying that there is no value i say it's a very valuable position to be in regardless of who squealing or who having the problem in terms of having the bunch of drug addicts in their country what oh, what yeah. oh yeah I remember when i don't know if you guys know a guy named dida from arm um, running away when dida got locked up on it like sure the people thought i work on it like uh, sure people salem was a ghost town well i salem was a ghost town so at times when the government said those things dida was big in jlp he was a big contributor to the jlp so when the government said them thing there the, the money the money the monetary value of it sometime to them is like yeah the problem bad but it's not that bad because i don't think we as a country suffer from a drug addict problem because no. most of the most of the substance on our shore is just merely transition transshipping is just passing through it's not for consumption so until remember in america it was that issue until white people started dead yeah no. so until it become a consumption issue in jamaica i don't think there'll be any laws relax any stiffening or Tension on any laws. And what do you mean to a consumption issue uptown? Like in the uptown schools. Exactly, because it, it, it has become a consumption issue in the inner city communities. <laughs> so when it, as soon as it becomes an uptown issue, it is it a really political issue. issue. Yeah. No, it's, it's, it's true, I agree with you. Mm. Uh, we yeah. can't blame them still because you have to follow the trail of the money. Exactly. Um, I mean <laughs> exactly. <laughs> That's exactly what I was saying. <laughs> them don't follow the trail of the money. And to me, it's very suspicious, gentlemen, why there has been less weight put on dismantling trafficking networks. Because everybody leads to somebody else. Even if she and her husband are allegedly, right? Not allegedly anymore, because now they're free. But whoever was supposed to be taking that to somewhere, it's a part of a network. Nobody just have, oh, you know, let me just get $85 million worth of that from you right mm -hmm. it's a network so 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 we haven't seen much dismantling so you know what the, the whole this is the corruption down there is is a serious thing and the fact that we even question it just show say you know is that is, is much to be desired no, no yeah let me do but remember now a lot of these people especially when they're dealing in certain certain type of weight 
Mm -hmm. You might either have your champagne as a lawyer or your Tom Tavares or mm -hmm. you all always have the habit as a retainer. Mm -hmm. So stop going to your yard and you call your lawyer and say, keep your mouth shut. Facts. What did, they, did, they, did they present a warrant? No. The case done, they said there's nothing to leave Facts. because him know the case going through. There's no need for you to talk. <laughs> so a lot of times these people, the money, it comes back around to the money. When, when, you have the strength, when you have strength of cash, there's a lot you can get away with. Mm -hmm. Very true. Not only anyway, that. gentlemen, it's 11.55. Bless up on yourselves. I've yeah, ma'am, it's doing it, man. Bless up on yourself. And you guys yeah. be safe tomorrow and we hope to congregate with you guys again. Yes, yeah, ma'am, Mr. Julia. As I respect. Bye. Good night, Miss Julia. Um, just to say to the, the, the gentleman that was talking about the, the fishing village um, stuff, I'll just give you a quick little, um, a quick little breakdown of what's happening here and why we never yet been cultured like we live on an island. First thing, Everybody here should be able to swim. And the moment that we make little money, we should be able to go get a boat and get on the seas. That's the first thing. You live in an island and you don't own a boat or you can't swim. Living in an island and you don't own a boat, you're not serious about riches. It's Florida. I go, I go learn that. I go Florida. I go see places where whole roads, everybody have boats. See? <laughs> and when I reason with the people, <laughs> I get to understand that it's on the seas, riches are, <laughs> are made and exchanged. See? And the seas is a yeah, is whole different territory from the world on land. The, the yeah, world but that's, land. That, that's a cut, not to cut the wisdom. That's a first world country. Like everybody can afford to have a car and a boat. Like uh, nobody, like my whole life growing up, nobody in my family ever even had a car, much less to have a boat. Yeah, but I'm not saying that. I'm saying the moment that we get money, we must look. We must, we must okay. break yeah, into yeah, our culture. That's that's what I'm saying, but, but, I'm saying but, that but, we... I know, but some of the people in Florida not necessarily have money. Why they have a boat? I, you know I'm saying, well, is the culture is is how their culture to, to to view it as as if they're living on an island. What I'm saying to you, you know, is that we are here cultured like we are not living on an island, and that is by design. Yeah. What I'm saying. Yeah, yeah, you're you're right. You're right. I agree with you. We are being you know. distracted yeah. from the prospect of a lot, is what I am saying. Yeah, Come because like, even like, even like to add to your point, like my my village that I'm from, it's a fishing village, but the boats are really owned by fishermen. It's not necessarily nobody there really, you know, have a a boat, so to speak, right? It's all the boats are just fishermen, and that's only because they're fishermen why they have the boat. You know what I mean? And I mean, the people in Jamaica who own boat, excluding the uptown people. That's just to go to the beach on Sunday where they have a lamb key or main key. That's that's just what you're about. Yeah, yeah, that's true. In Florida, you have a little money, a little canal in the backyard and get a boat. There was um a community, there, there's a documentary on, on Netflix. You guys can take a look at it. It's called Square Grouper. There's a community out in um out in the Everglades, west of Miami, all the way on that side in the Gulf. Where back in the days, that's where the ship them used to come from, Colombia, with the greens on it. And then the, the fishermen them now would go out. And they pay them to bring back the load on on shore, and then whoever leave from Miami would go by there and pick it up. And every single person in that town was rich, to the point uh, where they, they were just uh, crashing. They, like they were just coming out from the bar drunk and we just crash through each other and go buy back. What 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 what's the documentary? It's called Square Grouper. It's very interesting to watch. All right. What what them name? What the district name again? I don't remember the name of it, but it's a little small town, little small town, right? It's it's west of Miami, out in the Everglades, way out onto the um, Pacific, to the in the Gulf of Mexico side. But you know, the documentary is called Square Group, so it show you from when the Colombians used to come there, and everybody just start buy them boat, so the Colombians get them work. When them come, they just throw it off, throw mm -hmm. them, them greens on the boat, and then them take it off, and then whoever them send from Miami will drive out through the Everglades, pick it up, bring it back across, and. That town was one well, of the richest town at one point in Florida. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Not surprised. Them people like cultured my brother to exploit them resources around them. Put it that way. We are cultured not to look at our resources in a way that is valuable to us collectively. For a reason. So that people can exploit it for us. <laughs> I think I think the reason why we don't even live island life so much is per se because Jamaica mimic america so much that we don't we have our own style and yes we still have our island flavor whatever but our living is still like we're living in america like yeah. in Jamaica, it's like 
even the supermarkets now, everything, everything in Jamaica look like America. The people, when you see them, them look like them just come from America. <laughs> you're right, you're right. Is a whole heap of imported food in our supermarkets, my brother. Can we, you can have you other stuff when you can get things. I'm going to tell them to talk about my boat and go fishing. Okay, fishing. You're mad. That's what I'm going to ask you. My two men, they, 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 they live the American um, culture for sure. I don't mean I tell you, I tell the name one night. I say that's one of the things with the, with the new music that they're doing because they're influenced by hip hop, most of them. More. Or so than they are influenced by reggae or, or dance or well the thing is you know but, you know yeah. say it's it's a very long time since we, we have been influenced by the american culture oh, even, yeah. even as it relates to music you get me i say yes yeah as early as the 60s we we were being influenced by the american culture so yeah i think we're, I, 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 that something new will happen that's why I said it has become a part of our culture. Right. Like, even our Wait. crime is influenced by the crimes that come in America. Wait, the James Bond. I want to go a little bit further because both of these groups, both the North American um, people that look like us and us, have been exposed to a program named Cointel Pro. Now, most of that is fully responsible for where we are, for all of our crises and all of our um, disturbances and the chaos that we have on the ground. But we have to also remember that um that we we both subjected to that situation because we had similar political circumstances facing, and we both responded in the same way to it in creating a subculture of some gangster and violence kind of a thing. Um, so if you look at the, the when you look at the, the the environment around the American person that look like us and have the same color as us skin, he's basically if you put him down in by um down by Tivoli. And take him out from Chicago, when you know, one of the worst hoods, and put him down by Remar. Apart from the accent, he would be very able to adapt to what's happening around him. It would, nothing around him would be foreign, apart from a little bit of peculiarities that is different in the culture. But the whole subculture of gangs and violence and everything would be a language that would be um, something that he speaks very fluently and would have no reason or no need to translate anything at all. Is what I'm saying, and the vice versa in terms of taking one from out of Tivoli and go drop him up in Chicago or in one of them little areas eh, in a uh, Georgia or one of them gang Atlanta place here, yeah, one of them something. So right, um, um, reviewer, I don't know what's going on, but I'm getting a little feedback um on year end, right? All right, so my position is this: I, I think people in in America, right, especially the the descendants of slaves in America, you know, yeah, they are totally culture different from, you know, people in the Caribbean. Like, we're talking about descendants of slaves were in the Caribbean too. And and it, it is just like different cultures. Culturally, it is different because remember, say, you know, in America, bigger country, one bag of states, you know, the whole history of the place, you know, you get me, I say? Hold on. Um, we review a mute them your, your mic for a second. Mr. still get the feedback there. Hold on. Yeah, yes, I'm the saying. Culturally, you know, it's like there is a difference, right? So when you look at even the history or the French and Spanish and the British, you know, even, you know, yeah, Mexico, the control, a portion tight. You look at the whole melting pot. You, you understand me? I say culturally, I think that they should have followed the double E D Dubois um you know approach you know even after when Marcus Garvey thing get messed up you know mm -hmm. yeah and them deport him and them things I and mean, if he said them shouldn't really deal with the double E D Dubois which which was promoting you know black intellectualism you understand me I say um yeah. I, I think what went south is that they went into religion you know there was noble jewelry them with the Moorish Science Temple <laughs> The day was far, the Muhammad and Elijah, Muhammad and the nation of Islam thing there. And from the rest, we see how it go. From nation of Islam to, you know, 5% of them and the yeah. Nubapi and the rest is history. Before, history. All that, before all of that, before all of that splitting up or diversity, before all of that, wouldn't you say that at that point with the W.B. Du Bois and the Garveyism, that we right. had sort of like a merger of the philosophies that was guiding like the cultures? Are the center of the cultures that they were almost mirror in terms of the, their directions and directives. The well with Garvey's philosophy, it was diametrically opposed to Double E D Du Bois, so th that was the problem, though. You know, 
Yeah, yeah. I remember and that's why they were opposing each other. Remember but, but, but I mean, if we even want to bring it back to Jamaica, right? If we want to bring it back to Jamaica, you see, you see the whole post-colonial thing. In, remember, you know, the structure was always in place, you know, up to this day. We can't go around that. Emancipation was 1838. And up until now, that structure is still in place. But like, yeah, the, like the descendants of slaves, they we don't, don't yeah, like that, that, that in terms of being dominant, in terms of economics. No, yeah. I trickle down, trickle down. Couple, couple people get out and they then turn politicians and whatever, whatever, and them are doctor and lawyer and whatever, and then decide. Say, no, but, but, yeah. but with, with, with that said, though, yeah, me agree. So that will be title. Can you remember what's the way it way in a is a first world country compared to a third world? You yeah, know, black, the post-colonial but, economic situation will but, be completely different and diametric in terms of. Yeah, but but with with, with, with with that said though, I think where we went wrong is just a matter of leadership because Singapore and Jamaica got independence at the same time, you know, and they have the same government structure, same exact thing. And if you look at where Singapore is today and where Jamaica is today, you can see it was just purely on bad decisions. Would they have a more disciplined society that would have been adhered to produce a leader that is much more orderly and much more structured and, and create that sort of a guidance for us? The the problem to I, 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 James Bond, huh? James Bond with Singa, Singapore and Jamaica, you know. While I do understand, you know, the logic behind the comparison, um, there are differences, and we just want to point to in Jamaica there was. Reviewer, please mute your mic because your background noise in general. I don't know if you are listening for something. Or uh, 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 um, I have nothing in the yes, man. May I tell you? So I'm getting a feedback still. I don't know what's going on, but um, if you want to say something, let, let me let me just mute and then you can say what you are saying. Go to and say what you are saying because I was gonna say something, but go ahead. Hold on. Are, are, are you guys hearing it? Or is me alone? Um, when we have this discussion about Jamaica and African American, I'm not hearing you in a reviewer. I lost you. I think we're going to come off and come back on. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Just, just, just come hello? off and come back on. Come off and come back on. Yeah, because it's making a lot of, a lot of noise. Yeah, yeah. Your device is noisy and you Emo. know we're not hearing you still. Yeah. Emo. So as as I was saying, still right. Yeah, um, Singapore and Jamaica, yes, while it was the same time that they got their independence and the same economic model, um, Singapore was very privileged to not have the manual doctrine whip over their head. And when it was applied, you know, yes, Singapore didn't have the manual doctrine um, deliberately stifling their economy or deliberately um, creating social instability and things like that so singapore got that benefit jamaica did not unfortunately remember up to 1993 singapore was almost bankrupt enough. and singapore was in a very bad state state in 1993 so it's not something new to singapore just coming on is just as like i said as time goes by people start putting the interest of the country and as and, and, and to loot it, alluded to the point that um black light made Singapore start using them resources that them have them start right geographically we're in an area where we we can have one of the best um harbor port harbor where we can use that to our advantage and that is what propelled them economically to the roof where Jamaica had that opportunity as well still do they, they still do but because of political whatever red tapes and whatever because remember when the Chinese wanted to use Jamaica as a transshipment hub they were planning on taking over Goat Island to use it and it was on the pnp i think it was portia since at the time they said no because they have some bird out they will live out there and some something where is in um close to extinct and all kind of political um red tapes why they didn't do it where if they had given the chinese that opportunity jamaica would in a far 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 different place what what that what the transition hub would they do for jamaica is what the panama canal did for panama yeah, that, that's that's what it was projected to. Um, one one thing as well, emo. If your point is that we are culturally diametric from the American persons that look like us, then um, why is it that we share that subculture 
of that violence and that ghetto hood gang kind of activity? Why we share that subculture that is so unique to both of us, so similar, it's so unique to the rest of the world, but so similar to both of us? Um, I don't think we share that. Respectful as a black man in America. What do they want about the, the violence part? Just the subculture self -murder, of the ghetto, whatever. We self murder, self hatred. Black life, trust that, me. So as a black man living in America, as a black Jamaican living in America, mm -hmm. we don't. And I can not. I won't speak for everybody, but I can speak for a lot of us. We don't associate ourselves with black Americans. Like most most Jamaican know if you date black American girls, and like my we. Brother. We Remember, don't. we're a culture man, you know, my brother. You, we are an exception, my brother, to what we're dealing with. <laughs> You're an esteemed gentleman. So we can't you hold you out as a standard of, of what we No, but well, you know, you know, I, I think there's a difference in, in the culture. That's and what I'm saying. It's a big difference. difference, it's a big but, difference. <laughs> no, but but most most Jamaican men still, you know, yeah, we definitely is like their goal is to also date a black American woman or you know, yeah. In our real life, still, so I would say not, not because a lot, lot of people might not would, do that, but I would say American, not a black American. Well, uh, all right, we are. I could just say American still, but watch this now. When it comes on to the the culture, though, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, in terms of remember, you know, not all culture, of these things, more, you know. All right, let us walk through it, right? Mm -hmm. You're in the sixties, you know, of the civil rights movement. Where you see um, the Black Panther then spring up and. You know, yeah, Nation of Islam fully active, them five percent as them fully active, you know, yeah. So I'm just saying all of that started out, and then now here what happened now. You have these groups, and you have the disciples, them too, them, them ones there. And mm -hmm. once it starts to flow, you, you see, you see, once that thing starts flow in the community, and every man start cut off them push and then them something there, that is when everything went south. So the environment was always hostile because of the whole dealings and, and dealings and them someday. Once that was introduced to the community, that I went all hell broke loose. So here we go now. Culturally, I'm talking about like in the in the more city areas. You I know what I'm saying? We're not talking about the suburban areas where you know it go. We're talking about in, a, in a the areas naturally. Yes, yeah, yeah. it's, it's a lot of hostility. You get what I say, yo, yeah, you will see the hostility that's still in a real life. And then now, when you look at say the cultural difference, is that we you know we will ask style a yard, but when we come abroad still, we're, we're more disciplined, even though enough of them, enough man feel like say them can just bad everywhere, and you see we reach them more time still. So it's a, it's a matter of choice still, but when it comes on to the cultural identity like that, in terms of being hostile, I think Jamaica's hostility. Is politically motivated. You get me? I say from the seventies and them something there. Yeah, the sixties we fire the same way now because we can't forget the um. When name again, man? Um, Walter P. Rodney. Walter, Walter, Walter Rodney, right? Yeah, man, yeah. Walter remember, Rodney. remember last time Jamaicans really riot for your cars. It was was Walter Rodney, you know. Mm -hmm. When them declaring persona non grata, you know that was Buster Manti, you know. Yeah, I remember. A long time, Buster Man to them really a fight against all black intellectuals and them something there, you know. The man them all, all called Walter Rodney a threat and them something there. He was a terrorist. Walter Rodney was declared a terrorist. Yeah, yeah. He was declared, um, yeah, persona non grata and yeah, um, stuff like that and whatever. But what I say, Walter Rodney never did nothing wrong. I think even Johnny Jamaica should apologize to him. Yeah, I, I think they should apologize to him. I know, I know. Yeah, I think that's a conversation that needs to be had in yeah. our real life. Real. You get what I say? Yeah, in a real life, because what he has done, you know, and his contributions, you, you, you label the man, you know, yeah. And and that was the only time when Jamaicans really rioted and fought. You get what I say? Last time, look at gas Last riot thing. Even, that was when 99 or 97, the gas riot. I think it's 99. Yeah, the, that was 99. That yeah, that was 99. Um, that gas riot there was politically motivated, but you, you know what's funny. Why you said that he end up getting involved too? Why you said that was politically motivated? Because from the, where I was the, the um guess right? Yeah, from where I was, it ran across lines in terms of it 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 ran both lines, both sides from where I was staying. I could have said that um like across the board, it was people like disobeying the political directives. Yeah, but I, what is in a black light? Remember, say no, the opposition at the time. 
Did that threaten to say they're going to march and protest against no. it? No. Well, 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 on the black light. That's why when um, Romano, Bounty Killer did that song off of the right, you know, so them can't believe say, Matches Lane and Yardman are linked. They can't believe how we, that we... Right. That kind of... That, we kind of, that was that they kind of unite the political parties at the time. Let me tell him, let me tell him about this. You see where I was directly? We have to run from a convoy of police and um, questionable characters of both sides, politically alignment. So, and was not part of blocking any road. was just out there when them something they are going. Well, a peer looting did I go on with me today still. Peer looting. Loot, loot, loot. Yes. I want to let's say, yes. I want to let's say, my man has to call me down here and tell you. And take away all my loot and them something there. So <laughs> wait, no brother. Wait, no brother. The emergency response team was a convoy of law enforcement and questionable characters of both political. Right. <laughs> me witnessed that, so me I thought that because anybody will want to bring it up to me for defamation. But with yeah, in Kingston, in the Kingston spirit. region, they still in the Kingston region still it morphed into a, a looting spree, or so. Both PNP and JLP people are looting yeah, them. So that, it was all looting. I don't think it was any one side. It was no, both. everybody are loot. Everybody are loot. But I'm saying did. how it started was the threat of protests against the, the increase. But well, I, and it I, I, morphed into the whole looting oh, thing. Oh, yeah, definitely started it, on the gas. Yes. yes. It was blocking up the roads. And when I realized what was happening, there was a response team already to clear the roads. Of people of questionable character that was supported by <laughs> law enforcement, and we witnessed that we had to run for our lives, and that but, but black that, 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 that would that would forget that will be that that would have looted to where what neighborhood you are in because if you're in a certain neighborhood, if you if you're there on jungle or TG or run a boy store, that day, transplant, it depends on where you is. From don't, that don't. day, we question the integrity of the of the state when they put out anything about they want to solve crime or they're not involved in. Because we, we saw a different sort of situation. We saw a situation that run across the board parallel that didn't appear to be politically motivated or inspired by any political directive. And then we saw a political response to quash it immediately that, saw, that showed the people them that anybody who witnessed it should recognize immediately the, the enemy that we thought was our enemy is friends with the people them that said them protecting us. And we don't need no clear example of that. Say, we, we don't have a common enemy. The people them that lead in us and we don't have common enemies. And that's the problem. Not to switch topic, Imotem, but let me ask you this question. I know Mr. Yeah, Vega yeah. said he was going to do a show on it. He was just waiting. Do you think there is a bias between dancehall and carnival? I mean, it's kind of sort of the same thing that we're on. But do you think there's a bias between it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You know, say, um, that is an interesting conversation because, you know, me personally, I've been very much engaged in carnival from like 2003 yeah man straight up so you know we see it i mean you're, you're dead eh? at the end of the day yeah it's an uptown scenario you know uptown people carnival is predominantly you know back and on. remember say byron lee them thing byron lee them thing was like poor people carnival that like, used to leave from all you know touch pan Kanchan spring road and straight, just yeah, straight man, right down the outside not down the outside, but you know, they break off, them break off the actual road. So, but, but you know what I think? Um, the back and all them now, them start up uh, right near to Mountain View side eh, and then go around. You, make, you get me, I say, I talk from up at Old Oak Road. Yeah, man, from Old Oak Road. And then they all the lady must bring them and them down there. You good. So, you see, when them go through now, all of you see the uptown people, them have come out of them yard and have them igloo out. Them and them family and everybody are weird feet pass on them something there. And, and, and you get me I say, and you, and you see all the people them culturally prepared feet to you know. Everybody are playing music everywhere. A little ends, every little lot, every little parking lot you see man set up. You get me I say, peer uptown youths and uptown people. So I just saw that go more time still, but you realize that there is always that kind of prejudice towards carnival because are really uptown people really but, deal with the carnival um, what, what one could say though because it's it's um i thought you were going to put it in, in your topic one of the night it's a big debate going on all about now yeah 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. i'm talking about it still man i want it's to uh, can i add something to the old back and all thing hold on a second hold on a second yeah, hold on one second review i load it to it but i want the pushback i would give against that you know is the carnival people because some people's comparable 
popcorn show and last in time festival and all that kind of stuff but one could say you know, if only way you could argue that you know for a substantial case of bias you know, if you bring the permit from carnival say carnival have a permit till 12 o'clock but they make it go on till 4 and popcorn had a permit from 12 o'clock to 4 to and them like a film show that's the only all right so argue. so so what is now james band so, um all right you, you see you see juve Yes. Yeah, that go from what? For evening and street no, until the morning. It's at 3 a.m. 3 a.m. till. No, no, no. no. Well, on, man. No, brother. Well, on, man. Well, on. 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 Well, on a parade and dance and everything and then they start head out on the road after two in the morning yeah. so 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 we have so we just want to say put it in a context and say it start a mass camp and by the time it touch two in the morning or, or three in the morning you know so the road march and then the all boat in a new kingston region and them something there. you get what i say yeah right but, so but, so what i'm but, saying but, is that them go until we until six six thirty in the morning yeah, but we don't know the permit them have because yeah, you have to, yeah, yeah. I you get have, that you know. I get that You have to pull a permit for for juvie for that or the man because why? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I get that you know. I get that. But it, it makes the question. Soldier, it be begs the question you know. What is you know? It begs the question. Say, um, why even like a popcorn them can't get permit to go until six o'clock when them but can't. Who like popcorn awesome. apply for that permit? Ooh, 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 all right, Proto J them why them can't get who well. Said, who, no, no, no. Location with Proto J them, I understand the part. Who said they apply for that permit? They're no, no. As me I said, with Proto J them, that are up yard. So you know, up yard. Yeah, but popcorn permit was popcorn permit is is for four o'clock, you know. It's that same permit. Right, you know? right, right. I, again, again, again. That's a valid argument. So I try and that, I've, I've sure. been to a new amount of, amount of um carnival events. This um tailgate that was at National Stadium is two o'clock. Two o'clock it done. But got duck work up a U up on the Aqua Field, Aqua Field, two o'clock it done. Right. Like so, there was number of carnival events that end. As a matter of fact, most of them end at two. What they do is start right, right. events much earlier. No man, no man, left them yard seven eight o'clock gonna dance. You reach a carnival uh, uh, event, right. so like it ram. Yeah, yeah, because even even at mass camp, by well, two o'clock them lock off. Exactly. And, and guess what? One now. And what police they there, everybody they there, you know, but then just risk the thing and we'll say two o'clock a lack of time. Hold on. Um let me make the reviewer say a thing because I think I get a feedback by my quote. Go to the review, let me hear what I say. Um uh, uh, regarding the whole back and all issue, um I think um in a free society, different people will like different things, right? Um and when people people complain about prejudice and whatnot without facts because you you have to look at the permit that they're that they are given Thank um you. are they honor, are, are they honoring the permit um and things like that you know versus um a, a dance scenario where are they honoring the permit as well if if a, if a dance session is given until 2, 2 a.m. Are they honoring the permit? Are they going over? You, you understand? Um, right. So, 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 um, the, the facts have to be brought to bear. And, and, and in, in, in a free society, different people will like different things. And, and Jamaicans will have to, will, will have to just be comfortable with that. And we can't cry prejudice all the time because different people like different things. Right, and, and, um, I, and, I, and um, it's not a matter of even being prejudiced, you know, because naturally the prejudice is there whether we like it or not. Naturally, I, 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 the demographic, hold on a reviewer, naturally yes. the demographic when it comes on to um, carnival, I mean, I thought about the Byron Lee, remember I said Byron Lee, them carnival was like poor people carnival, so to speak. Everybody could have party yes. for more time. The uptown carnival, back yes. and all of them sitting there, you know that go. Everything seal off. So my point is, um, those carnivals who were, were given certain privileges. Case in point, when carnival finished the Monday morning, where you see I've got the mayor must see a ball. I say him need to meet with um the organizers because the whole place is a mess. 
because clearly no one made that, arrangements to clean that, up the place. No, I'm, I'm telling you, I'll push, I have to push back on that. that. That has never been an issue. There was an overlap this year. No, no, no. That, that I, I'm, I'm not saying it, it has ever been an issue. I'm saying it happened recently. That's, that's my point. My point is, recently, right? Yeah, the last carnival, they are saying that, yeah, they mess up the whole place. That's, that's all me. I said, I never said it happened before because me, me understand how it works. You always have cleaners where, where they're behind them, probably 15 minutes behind them. I actually saw cleaners Sunday garden on, so I was shocked when I see, but obviously different. And then now people, parts. business place, they wall paint up everything too. You get what the, me the I say? The painting that, paint, the paint, the paint was an issue one year in Juve to where a lot of people complain that their business paint up. But what I'm saying is, Carnival is way, way more organized than dance hall because Carnival people are planning 8, 10, 12 months in advance. They're meeting with the different stakeholders, with their sponsors, they're this, they're that. Dance hall, I'm going to keep a show. I'll do it before I'm not getting a permit yet. So we can jump the ball, but we cry bias when these people are putting in the effort and doing the right thing. Of course, in everything, there's going to be some form of bias because, and the bias will be lean, it will be contingent to, um, well, even me as a sponsor, mm -hmm. I would more tend to sponsor a carnival event because of my brand than a dance hall event. Because you, you imagine you could, you think you could have a dance hall. I don't say it can't happen because it, of course, it can. But we could not have a dance hall event with 50, 60,000 people on the road marching and jumping and dancing with each other and fighting a broken man that gets stubborn on the <laughs> Yeah, but, yeah. but, but, uh, it, but, it but, James, man. all right, but, but you, but you, you were supposed to know. You're supposed to know who are these organizers and how powerful they are in 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 the in the private sector though. We, we, we can't go around that though. We can't go around that. No, we can't. We you can't, get what can't, me I say? So we, yeah, so the reality we, we is that can't, can't yeah, the, the reality is that you have an influence and some degree of power does um make a big difference, but at the same time, you are running your thing professionally too. So you know everything kind of tie in, we get that. But um, yeah, powerful people are these are the organizers. We we're talking about like top a top top people in 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 a private mm -hmm. sector. So you know they uh, definitely uh, um, get the brand, the brands put out and a lot powerful of people people like different things as well. You know, um, it come back to what I said. You know, and I, and I, and I think you guys are glossing over that. Like no matter how you slice and dice it, um, people like different things. And, and right. you know, and, and, and I, I, I get a prejudice argument, but let's let's um imotep. There are things that you like that I don't like. You, you know, there are things that you support that I will not support. And if we're gonna live together, we have to we have to accept that. And All I right, think. What's this now? What's this now? I can I, show I, you. I can show you prejudice in a real life. Um, listen, I know I, I am not disagreeing. Watch this now. Hold on, now, reviewer. Yes, in Monday morning, when them find the whole place dirty up, so yes, I mean, people should have been fined, they should have been fined. It shouldn't be about meeting with them because at the end of the day, um, that's a breach of them permit and a breach of the city ordinance and them something there. So at the end of the day, you forward out and I say, You want to meet with them. If I, if if are some places, you see what they them find them long time. That's the reality. I agree. I I agree. So, so, um, so we can we can deny the fact that there is some degree of prejudice there. It's naturally there. We can't go around it, but it is what it is. Okay. In comparison to I, I agree. I agree with you. Answer this I question. Uh, 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 um, uh, uh, the, uh, hold on, hold on, hold on, my brother. I don't think it's to the extent of what the internet is making it be right now. I just don't think it's to that extent where people is going on like carnival can do whatever they want in the middle of the road and dance all can't which oh no I no 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 i don't agree, agree with that and they're, no. doing it, and they're doing it without the facts no, and, and, and this carnival is the one where where because normally the carnivals them them always have the cleanup people them we're right behind them so and and I think that's why they didn't. I think that's why they never push back behind. Exactly. I, think, I, I personally think that's why they never push back on it to, to the extent because they must say, "All right, it's not like a yearly thing." Obviously, there was an overlap to them. Mm -hmm. so I could meet with them and say, "Where the overlap is coming We exactly. But if next year that happens, no, then you charge them all five million dollars. <laughs> um. No, but what you need uh, to do. Uh,
is what you need to do in the contract or in the per permit. What mm -hmm. you have, you have a refundable deposit that covers cleaning up. So a man knows about if he not clean up, he lose this deposit and make it be Good a point. sizable sum that a man will ensure that this work mm -hmm. is done. So you well, know, if you run well, by nobody with a no big stick, well, you just make sure. Say, well, 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 the well, with that, remember, remember, now you have three different bands, and and if if my band have, have my cleanup clean crew, which I saw cleanup crew on the road on, on Sunday, so when let's say Exodus just passed and them cleanup crew, because every band has their cleanup crew at the back of the band. So when the band pass, the cleanup crew is there right away clean up. But remember, most of these, all of these bands use at some point use the same route. So if Exodus pass and then Gen X pass and then Yardmas pass and Yardmas is the one. To leave the garbage behind. Exodus now then can't suffer for that. So you need a different, you know, because now Exodus will lose their money too. No, well, yeah, what you right. need now, all of those persons who are participating in it going to coordinate the cleaning up campaign. So you don't have me doing this and me doing that. We just contract one cleanup crew and then come after everybody go through. That that would be a valid response where you have one cleanup crew. But then again, these bands, you think dance all dance all not united, them band are not united. Everybody have fight cast, everybody wants to declare themselves as the biggest band. Everybody wants the rebels. Remember, no, people are selling costumes up to 2000 US. So the more people you get to buy costumes, mm -hmm. is, is the more is the more um the more money you make. So they trust me. I said if when we tell us that in-house fighting night, like, in-house fighting night, like war where they sabotage each other, this, that, rare, all kind of antics. So to get them work on even clean up crew together, wanna go on, make sure it's a theme crew in the night. So next year I wanna get no permit. You know, you know what I'm saying? There's a lot of lot of in-house fighting in it. Whole leap. And, and you know, um when we when we talk when when I hear these prejudice arguments, we don't we are not specific. Um, are we saying people, are we saying Jamaicans who are, who are non-African are prejudicing against Jamaicans who are Africans? Is that what we're actually saying? No, what they're, what they're referring to, they're referring to as card no, advisors. What's German on those lines? Card advisors are uptown thing. Are black, uh, are, black people, are, are, are black people being prejudiced against other black people? Is that what we're saying? But, oh, that's a known fact. <laughs> well, well, that's it's called class, xenophobia. Yes, um, class um, Jamaica, hold on there. Reviewer, reviewer, just look at how the Haitians are perceived and treated by the same uh, even some Jamaicans, too. When I, I know, but and, and still, hold on, let me finish now. I'm you ask you, you make a statement, may I give some example. I'm saying, uh, go ahead. the way Haitians are treated and they are looked at, yes, that is xenophobia. Yeah, but 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 uh, but uh, are you are you actually saying black people uptown are discriminating against black people downtown? Yes. What? That no, happened. No, no, yes. hold on. I don't want to know that because we're not talking about black people uptown like that. No, no but we're talking about is a more of a class. But that's my, yeah, but, it's a but, class. Hold on, I'm but, general. Like upper. Hold on, no, that's a mention. Private sector. Hold on, no. Reviewer. Hold on, no, man. That's a I'm frustrated element. because you know we you know we need to be specific. Well, on, man, but listen to me, General. I said private sector, so what is more specific I need to say about that? Yeah, yeah it must be. I, 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 I didn't go into any racial classification. I, I dealt with but status the, and positions. But, well, but, 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 but the racial undertones are there. No, well, on, no. <laughs> no, it's just, well, on, man. That's we great. said private that's sector. That's we said that's private that's sector. That's and it doesn't matter if you want to put any racial undertone to it. The reality is. I said private sector. So now you are turning it in a black mm. man uptown. Well, that, that's that's the reasoning there. Yeah, no, but, 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 but I want to know the uh, but, but I want to know the people involved. I want Bro, to know the people who are discriminating. You can who, who, who is who is discriminating? Carnival people has not said anything. Uh, 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 no, no, no. Hold on, hold on, hold on, reviewer. Hold on, hold on, hold on, James Bond. We yeah. were talking about prejudice and preference. Yes. It wasn't yes. a yes. discrimination argument. So I don't want you to I know. Us. Well, I know. I know, please. but... Hold on, I'm a general. Please. <laughs> I'm, I'm, you don't I'm want saying. me to finish. Hold on, no. Hold on, no. I'm saying 
this is not a discrimination conversation it is more like a preferential prejudice conversation that's where it's at it's I not get a discrimination. It. so no but you are framing the argument as a discrimination one I am not doing it. I, 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 um, I want to get to the root because we are not going to be stupid here and we are not going to be, be obtuse. Most people who are in that carnival, they are either 100% non-black or they are heavily light-skinned. Hmm. Um, I, 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 not I, true. I, no, that's not true. Come on, come on. That's not true. That's not true. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. I'm going to run first thing. Way I try to say that is that um, light skinned Jamaicans are less Jamaicans than darker skinned Jamaicans. That's what you're inferring, right? Uh, uh, that's not what I'm inferring. I am inferring that the, the, um, the old prejudice argument that. The, uh, hold on, let me finish. Um, I, I, I accept that if you live in a country, different people like different things. So the old prejudice argument, I never use it. But what, what, I, what I'm trying to say is that. Um, we never name the people who are doing the prejudicing and there's always a, a racial undertone that is never brought to the fore and i just want to bring it to the fore and, and when i look on carnival hold on hold on when i look when i look on carnival when i look on carnival the maj um when what i see on tv maybe in the background is different but, but, but mm -hmm. we, we, we're not going to be obtuse um when i look on tv the majority of who i see reveling they are either 100 percent non-black or they are mixed race no, 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 this no. is uh, a fact no well i mean yeah but but, but <laughs> physically well, a car, i'm physically bring, bring to a carnival yes and you are you still hold the same thing that most of the people, yes, yes. people no, yeah. I, I can't agree with him that's crazy he, all right, all right. No, what but, is but, Jason? But, Jason? But, you see, if he did say 60, um, 60, 40, or probably 70, 30, probably look at that, so all right, cool. But once he must say 100% and them something, there, them numbers they can't make no sense. No, you know no, 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 I did not say, I, I did not say 100%. I said the majority. Yeah, you know what you should have said? You should have said that the minority that has the most influence on that culture is what you perceive to be the representative of light skinned Jamaica. And it, it's it's not a racial um, conversation either. It's exactly. a socio-economic conversation. So we don't want to turn it into a racial conversation. We're talking about no, the, but 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 my friend, power. we have to be honest. But we have to What's be honest, and we're not so honest. What is honesty? We're the, uh, we're talking the, about we're talking uh, about um, dancehall and uh, um, let, let, uh, um, you ask and you ask and let me explain. Um, dancehall is a black um a, a black people thing. Where? Not true. Where? 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 Not, Jamaica? not true. Um, Where? So it's only black uh, Jamaicans um, they call Jamaicans then? I asked you that already, you know? No. It's only black um, Jamaicans you they are, call you, Jamaicans? You, you, are, you are asking the... You are, you, you are asking the wrong person that I am the one who started that saying I have no problem with the old carnival issue, but the people who are bringing up the old bias and prejudice thing, they, they need to put all their cards on the table. And that happens all but, the time at carnival. The carnival so. people is not, but, but, but the carnival but, people but it's not a it discrimination and a racial thing. Though. Though. It's not the carnival people being, bringing it up on because the other the other set of people. I know. Say the carnival is getting preferential treatment, and I go, I, I lose it. Hold on, hold on. I lose. Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. I lose it to the fact that until they can present both contracts with both timings on it. And one is allowed to go further than one, or whatever the case may be. That's when I can say, okay, cool. There is significant bias towards not, that song or carnival. But up until not that, only, not only that, James. You but, and uh, I are in the same wait, boat. You wait, and wait, I are second. in the same boat. One, one second, one second. Even if they have a strong bias, because that is what they like. <laughs> that is I, agree. Piece, but, 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 I agree. I agree. But, but not only That's that. Not racially but remember, not. <laughs> the carnival cannot operate without the sponsors. The sponsors put a lot and a lot and a lot of money in it. And when, when you sponsor an event or anything, you're looking for mileage for your brand and to grow your brand. And if dancehall does not suit what you're looking for in your brand or way to represent your brand the right way, why would you put your money in it? And that is not on the sponsors. That's on the dancehall because you're not of organized. Course. You're not organized. 
you promote certain things, thir- you're, if you go to a certain event, you go to, they're likely for an incident to happen. When you have carnival going with thousands, there's no kind of, there's no dance hall event in Jamaica bigger than carnival. And you don't have the type of incidents that you'll have happen at dance hall events. So That's why would I, as a red stripe, or as a campfire, as an international brand, or KFC or whatever the case is. A lot of those sponsorship is yes by relationship as well as as well. I can't elude that. That's why well. heard and said the bias is warranted. <laughs> exactly because when you call Tina <laughs> to say yeah, I'm going to sponsor the band. She'll more come than I'm gonna call her to come sponsor annually first. Which I I, I totally agree with you. But 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 um, but um I, I totally agree. If people uptown want to have their back and all the carnival, I am with that. Different people like different things. However, the people who constantly bring, bring up this bias and this prejudice, they, they need to put their cards on the table. I, I mean, they, um, they are not being honest about what about they're, they're, their what true intentions in bringing it up. So, so, all right, so hold on there. Hold on there, James, man. So, um, reviewer, what do you think is the true intention? Are the true intentions? Mm-hmm. Um, the true intention is that um, Jamaicans who are 100% non-black or they are mixed race are being prejudiced against jamaicans who are 100 percent black that's, that's the issue true. that's not true no 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 well, it's not the regular bringing up the well, bias. I know. Well, well, well i know reviewer well, well, well i know reviewer you're not going to use a craft and frame the argument you know? mm. right i am not yeah. framing the argument well, i want well, people well, to put well, their cards well, on the well, table well on well on you're throwing out some some wild numbers no statistics no facts just a conspiracy you got in there. We can't do that, my general. We no reason so. Exactly. And I'm not seeing one rebeller come on the internet or where and I say, boy, we're not being treated as old dance on the street. Him is can't tell dance, you that. Is it dance on the advi- general? Are the dance on advocates, advocates are coming on social media and different blogs and in the papers and all kind of something I talk about how they treat carnival based on how they treat dance hall. Yeah, it, yeah. It, no, I agree. That, I agree. Hold on. No, on, yeah, on, 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 on I agree. Hold on, brother. Hold on, man. man. In in the same week as Carnival, there was dance all week going on. There was no promotion. Nobody hear about it. Nobody they, they, so not because somebody come forward and put the, the necessary stuff in place and put the time and effort in them, in them craft to make. You, did you know that they start? They already started making design for costumes for next year already. They are costumes yeah, yeah. Every, like every year, every year, every year. As I go and buy. Yeah. Yes, yeah, so, man. That's, yeah, man. so that's what I'm saying. When these people put the time and effort in, yes, I will never sit here and say there's absolutely no bias. Of course, there's some selective bias. Of course, it's a relationship. Jamaica is, and, and a True. Whole is a relationship driven country. So when the dance hall promoter might go to a certain private sector for a sponsorship, where they'll be hesitant to give it to them, a carnival person, whether by friendship or relationship or whatever, will have more easier access to that person where you can say, yo, Come sponsor my thing or uh, whatever, whatever. And they will, will be way less, less reluctant to because of the element of carnival. It's a fun, whatever, whatever they say they're having. They hardly have any incident going on at, at, a, at a soca event. And I see soca, there are a thing called so- I love soca down by you. I've been going for years. Every time it keeps 20,000 people. And I don't say it never happened, but I have never yet witnessed a fight or hear about a fight. Never. Right, right. Um, no, no, no. You're not really. You're um, not like that still. Exactly. So I a have brand the proof. Be t- a brand I have the proof. Like that. Yeah. All right. I go have the proof. proof. Um, no. um, go go the proof, yes, and watch. Uh, um, go and watch Oral Tracy's reason he gave as to why he does not like Carnival. He Hold brought on. up so classism and he, and he brought up on. colorism. Well, on, man. Man well, like, yeah, so that, that is a that primary source. Opinion. That's a primary source for, for validate your argument is a hypothetical anecdotal statement by a commentator. I'm coloring. Emotep. Yes. Emotep. Yeah. I, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna I, I'm I'm gonna you're a very intelligent brother. Um hear my point. I do not have a problem with carnival. I you believe can't. in a free society. Hold on, hold on, let me finish. Because, because I, I, um, I, am, I, I am in agreement with you guys. Um, I believe that in a free society, different people like different things. But, but I, I, my, argue, my, my argument is for the people who constantly complain about the bias and the prejudice. 
Um, they must be they, they, um, they, they are not being honest about what they're complaining about. But, you, hold on, me, General. You just you keep on saying that what probably the fifth time you have said the same thing. Mm -hmm. I remember when me asked you, <laughs> you went into some reddering muddy and up the waters kind of reasoning. So me I said, no. We never go in at a racial thing. It's not a racial conversation. It's a it's a social construct. No, but hold on no, no, hold on no hold on you're general. wrong. Hold on, let me get that point. In hold on, please. You are arguing that dance hall is quote unquote downtown, carnival is uptown, so it's brown. uptown versus downtown, brown versus black, whatever, whatever. No, no, no I am not arguing that. I am not arguing hold that. On, general. Hold on, we do understand the history of dance hall and the sound system, and oh, certain music the radio now play it because the radio would and cater to only. Uptown people and call dance all boogie yaga music or whatever, whatever. We mm -hmm. get that, but right now, yeah, it's not a racial conversation. Not only that, to my brother, I, I, wait, 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 I wait. agree. Wait, no, my brother, <laughs> yeah, yeah, go long, you know. yeah, go long. Wait a second. Not only that, you are drawing up some very basic lines as it would explain a very complex, um, strata or, or divisions in our society. First thing. Uptown don't carry necessarily straight brown, and downtown don't necessarily carry straight black. That's the next thing where you, you, you can't mix up that into like that, that, that is just a black and white thing. Like, say, once you're uptown and you're rich, you're brown, and once you're downtown and you're poor, you're, you're dark skin. Not no work, so in a Jamaica, Zin. black, black, black light. I am in 100% agree with you. You are muddying up I, the water. I, 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 with your no, I am not. I, I am not. I, 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 no, no. You, 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 I, I'm, I, I am in agreement with you. What I'm saying is that the people who keep on bringing up this prejudice argument, they must put all their cards on the table. No, but uh, hold on. Let, you, let, said, let, you said it's the sixth time now. Hold so on, hold on, man. Let me, let, me hold on, let me give him this one. Say, 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 yeah, 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 man, because it's sixth time I, in I, I was at the I was at the I was at the pro today show last in time. And trust come on, me, man. Come on, man. This, this, that is one of the, that's one of the big dance hall events I've seen the most white people in Jamaica at the protege, protege event. And they are also complaining about carnival getting permits or whatever. So your argument don't hold no water. Like the protege show, when you say white people, they say, like, whoa, okay, this is what we're going to come out for. And this is what they come out for. But, 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 um, but, but, but again, you must you, you you must not direct that argument to me. You must direct that argument to the people who are talking about prejudice. But is you bring it up? And, the, I'm, the, saying to, and I'm saying to you, no, it's but, not carnival people talking about prejudice. No, it's the handsome people, carnival people. Have yes, a yes, I know. I, I I know. And the dancehall people who are bringing it up, that's what it, that's what they mean. That's what all they right, mean. So, they right, so, mean. All right, so 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 <laughs> reviewer. All right, so what is yes. You, you keep on harping on it, <laughs> right? So I, no. and I know where you're going to, right? Yeah, because definitely it got to Mr. Vegas, but watch this now. You know, I would rather be, be really harp on it when he's here so he can speak for himself too. Because me, me know uh, after you have said certain things, I may sound like an apologist. You get what I say? But the argument yes. is, it doesn't matter who you want to say, I put the argument there and then need to declare them and it is not a racial argument. It, it is, is not about a, a discrimination yes, based it, on race. Yes, hold it on, is. No. It hold is. No, hold on, no. you are trying to frame <laughs> it that way. But at the end of the day, that's not what it is. You know, oh, my God. Uh, okay. Uh, I'm, I'm, but I'm, 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 Last time, Mr. Vegas said, Mr. Vegas said, he, he wanted to make a video. He wanted to do a video on it, too. And he was like, yo, next year, I got a carnival. Because so much people are jumping and enjoying themselves. And now I go hang out there. Nobody not fight. Nobody not. Mr. Yes. I don't know. I walk down and jump on the road. And nobody not try to pick him pocket. Um, but they are duck work. You see both of them. Chris Gale. Everybody out there, man. But they are, but they are duck work. I'm about to set up the whole night. And I'm going to dance the soak. And nobody not do nothing. Nobody not run up and run up come. To take no picture, Mr. Russia and them, they miss everybody there, and everybody just having a good time. So it's just the vibe why it bring where all it is doing is shining the light over dance hall and I say, Yo, fix up with it. That's all it's doing, shine the light over there. So, all right, people, this is it's Jamaica all over there, and we can congregate in large numbers, and we can get sponsors behind us, and we can put on world class events because even the decor of them of carnival when you saw them set up a carnival event you're not going to know dance hall events outside of a sun fest because the people put that type of energy and time and effort into making a, an event presentable you got one dance hall event or some sheet type on a piece of zinc 
people are doing them kind of something there. So all carnival is doing, you know, is shining the light in the dance hall and say, yo, fix up with thing. Come. This is our thing. Fix it up. That's all it I do. I 100 percent agree with you, James Bond. But um um I 100 percent agree with you. I'm in total agreement, but but um <laughs> you know, um I don't think oral Trace's view is is um limited to him. I don't think it is. Yeah, but I, I don't think it is hold on Remember I know that's his personal um perception, opinion, commentary. So you can generalize it and make it absolute. That's just the reality I know. as well. But I am saying that Ora Trace's view um he's one of he's one of the he's one of the few um in his camp who is willing to be honest when he when, when he said he does not like soccer and he gave the reason he said he, he said you don't like he doesn't like carnival he said that the beat is um you know monotonous he said, yeah, but you that's know, his, that's, review, uh, that's, his, yeah, that's his opinion, his perception. It's not absolute. And it's not a review. Review. Uh, 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 yeah, hold on, R, R, man. Hold on, I'm in general. Remember, Imotep, Imotep, Imotep. Hold on, the review. Imotep, Imotep. Can you answer? Can you answer this question? I want to ask you a question. Yeah, go to Of the people who are. Uh, um, are you gonna to, are you gonna completely? Uh, um, I, I am almost forty years old now. I, I've I've been around Jamaicans all my life. Are you gonna completely deny that th 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 there isn't a fraction of these people who um view carnival through a racial lens? But what are you going? Are you going to deny that? Are you going to deny that? Well, no, 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 and I have no, and that's not the argument either. <laughs> you get what I mean? I said, no, the but argument. It's there. No, well, I'm a general, as me I said, Jamaica's <laughs> a melting pot. Has always been a no, melting come pot. Right? Well, no, no. Well, reviewer, <laughs> please just hold on. Let's maintain some decorum, right? Okay. I am saying it doesn't matter where you want to take the reasoning. This. The context of this argument is not a racial one. You get what I'm saying? So I uh, so you might want to strong arm the reason and try to carry it over the racial thing, racial thing, racial thing. No, it's not a racial thing right now. When it comes on to carnival, it's very diverse. You have a lot of um, powerful black men who are involved in it, a lot of powerful black men in the private sector. You know, yeah, it's all, different now. It's, it's not like, it's it's not ten, like 30 all, it years ten. ago. All the you bands know, are owned by black men. All three major <laughs> bands are owned by black men. You know. I know them personally. It's three black men. Black, right. groups, of, black groups of men who own right. the band. You know. All three of them. Yeah, so it it say, um, but, I, all right. So, so hold on. Eh. Hold on. Eh. Uh, I am. Um, hold on, reviewer, man. Hold on, man. Um, See, RR. I try to say a thing from how long still. So go to RR. Let me hear what I say. We may have to say it's totally different from Carnival. You see, up to this program here, it is even a biased program. This program where you see me up on right now is a very biased program. I started to listen to this program about, about a month now. And there is so many people. Um, I, I might not know them by name. But he's most like a six panel person, a more privilege on this program. Just him like more chance to talk, more chance to put them word across, more than even me. Be treated on this program like one go calf out. We just have to tell you also up to the program. This program is even biased hold on this program. Hold on, hold on, stick up in, hold on. So you are saying that that's the way you feel? Yes, man. Look it oh, up. Yeah, so yeah, man. Hold on. Okay. So what makes you feel that way, though? Then listen up. Yeah, man. Me see, this is Vegas. We are company program, you know, and in get a free chance to talk and talk, come back, talk and all these things. Let me no, tell I'm you something. Talking about you. Hold on, man. Then, hold then, on, then, hold then, on. Then look it up. Then hold they are referring to me. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Um, yeah, I'm talking about you and me not talk about Mr. Vegas, all right? So, make me the, 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 allow me to speak. We cannot over talk each other. 
for your command in, in a 10 second time you want over talk and that's our reason you have to wait your turn to a lot of people come on the panel and then wait all five ten minutes before them say a thing not because you come on that means say in 10 wait, seconds sometimes you have to, wait a, half exactly hour, and that's how it go so you <laughs> can just one on the man and as me i say you have to maintain the quorum to me general you can't just run up on a panel, a reason a flow, and in 10 seconds you want to interject and say a thing. You just make a man finish in point. You will get your time to speak. When you're in an ears, so you make it look like an ears you're in or something like that. So me I say is that don't use that to gaslight and appeal to authority. If you come on the panel to say something to the reasoning, you say it to the reasoning. If you come to get personal, just um just click the exit and just tear out. Simple as that. So if yeah, you have something to contribute right. to the reasoning, I guess so we get we not get the personal thing because personal you are going Stick to the look, you know. The, the what I'm saying to you now, you know, that's the way you know operating. You know. Certain people is okay to be personal, you know. But, but you general, see, certain well, no man, you may say no, you may say no, make we stick to the information. If you come to talk about the information, make we talk about what we are talking about. But you see the personal thing and the feelings thing, first thing first, um, me know. Oh, nobody no obligation. Nobody no owe me none. People are free to access the panel anytime they want. The problem is sometimes the, the man never go on like say them to just run on and take the mic and just run gone. If you can't stay upon the panel for 1, 20, 30 minutes, they might as well know say the reason at not don't bother try checking them. Because the reason I got at and you want to interject same time. As if say a race, yeah, a race go somewhere. If you, if you plan to come on the panel, you plan to stay if one ten minutes or so, and you make your point and you cut. So I just saw the panel run. So what I say is that I don't want you to come on now and, and I turn it in a personal thing. If you have a, um, a reason to say, make your point. But watch this now. You know how long you want to check in on the platform, but you have a problem with people on the platform. No, my general, we no reason so. The, the what about you were on the program? The, the, the program pan a buyer by pan a level play field that like everybody can. Hold on, can RR. Hear me say no. Hear me say RR. Me done say so, what you already and so we you you don't say up. so you're done say if you say look you know RR no, stay far from the program then. No, That's saying, it. No, hold on. It's my platform respectfully, and you are free to either come on the platform or not. But what I'm saying is. I am not here to entertain a personal thing because I don't, I'm not here to appeal to anyone's emotions or feelings. So I am saying we are going to be speaking about the music or the information and not about a personal thing. It's irrelevant. It's irrelevant, my general. Everybody can check in and stay as long as they want. We go for five, six, seven hours and you are complaining about other people when in the pan panel. Family, that's irrelevant, man. Come on, man. That's irrelevant. I don't know why that I bring up for. I'm going to add my two cents to it. Yeah, you got you. Because we don't know if we fall in another category there of him perceived as being favored or being discriminated against. But either way, for him, that um, what to, to how I perceive the platform, everybody is allowed to, to come and give them input and give them perspective, whether or not it's supported by facts or it's is a wild guess, guess to make them making our it's just wild arguments them throwing out there. It's going to be challenged for those who people who don't feel like them supported by the platform. Most likely is the people that coming up here with baseless arguments where the moment it open up, them open them out. It's going to be challenged, to be honest with you. So if you if that you may draw that perception that people is aggressive towards you or call you down and it's a personal thing, but to be honest with you, for me personally. I just challenging what I believe is, is false or not accurate to how I know what is being said around here. That's but, all. But I don't know any, anybody personally, and I don't have any kind of discriminatory feelings towards any, any person. But black light, black mm -hmm. light, don't pay, don't pay RR no mind, man. You see, a, a feelings thing RR I deal with for whatever reason, I don't know. Because first thing first, you there regularly, um, black light. When last you see RR, James man, when last them man they check in? Look how long. You know how long they managed to check in, James Van? I, I true. And then the man have problem with who they the panel attack and them something down and say with bias and them something that, that can make sense to you. So him I watch the platform, him now calling, and him want to say the panel bias because 
You will not allow others to talk, but you not call in. There be no group of people having a conversation where everyone get equal to the to the second time. Some people is gonna have more to say. Some people is gonna take longer to make them point. Some people right. are just are just, just sort of things go. And if I am having a and if I'm making a point or answering a question, where do you check in? Of course, the next person is allowed to answer your question or to rebut on the question. You can right. check in a year point in the middle. And because look, we're having a good reasonable carnival, and I'm sure it off completely. Right, but the funny thing just is, you know, yes, man. man. Ten, well, five seconds when the man check in, the man try interject. I mean, I say, hold on. So the man couldn't even wait. But at the same time, him get him, him take about five minutes for a talk about some little personal feelings thing. That, that That's weird, brother, man. Come on, man. You know, do you think so, man? Yeah, minute, I, I YouTube this, man. You know, that's serious, brother, man. That's why I tell the man, them say, them for work with emotional intelligence, brother. You get what I say? YouTube this man. Nobody not know nobody. It's not that serious. So anybody who are overthought nobody are the passion and the zeal and it's organic reasoning. I just saw that go more time. I just reasoning. It I got more time. But we respect each other the same way. We not have to, we not have to agree. So that's the organic nature of the conversation, opposing views. But we are going to deal with it on an intellectual level. So at the end of the day, my general, we not have the time for the personal things, man. Invest. Yeah, yeah, man. Go to my general. What do you have to say? Intelligence is a is the processing power that allow you to find wisdom and factual knowledge. I I completely, um. I completely reject the premise that that brother make earlier. This platform actually a good platform, and and you know people just want to come and say something negative towards something but, positive. You know. Right. Let's get, let's get back to it, to it, to the argument and make this choice talk. And it's a true of this. It's a true of the argument. So let we get back to our our, our, our discussion was. Yeah. Yeah, man, right. I, I, thought here, so. with, I thought he was well, coming I mean, to with, with a great point in terms of bias. Because I'm like bias. I'm like, all right, cool. Let me hear what what from a yeah, different right. perspective. All right, let me interject right here, so now. All right, the argument with Don Sal and Soka. All right. What I see over the years, and is this, Soka have made itself a product where businesses want to attach themselves to it. So it automatically get that promotion. You go have a cleaner sponsor, you go have a Sanders sponsor, you go have all kind of sponsor because the product that they put out give that level of what people want in businesses wanting to attach themselves to it. Dancehall on the other hand, don't give that. And what we have in Dancehall is this individual system. Sound system by themselves, producer by themselves, artists by themselves, dancers by themselves. There is not a collective of entrepreneur who say, look, or one, or one objective is entertainment and we have a farm and organization and promote this product yeah but there's jams right and java and them something there, right right mm -hmm. and every one of these things are individual you need a structure no 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 Where... i mean java and jams i wouldn't say it's individual though it's it's a collective i just that more people need to be a part of it but it's a collective thing you know right so you need the color in other words then when say for instance every segment at the dance hall jam are an organization supposed to represent it so you know have this individual i try to do this for himself that individual i try you have the structure of the organization will help it because rich people from uptown unless it's a producer or something them now go promote dance hall because most of the thing coming out of dance hall are not things that they want to attack touch themselves on unless a Grammy award is being given to a, a music and unless the people who are involved in dance hall realize this limitation and know that look we are going to have to be the promoters and the producers of this and throw our money from and get our organization up to a level where we can promote a road march just like all the Big people gonna do it, and if they don't reach that stage where them take out the individual out of it, we're gonna always be having this level of conversation. Right. I remember. I remember. Um. Even like early 2000, 99, 2000. Yeah, you saw about street dance. Um. In Panotswad Boulevard. Yeah, understand me. I say. 
That used to go uh, on. That uh, was like a dance hall thing to one, you know? Yeah. Right. Um, and that was when, a um, hold on, guys. Let me say this real quick. People, for the record, um, the general, when he RR, he left on his own volition, you know? It's not like I mean, he remove him or nothing like that because I don't have no problem with what he must say. Me just know, say, this is YouTube and me really not have the time for the feelings reasoning. You get what I say? So at the end of the day, if you check in, yeah, man, you just contribute to the reason. If you want to challenge somebody's argument, you check in and you challenge them. I want to square off intellectually. I will see what makes sense and what makes sense. Now, no time for the personal thing in general. Um, um, go to the, um, go to the um, reviewer and then Lion Man. When, say, I, I, um, I think that um, Jar Simit, you know, he made a very good point about the content of dance hall um, and its limitations. And over the years, when you point out to dance hall practitioners and the people who love it that look, um, the, the, the content of, of, of the lyrics, it is, it is not palatable to, 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 to um, people who are outside. You know, most of the time, it's not going to go past Nama Mali Airport. And, and what you hear is that um, left the youth alone, them eat a food, and they might get to youth, uh, they might make money, and, and, and you know, and, and you know they, they sing about the infam of the dead and and you know um the under woman in a very vulgar manner and, and all hold of on, that and you know scamming and 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 you know hold on R R R R hold on 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 hold Muddying up the waters and conspiracy this and that and them something there. Yeah, man, we're not gonna do that, you know. We're gonna talk about what is there, what is public knowledge, what can be proven. Cause them say, yeah, man, there's no way you know a way you can prove. So we're not gonna muddy up the waters right now. So you see, when they get the mic, yeah, man, please just make use of it. So what's this now? SD, you know, it's a lion man the day and I hold the fourth stage. All right, so All right man, can go to and then you after. So go to lion man. Yeah, but my brother is better than the finish still. Yeah, yeah, no problem, no problem. And hold the thought, you know, and res respond to him. But as me, I say, man, we um, I, 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 I wasn't as done, as well. I, I, I wasn't done, I wasn't done. Yeah, yeah, all right, um, but, I was, but, all right, all right. No, um, but we go on, we review. No, we have yes. to stop it. So, no, you can't say it wasn't done, but yeah, muddy up the waters and I go in a conspiracy. And I'm saying, right. no, no. Uh, um, no, that, that, uh, oh, okay. General, um, well, no, we're not going any further with that. When you say once you start muddy up the waters, we're not going any further. I am with not. That. I am not. Mo I am not muddy up the water. Just yes, point well, out well, the content of dance hall. No, he but, pointed well, out the content George, of dance hall and has been marketed properly. He didn't point out anything. No, anything. he he he. he, he uh, ask him. Ask, ask him. He, he, he talked about the content and the content is not palatable to uh, um, corporate um, corporate um, um, Jamaica. But not because he said that's, that's, that's not that's not what George said. All right, make him land in my tech. Make him land on the suit. All right, so go to no. one land review and then Lion Man can say No, but, 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 no, 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 but, but, but what am I, what, what I'm saying is that, um, I'm, I'm agreeing with Josh Smith and said that um, the, the content of dance hall might, might be the reason why they don't get the type of sponsorship that they should get. That, that, that's all I was saying. And, and when people point out the, the, the lyrical content and, you know, the crowd that it, um, you know, attracts, you know, that carp, carpet Jamaica might not want to be associated with, um, you, you get pushed back, you know, that, that, that they must be left alone, you know, allow them to eat food, they get to youth, so... Um, th th that's what I was basically saying. The, all of, you know, all of what I'm saying is, is you know, are facts. So th th that's it. Yeah, yeah. But but um, but um, at the end of the day, you, you're talking about they should be left alone. I mean, they eat them food. So clearly, you're speaking about the the the, the younger generations, them, right? No, um, no. I, I am saying what? that people, pe that's people, people when, on, you, no. when you criticize the content, uh, hold on now. That statement that you made a while ago, yes. when you said they should be left alone and make them yes. eat them food, you are referring to the younger generation, right? No, I, I am referring then to the who people are you referring who to? Who are you referring are, to? 
Um, you are Carolyn Cooper at the University of the West Indies who, who defend dance hall. Um, no, um, who you're referring to? She gets. Well, I'm a review. Well, I'm a review. Well, I'm a review. Well, I'm a review. We can't handle about the place in general. Well, I'm a man. This is the reason. We can't. Yeah, who you're referring to? When they just say we are so well, I got Carolyn Cooper. And I have nothing to do with my question. Because you talk about we are talk about dance hall. You talk about. The, the content of us is a dance hall again, soccer thing. Um, right, right. Are you not, yeah, not about yeah, the content? And, and content and music, because if you listen to the content of soccer music, compared to yeah, dance hall, so my dance hall song, I practice my practice in terms of slackness. Yeah, it's not that. Well, me, 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 me make Lion Man say a thing to you, know, because you know it got to you. Know. Go to Lion Man, quick and fast, there, and SD after. Yeah, man, bless you. May I make this quick and fast? Yeah, man, big up. Um, the, the, give thanks to all of the people in the panel and bless up yourself in my tip for, yeah, the, man, for the, the, the food oh, time. Um, I'm saying to all of the people who call in, there's no panel without a moderator and I have to respect the moderator. It's a message. Period. And the moderator is the one that uh, um, steer the thing because even in a church, yeah, the pastor is a shepherd. You know what I mean? But let me get to my point. I remember the first time I me, 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 me go up on sound system, it was a sound name, Wild Passion Disco. And the man bring me up, uh, the uptown people, um, and the man I play play Calypso. And I tell you the truth, the people um, we listen to Calypso from now till daylight. You understand me? Now, the thing is now, when we realize with dance all, you see, if the man them where 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 wouldn't come in at the dance hall come cars ruption and them something there they wouldn't give a stigma pan dance hall music make the uptown people them start get curious about it it's the best say if the man them can just make the dance hall run nice as though it's supposed to be because you know it, it, the dance hall music help woolly pagetto youth it's the best say and Byron Lee and Jaganiers are the first man who come in at Jamaica and put Calypso up on the forefront in us way with them them do it professionally and marketably. We don't have nobody if we do dance all like how Byron Lee do Calypso. You see me I say? We don't have nobody if you look for and say boy, that man there are the man where really and truly put dance hall upon the market and that is why I fake dance hall. We don't have nobody for market dance hall like oh Calypso they get market in the genesis of the, in a Jamaica. You see me I say so no we there as a debate and I say boy well, we dance hall I go ray ray cause when you when you check it you know you see reggae music and dance hall then put a ceiling for it in America you know? and it's like when we say you put a ceiling, they come like it in a little box and you can't go over the ceiling. They call dead sex, not dancehall. Dead sex. No, well, you see, the, 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 the reason why they give it dancehall you know, are because of the music come from reggae music. You know what I mean? It's like dancehall of the sun are, are reggae. You know what I mean? And it's like it, it, it more for the ghetto you them we just can just come up with a, a lyrics and put it on a reading that was then but i'm talking about now it's called then the sex. same thing now man. No, the same man. Thing no, now. Man. It can be. yeah when, when you hear my talk about sex and 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 all of them something there that's because the, that's not this all when you're talking about then so back then mm. like i'm lying man i will on i, I reason yeah well so like i i, I just chill here call it up on lion man yeah yeah <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah you know, wifey. You know, it's a wifey. <laughs> you know, easy, no. <laughs> no, no, my bad, my bad. I apologize for that. It's no, man, nothing no wrong, man. I saw it sometimes still. <laughs> you can interject because, you know, no. she, she, she's not from Jamaica, so she she can give her fair perspective. And I like say, me I deal with a Jamaican way. Them I go be, um, like, say, boy, yo, me I defend dancers. Me I talk about somebody outside of the box where I yeah. look. So that doesn't mean we don't know they're different, you know. No, I know. I that's... listen to Levy. I listen to what you mean. You know, I understand me. May I tell you, say, you, your perspective is very much right 100%. Now, this, this hole that we listen to is not dance hole, it's called dance sex. 
this was dance hall, like back then, oh, when I... my father used to listen to dance hall, it was a different vibe. Like you listen to like, you know, like struggle. You listen to like, you know, like redemption. You listen to like, you know, things that make sense. Right now, if you listen to any dance hall song, it's like you listen some to somebody that's having sex. Simple and period. Well, yes. um, well, the thing is, you know, the dance hall is a bigger genre than what a lot of people experience while overseas as well. Because a lot of songs were local and were dominant local, but they never cross over or were never being played in the, you know, in North American station. So, you know, um, I think a person's experience over this side of dance hall, it's, 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 it's not the entire reflection of what dance hall is and what it has been. So I do understand that, yeah, the standards might drop and the content might drop and stuff like that. But, you know, the dance hall that they experience, especially in North America, is not the entire reflection of dance hall, you know? Trust me. Um, the, yeah, That's dance hall culture. Dance hall culture where sound system are playing, people go and, you know, tunes, big selector, three, four, right. five selector and stuff like yeah. that, you know, is, is a whole different experience it's as well. Too, so. You listen to Hot 97 and 105.1. Yeah, but that's what I'm saying. But those are the songs. Those are the songs that, um, quote, unquote, crossed over. So, yeah, you will know those popular ones, but there are many more that were dominant locally that you guys never heard. So that's that's just my point, you know. Imotep, Imotep, I can say something to you. I yeah, play man. one of reception Saturday night gone. And me see a boom snan, me a juggling and the girl in my dance and thing. And me see a, I'm, I'm, I'm a download some, some of the nowadays music. Like some, some um, Valiant and some, you know, Malidan mm. and thing. And so when I go to boom snan, I draw the Valiant uh, where them tell me to play and, and the Malidan. Me and my man say, Yo, some picnic at the dance, you know. Then, and when I look, I me me say, no picnic. <laughs> right. The big man I tell me, say, yo, stop playing them there. Oh, got you, got you. Yeah, because, yeah, because, yeah, because member say, you know, member say lion, man. That's why, as me, I say, certain music is a certain um, demographic of people as well. Because Malidan, them, and Pablo YG, them, and Silk Boss, Joshi, them, Skeng, Craft, them. <laughs> You know, yeah, Nigeria, them, Raja Wild, them, the skipper, them, Yo, I mean, the I mean, of them, a younger generation, so I understand that still. So that's normal still. Um, so, Immortent, the question oh, I'm asking yeah, you, yeah. To you on Blacklight, why is it, what, what you, why you think the um, corporate Jamaica is more lenient to or tend to support um, Carnival over Dancehall? I, I think one the organizers of Carnival, especially the Bacchanal, um, are very influential private sector people, well connected and you know know people. It, it's it's a network. I mean, I understand a business anyways, because the whole them are business people. You know, man who own, you, you don't know a thing God. Them thing no normal and them name no normal neither. So in terms of them being business people and things like that, I think that does foster an environment of confidence where. Corporate get on board as always. So relationships. You know, I'm I'm sorry, SD. No, I said relationships. It, it, yeah, 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 yeah. It's about networking as well, you know. And you, you don't know anything. A corporate, real and every them are get involved. Everybody are get involved, you know. So that's just the reality when it comes to the carnival thing. I think the dance hall, the dance hall has has been stigmatized. That's the reality as well. You know, it has been deemed to be very um toxic and counterproductive towards society. As it relates to um, you know, moral um engagement or moral understanding. So I understand that part there. But when you look at um carnival, carnival does have the network in there, and you know, it's a lot of influential people that just come together and, and then just make it work. And you know, it is always a good carnival. This one was a surprising piece. Yeah, got to SD. So why is that corporate can come behind dancehall music just the same way that they come behind um carnival because the product and, and, because and the product the product that yeah who's that um judge but, check your yeah, mic right again, so, what, yeah. what, what product i said the product that dancehall is selling nobody don't want it to buy all right when you say the product like what what do you mean dancehall on a whole 
what we're selling. Well, our... Who is that to play music? George, come on, man. Well on, man. Sorry, yeah. sorry, sorry, sorry. Yeah, you can't Here play music, please, bro. You, you no, man, sorry, sorry. sorry. Is that not yeah, like, so, uh, like, like, like here I said, um, dance or music too, too, too X rated for carnival. That's what you mean, like, right? no, not just not just the, the carnival, no, that, 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 that carnival, music. Than that. Well, like, yeah, I some answer, no? not just the music, yeah. just the package on a whole, the everything surround, everything surrounding it. Like, like, what, give me, give me some, give me some example, like, like, just what, more violent. More violence more... Go on and one any anything anything at all where a crowd is gathering, the main concern is safety. And if people don't safe, they are uh, not coming to your event. Alright, hold on, hold on. I'm, all right, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna cut you. Stay right there, so all right. Me live no around the family with carnival, right? Every every year when carnival keep right, you know the people who come out for, for carnival all across the road, which is what? Rima, jungle. Everybody don't this are come out, right? With um, it depends on which carnival they, they come out. To, they, they come out to watch. They're not yeah, yeah, yeah. They, they come, come out, out huh? to, to watch. They come out to watch. They're not watch. Regular, um, they, 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 yeah, this is street march because members say them can't get involved like that. They can't go. go yeah, 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 go yeah, 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 yeah. But yeah. but you know what I mean? Them them, them them come I'm out and and follow and, on the sidewalk and watch and, and follow. But yeah, but if them come out and follow and behave themselves, right? I, I'm because happy, what I'm happy you come to that because well, that uh, it's just it's just they, like they, they behave themselves. Up, no? It's just like when a man come to America, nobody don't tell him to drive the speed limit or not, but him obey it. Right. And those same people come to carnival and then behave themselves. But and, uh, that means not come to say it's not. And it's not about the do, dance hall, you know. They don't do it. It's not about the dance hall because carnival come with a certain amount of regulation, amount so the amount of security, right? If you go there and be a certain body, you, you know your bone plate lock up. So put all of them thing in the dance hall space too, right? Because it's not about the, the content of the, of the music. Because if you listen to Calypso, it's, brother, it's, it's, Calypso. it's not the content. Calypso, so as, and I said earlier, some Calypso song is way, 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 way more. Graphic. Yeah, man, way. Music. And not I want to tell you, dance hall music. Delivery. No, the dance delivery hall music. You know, dance hall music play maybe 50 50 or more a carnival than even Calypso. What, what was that? Dance hall play what? Dance hall, a year time, play a carnival probably. If it's not 50-50, it's probably even no, more than no, no, exactly no, no. carnival. 20-80. No, 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 no. More than that, bro, man. I'm not, bro, I'm not asking you. 20-80, brother. 20-80. That's it. Can you no matter where you want to go around it because I've been there and it's, done that it's just like hip hop. When you go, when you go a Yankee party and they might play hip hop and and you when you listen, you them go play about five dance hall music. Yeah, I remember and, and remember that when you go to, when you go to us when you go to a, a carnival event, you'll hear the same focus song four times, five times in one party. Yeah. That's how that's that's how, is that is that is that. You have to experience it, my brother, to know where I'm going. So, the minute we can't, the minute we can't even allow the dance hall music play carnival just the same like um no, um carnival. No, 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 no. That's not that's not true. That's not actually not factual. That's not true, brother. Right. Dance hall right. is about it's eighty. Me. About twenty percent of it is dance hall, and it's all in Jamaica. They do they do carnival like that. That is why the trainees flock to Jamaica because they're like we like a little fusion of dance hall in in the carnival. And we never go to that carnival, we never crop over and carbine or something. It's one hundred percent soaker. That's what Jamaica is the only carnival that infused their music some to an extent into carnival. But it's not the, the, the only people. thing we want to say, they might keep like dance and music, then we keep the, the kind of old school yeah, dance and music in the carnival. The people them cool on right. And actually, I'm not giving a carnival because when even when they play the, the, the dance and music in carnival, they play the five or the ten or the ten. Hot is that's going on now. They play that, they yeah. go back to them to them soccer. That's what yeah, they do. The and, and then go back to them soccer again. And then go back to them to them soccer. Yeah, and, and then, um, black light. And you have you have a few you have a few bands that we like last year. Um, because of the campfire sponsorship, I don't know, was on Exodus truck. And with DJ and go on with that thing, this year was he was on it too. But usually I hear since I was on it too. But usually I hear time you'll have a, a Jamaican artist that come through one year, 
when Bounty and Beanie was at Bounty, they found one truck, Beanie, they found one truck. Yeah, that's true. And, that's and that's true. just them just infused dance on it for, for a small portion of the time because and then them gone right back. Yeah, because because a lot of dance and artists used to dip on the trucks, but watch this now, James Bond. The Byron Lee them carnival, that's when the, that's where the RFM them and the dance hall artists them was on. Yes, the Bacchanal I know. one them know was never like me that. Like, I me about their own truck. Right, 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 right. And you know how that goes. So the yeah. reality is that the Bacchanal one them still, they never really have a dance hall like that. And you yeah, know, yeah, from Byron Bacchan, Lee them thing, cut when down, Bacchan you know, when, go, Bacchan, when Bacchanal take over carnival fully, Bacchan, at that time was oh. one man, Bacchanal, juicy them. It was straight. You got the breakfast party at Soka. You got Black or Soka. You got the right. party party. Yeah, man. I mean, listen to me. I've, I've been to the wall. Wall. Right. So, 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 so you must know about our Frenchmen, them. Exactly. Yeah, they they were and, and, it's back and they keep Frenchmen. Yeah, it's them keep Frenchmen or not. Right, right, right. The New, right, year, right, the New right. Year's one right. of them keep right. October morning and what. Right, right. That, yeah, that, that around um, Cayman has gone for this. Over Cayman has. And even when they go Cayman has for New Year's, no. There's a great about 30% of the soca. When you go to new, the New Year's one right now, I came on us. It's 30 pro, they would get like a 30% soca in it. Yeah, man. It's since mm -hmm. Exodus come in now and say, all right, I remember Exodus come and was Exodus wanted to be a part of Bacchanal. Bacchanal tell them no, them open them one band until them know Bacchanal is exit. Bacchanal is no more. And then now Exodus come in now and start to say, all right, cool. I'm gonna infuse a little dance all back in at the thing the right way. And that's why the Trinity people, when they talk to Trinity, them say we like the, we like the idea. Of infusing dance hall in it, and as you say, the whole arena come up, the whole activity come up, everybody come up, come watch carnival, and then behave themselves. No man, you step on a man to it, all right. You go up to him, you step on a man to him, and screw up him face. I know the same carnival, so you step on him to it was okay. So it's just we, the product of dance hall, to look in ourselves and say, all right, cool. If them man can come together, Marshall, Marshall, man, the biggest thing in soccer. You see, Marshall walking a duck work, he man too smart, just a walk. Normal and he's the biggest thing. It's two hundred thousand dollars. Marshall charge for your show, But 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 James man, but when you got a Frenchman and you see the Usain Bolt them, you see yourself a Powell, you see the Prime Minister, you see Peter Bounty, you see everybody. First everybody in the damn place, you know. Like, first normal, in Frenchman, normal. first in Frenchman have no VIP, no VIP. You know what I say? Is it because he, I, I, I want to see all I tap at the people them a rolling. Exactly. Everybody just normal. Everybody normal, no yep. no VIP. Frenchmen are I, 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 I think one time Jamaicans what we call all right, what we call um so you know get the people when they mix with uptown people, them intend to be of a better way, like them intend to more calm. I don't know why. You know, <laughs> you know that that be that's, 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 that's my point though, because if you can come uptown and be of yourself or so to speak, mix with uptown people and be of yourself. Why you can't have a full dance hall environment where you behave yourself to attract your sponsors? Well, this um, but it things that cultural thing. Joe Grind, yeah, got you in general. Yeah, all right. With, with this dance hall and soccer thing, um, with, with, with it, in my own humble opinion, me then go to soccer party anytime because with soccer, you, you feel the vibes. With any any song playing a soccer, you, you just want to move. That in a dance hall, that is gone. You, you, you know, feel. You don't know, feel for willy bones, you don't know, feel for nothing. When you go to a dance hall party now, you just turn up, your screw your face, and it's the vibe. It's the vibe. And that's, and that's why people is attracted to Swoka. The vibe that keeps you going. Dance hall, you know, it's not there anymore. I am going to say something that going to shock you. Know. You know, say every single ah. dance hall selector now, their dream is to play on the Swoka parties. You know that? Two because days, everybody are going to dance. No matter what day, song you play, exactly, everybody is going to dance. Exactly. A dance hall, today, today, turn up on you. When as when a dance hall artist, when you listen to soca all that and the people my dance and rare, when a dance hall artist go up on a soca event at Jamaica now, him in 20 or 30 minutes, when I say shell the place, him shell the place. So they're them inspiration is a play. When the dance hall artist come on for I love soca, you have 20,000 people on you, you feel a like jump up when any song them play. That is a joy for them. So every dancehall artist dream right now is to play in a soccer party because the the vibe what them all get and they must say them when them left automatically them must the dance. So so what can change this 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 behavior then for make you know what I mean reggae reggae uh, I mean I'll even say the music itself where if we make party where a dancehall party or a road march where it can be palatable if we bring you know, corporate 
involved. The type but, of but music you used, to have, you used to have um James Bond, you used to have dance hall meet soca, right? Oh, you used to have dance hall versus soca. Right. So um, you know, again now, even I must camp, you know, when I carnival time, you know, dance hall music play too, you know. Yeah, it's, just, it's predominantly, you it's, know, the soca music. Yeah, but also it's just that when, 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 when you have a dance hall thing by itself, it just but, after but, a while just broke out in a war. Can I can I say something from that? You might have... Yeah, go to the door, Grant. When the dancer sang them a play a soca, a dancing song them a play no, you can't play no gunman song on a soca. No, true, 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 true. That's true. why. So you have to play music to keep you going. That, that, that's that's exactly why. You have to play music <laughs> that keeps you going. Yeah, that's true. That's true. That's true. That's true. So remember, my answer, so the thing to say now. So if you get this whole <coughs> incorporate thing in a in a in a in a dance hall as 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 Calypso, we have to dance and have to cut out the the gun the gun gun lyrics because you feel like it because the people have to be of a certain way in yes. a dance hall space. Yes. Because right now, in we, we, we cross we cross and we, we, whatever sing it or whatever whatever they can play that's a soca party, you know. Any other song them they cannot play it because they're gonna stand the, up on you. The dance hall songs were well, compatible with the soca environment are the happy ones the man in some exactly. days. Exactly, the dancing yeah. songs. Exactly. That there, you know? exactly. Because me not telling like me here for say, cause me love Calypso, you know, but me here for say somewhere have this dance and music, and when do have this 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 turnout for a road march or you see what yeah, I'm saying? The thing is still in the SD. Um, let me tell you why I wouldn't really compare dance hall and 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 and, and the soca too much. Um, this carnival thing or bacchanal thing, it's a seasonal thing. You get what I say? Yeah, man, you know, so them mm. launch out um, from all in January and whatever, whatever, and but, them go for one, two months. And you know, there, with that, yeah. said, know, the people, and what you say, out at the Isle of Soak and the night carnival, you know, I see them people, no time for the rest of the year again. No, 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 even only carnival like time, right? Even, yeah, no, are the Frenchmen, them got the Frenchmen, them, them, them go French, yeah, they won, yeah, one, one, yeah, one but, in October, then go, yeah, you know, in October, then go, January, right? You're not at the breakfast party, I'm on time, but you're not, see them people out at the regular dance hall, the dance hall, no, 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 I love Soka, keep look on Isle of Soka, um, I think it was in. October or something. It was a half weekend at um the cricket stadium. Why call it again? Uh um, Sabina Park. Sabina Park. Park. Sabina Park. Look how much people got a something like that morning. And all those people live in Jamaica because it was an off season. People bring all them tent and sleep for the party, you know. Right. the party go from seven to it was a seven to seven thing, I think him try. It go from seven o'clock in the evening to seven o'clock in the morning. I don't know how they perform too. And if you see the amount of people turn out, that's how people now do them something. Like. Breakfast party. And, and, when last and, you and, that, you, you don't. You never hear dance at breakfast party. And and, and Richard party always have a nice good turn out too, you know. And, and and another thing that the, there's another thing the hype, because nobody, everybody hype, you know. Nobody know uh, you know, nobody know uh, move. Everybody you go, you turn up, you know. When you go out and enjoy, because the, everybody the key thing is a, dance. Damn. Everybody was show we got um we got sunrise breakfast party last week Saturday morning. Party starts six o'clock to two o'clock in the day. I get there probably about eleven o'clock. And when we tell us to them people, them carnival girl they come dress up, them come to them long frock and them this and them that everybody have and them sunglasses and well nice. And as two twos of them walk to the party and get two drinks and everybody start whining and a dance and a rare and all them something. That's how people now do them something. Eh? Man, the son of in a car and I crush out with nine man and if you step on into a problem. Yeah, right, yeah, right. Look here, right. what a man have on. Him not here. Once he go to the party and get two drinks in him, and I ready him ready for have a good time. And, yeah, and you step on him to you, you get up and, and you and him start Egg, move together. Egg, and, 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 exactly. Um, Juve, exactly. and Juve, um, James Bond. Ah, uh, uh, Juve, uh, no people had spray paint each other and them sitting there. So you know, say anything where you wear, got Juve, you know. That you know, done. say how you know, say yeah, yeah forgot that show, you know. Yeah. Exactly. Like, exactly, just that show that people are throwing powder yeah. by, are throwing paint, are throwing water. Yeah, man, you, everything. Spill liquor drinks, and shoes, and them sitting there. Yeah, you spill liquor drinks, but that man, that dance, he won't fight you. But the same man, we got, we got a carnival. This and they step on him too. Exactly. And there's no yes. problem. Exactly. So, so, and that means say what is what? No problem. You're right. The same man will go to carnival and no problem. You, you're you're right. I think it's a it's a cultural thing in our way too, you know. Cause you don't know going out. Know, watch this, you know. Because even when we in our dance, you know, when you in our dance, you know, you go a certain place all the water house, you know. 
You see, the guys are in the dance hall of water, you say no big dancer keep on them sitting there. And when you go to them places, you know, you're observing them. You, yo, yo, you when certain man a step to a 10, 15 man a step with them, you know. Because you know, everybody have a show say, yo, yeah, man, they're a bad man and this and that. So the dance hall culture kind of create the personality there where everybody have to be tough and man have to be bad man and them something there. So I just exactly. say, you know. Exactly. Dance hall is more like fun and dancing and enjoying yourself. And then you walk to the party with artists that come in, 1,000 man behind. 1,000 man. And guess what? Guess what? Um, James Bond. Every man face long up. The man them face, yo, if you see the man them, it's like, you're afraid of the man them. The man them face and long some, up. And sometimes the, uh, the artist is not the problem, but the man them around them. Or not. The artist is not the problem. Or not. Oh, the man, every man, man face long up, man. <laughs> long up. I don't, no yellings that are push out of the way and rare, 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 when, when the artists are trying to get. Me tell you, Marshall, most Jamaican artists is not getting the booking you know, or Marshall getting. Marshall right, I even, I even uh, the bungee garland. Ah, the bungee. Marshall sell out Barclays Arena. No, there's no Jamaican artist ever do that. Marshall sell out Barclays Arena and New York at Soka artist sell out Barclays Arena. Right. And Mister Marshall at the party, him and two brother walk up and down like and nothing. Mister Chi Ching Ching walk in one thousand man. Sean Paul walk in one thousand man. Russian come in three thousand man. Like right. I mean, what the what the what the man the man. And I soak a party them and come enjoy themselves really, and and it's just not the same dance. So we just create a thing where we have to go low it if we want the sponsorship or want to get it at the same level. And this will all be, every year after carnival done, this same argument come up. Why we can't get the support? Why dance are not getting the support that carnival is getting? But at the same time, we're not changing anything. We're not well, I don't think the dance are like going with no help of festivals though. It's like oh carnival, you know, so I want two months. Them but the region that, there. That, that's the point. You know, the dance and the region of the festival. Everybody are waiting for Sting. And, and everybody, some everybody are waiting for Andrew Woolly Fest in December. And that is it for dance hall. I probably am um, chugging it them, keep right. them sitting. But okay. I don't really dance hall that per se. All right. You're talking about a dance hall festival. Not going to open at the early part of the year. February, March, April, May, June, July. And, 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 and you know, Andrew Bellamy, them start keeping the I love soak them three, four times a year because they realize the dance hall slacking. Right, so, but say night carnival or some other keeper, no. The night but, carnival, uh, star we can't say something to, again. You know, to, yeah, man, Joe Brian, look for the name on. them. Oh, yes, a sting and really fest. Them give up them, those names give you a negative. Even a year, you just you just feel dark. Well, it's, well, well what's this true? true. I'm mean, not gonna say that in a Joe Brian no, because no. here go on. I'm mean, just understand say, say sting from a cultural perspective. Sting yeah, is but, dance hall and the rivalry right. and but the man, clash yeah, and something there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah that, so that, a couple that, people take it personal. Them allow them to consume party, them. Every dance hall, every dance hall party, it has a dark name to it. You never hear when last year you I love dance hall. Ah, let's dance. You know, no, you know, party. No, it's true because Soka name, I love Soka. You know, I them have a Soka party called Duckwork. You know, I just is a Trini girl tell me. Hey, hey, hey James Bond, why, why, what's going on now? At 137, we have 173 people. <laughs> See ya. <laughs> exactly. Uh, boy, I, mean, I tell you. Yeah, man. You know, you know, you know, the party, you must say duck work. Duck work. Um, which part that keep? It's a soccer party, man. They keep that trade in Jamaica. I just found out white name, white name duck work. Or not. It's duck, you're ducking work. Because the right, party right. starts 3 o'clock in the day. So you're duck work. I'm going to party. Me never, me ne I, it just show how creative soccer people is. Even the name of the party, they put the meaning into it. Duck work. I'm like, all right, I think it's just duck work. Man said, no. In Trinidad, you're ducking work to go to the party. I'm like, okay. You know, right. the soca, you know, the wee fet. Last of them keep wee fet. And it had a balance. No lie, it must have. It had a balance of um, Assassin was on it. Valiant was on it. Um, I think Skeng was on it. But about four big Jamaican artists at the time was hot last year. And then... <sighs> You have Marshall Panit, Bungie Garland, Skinny Fabulous, and some other people, and two other people. And when we tell us, say, Valiant did something wrong because he came out with the Stark Ashley song where you can't come out with a new song. You know, them something. So he flopped totally for the show. Assassin all him own. When he's when all the Skinny Fabulous touch the stage, he's somebody that part them keep it to honor. That had probably about 15, 18,000 people there. Yes, when the man, when the soccer man them touch the stage and the place that tear up, he put the Jamaican man them to shame. Obviously, it's a soccer event, so of course. So. But we should have still be able to hold our own and a fully soccer event. True. We should have still be able to hold our own and a full soccer event. And me and Killer stand up and Killer say, yo, if you don't watch, then you know, 
Dance all gone, soak a garlic, dance and a cool energy. Well, 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 well see, um, Shaggy said dance all, um, quote unquote, you know, absolute, you know, so. And then, um, do you want to say something from that from the other day when it's say, you know, and when he said it, you know, he, he basically, he said old school, you know, so we have to give him credit. He might, he might kill himself too because he's old school. But, 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 but the old school are what? The members of the old school are, members of the big bunks with him and dirty money with him, them are old school too, you know. The, the street vibes, them are old school too, you know. I just want you to know that too, you know. But Shaggy contradicts himself from his point. Oh, uh, so. Uh, 10 years. And I think Shaggy just talking, because case and point, him say, look at TJ. Obviously, I have a vested interest in TJ. Right. Yeah, 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 yeah. I don't yeah. know who the water we went when he was talking. Uh, right, even, look right, at, so... uh, even look at that song. That that song got big because it's a, it's a, when you hear the song, that you just want to move. That, that, that's the thing that we're missing. That, that's that's the thing we're missing. Song, you hear something, you just want to move. I see them thing with, uh, that's why something is gone. What do you call it? Afrobeat. And... And another another Caribbean music where I go past dance hall in name Compa. You, you, you move when you hear them you hear the beat and, and, and the people you just want to move. That is totally missing from dance hall. And it's well, called at dance the the hall. Day, at the end of the day, still they have to just bring back the dance and dance hall still. That's all it needs. The happy music. That's I all. think I That's think there every single soca song are dancing. Either you whine or you jump or you run down the road. Every right. single soca song. Balancing down the road. I feel like Hulk. Pick up something. Everybody <laughs> feel like <it. laughs> <laughs> when I hear that people just people just say, oh, well, have a good time. And every single soca, this is why I show you soca is taking over dance hall. There's no soca party at a 10,000 of Africa. Every single soca party there. You know? I'll told you this great that soca party. You know? Yeah, man. Yeah, man. Every it's like a soca black soca one in case the man. Exactly. You know? Every yeah. single soca party there. Hey, so, I, and I go. Go ahead. I go on an RL on the last year with my family because it's my first time going to a soccer party. And then my dad, I see man them stop and they start count. Three, two, when I see man them go one, everybody start jump. Like, when you, when you see it, you, you feel happy. If you come in as a bad man and you screw face, two minutes after you say, everybody have a good time. You have to just relax. That's a yeah, man. That, them, oh, it's true. All right, um, watch this now. You know, so one good six hour, 19 minutes when they get in so <laughs> And I do in the week, so let me hear the last words, them, so we can close off this day. Um, bring back dancing a dance hall. That's right. It. Well, we just are saying that the man, them, where the same balance of them with them, when we get go out there and we carnival, is me. So, when they mean a dance hall, the same behavior we need, is me? The same behavior. Just like when they travel, travel to go foreign, they build themselves. The same thing, you know. Right. Um, lion man. Lion man. Lion man there. George yeah, Smith. Me there. me there, man. Oh, yeah. yeah. Let, let, me, let me hear closing words there because, you know, we are close it off and now still is it. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. And uh, oh. right there, you see, you see, the thing is that Dancehall music make a ready, you know. So anything we make a ready have life, it can't dead because me a, me a selector. Right. And when when me a play the music and me see the people my dance to it, if me go in a segment to segment, what happen is that nineties most of the music we make in the nineties and eighties and seventies actually, sixties too, them feel good. You see me, I say, early 2000, yeah, the feel goodness get hype. And then after that, you know, it start to trickle down. The feel goodness start to disintegrate, you know, get no feel goodness. But me as a man, we did it from 1988, I select around the turntable. Me know I feel good for I want to feel good. So when somebody booked me, I'm willing to play for, for, for to make me come in at them party come play, me know if you play for them. Right. You see me? Right. And, and, yeah, man, and, I go still, man. You know, as um, Bob Marley did say, you know, one thing about music, when it hits, you feel, you feel no, no pain. pain. Yeah, man, um, the, the OJs, they have a song that say, I love music, any kind of music, you know? Yeah. All the style Powerful song, that man. So at the end of the day, you know, music was always... Um, you can feel it, man. You can feel the vibration. You, you know it's song. You know you hear it. 
You can't know, say, yeah, man, that is a hit song. You're not, you're not mm -hmm. for wait for nobody to tell you. You get what me mm -hmm. I say? It was always based upon the whole um composition. You get what me I say? You right. know, it's say like a hit song. You see, like when I say that, Imhotep, let me tell you where I reach the music in a dance hall. The, the instrument players, them, a very few of them left. Right. You understand me? And when we, you, the man them usually build rhythm, usually have the, the best drummer, the best keyboardist, the best guitarist, you know what I mean? Come together and the man them share ideas. And if, if a man goes to boom, so him strum the piano and that no sound good, the whole of the man them say, yo, that no sound good enough. You understand me? And if a man strum the guitar and no sound good, the man them say that no sound good. And then right. them come through what sound good. Not only what sound good, you know, what feel good. Right, because you know, you see the panel, you be fat, you know, all them people that come and take over reggae and dominate this space. That's so why you go still a music. Um, George Smith, I don't know if you're still there, in a judge. Yeah, man, me there, you see me, man. Yeah, man, let me hear your closing words there, because you know what you think of. Yeah, but the dance hall need, the dance hall need organization you know i move away from this individual thing and the, the attitude within the dance hall space that need to change but we have too much individual you know one up manship and that never help it because dance hall come from the people you know so if them not organize around themselves and push it it now move car corporate and see it as something that they want to jump on you understand? That's how we see it. Right. Um, all right, respect. James Bond, let yeah, me hear your, I, your last words there. I agree with George. We need more organizing and putting more in the music. And I just said, bring back happy music. People like happy music. Because every single music that we see dominate and pass in dance hall is happy music. Carnival is Carnival don't have one slow song. And every song slow, you sing it and dance the same way. And even in the 90s when we had slow song, you could have danced with your girl, you could have danced with this. So it's still happy music, you feel the vibes. I think the vibes left dance hall and it gone. And carnival, soca, the vibes only growing because every year carnival is growing bigger and bigger. bigger. When you see carnival bringing $5 billion to the economy, I think the government not going to support that. I think right, the, minister right, of right. Not, the, right. the Minister of Tourism not going to support that. Right. Of course, I'm gonna put that behind it. There, there's no dance hall event that bringing in a hundred thousand people into the island at no one time. So you need, we need for them if you go to the drawing board and see. I would have a copy, but okay, I see what the soca people might use and see what draw people to it, see what draw corporate to it because without the money we can't do it either. So we need the sponsorship, and then we we'll come wheel we'll and come again and try implement some of them something there in you know, the dance hall. Right, right, right. Um, I don't know if SD wants to say a little last word quick and fast in our him check out still. Let me know in SD. No, man, we don't really have nothing to say, but um, right. the, the next thing there, if you're going to jump on the, you know, the Middle East thing there, I you want to know them thing there? Why, you know, say, you know, say, I <laughs> see what I go on, but I can't talk about it too much in general. You know, the YouTube, the YouTube thing kind of funny. You get what I say? Right, it's right, right, thing, right, you know, right. So you just want to study it, you have to study it, you know. You get what I say? Because right now, you think Mimi can talk about Russia and Ukraine. You must be mad. It, yeah, they, 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 the live now go, now go be monetized. So, you know, them right, go right. there. You know, I hold the political guidelines and all the political things that change up, man. So, you have to kind of observe this space and follow them guidelines. You know, I see everything mm. going on. And I would love to speak on it. But sometimes, too, the man have to smart with them choice of words there, man. So yeah, 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 yeah. So, you can't can do yeah. certain words are the reality that now especially in the space yeah. right now it's a very hostile environment where certain words is being searched for you know and stuff like that so me kind of see what i go on but just kind of go and observe it still you get what i say but yeah, i see yeah, yeah. escalation go on but a cause and effect we see what happened on april the first where them go on with over syria side there and them yeah, something yeah, still yeah. all the political things go on still but we just go and observe and watch what i go on still let's eat go and focus on the dance hall and Little politics and them sitting down, some social commentary. You get me? Yeah, yeah man. man. You see them things, them in general, them things they are serious. So, me, let me tell you, some, me, me get all the barbecue interview, man, from Michael, man. I me can't take the barbecue interview. Me can't do that. That trouble. Yeah, yeah, trouble. yeah. And, and that would be a good interview for me to take. You get what I say? 
Yeah, because that's an exclusive, like a world premiere. You know, some people may say, yeah, man, me, me, me have to be very tactical with them things. You get what I say? So I just saw that mm -hmm. go still. But we definitely go, we definitely go speak, man. Um, we supposed to talk on the open, the open AI, the 100 billion Stargate, where them actually said them that deal with, you get me? But we definitely going to talk about it the next reason still. And, you know, we always can throw in some topics up for discussions. Yeah, 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 yeah. Make the reason yeah. flow. I just saw it go more time still. You see it. So big up on yourself, you know. All right. Take yeah, care. You have, to, you have to get septic panda reason there. Oh, uh, yeah, man. You know, septic check in, you know. Septic goes and can check in, you know, when they're ready, you know. Skeptic All right. But the star gate, you know. Yeah, man. <laughs> yeah. We definitely, but yeah, yeah. You know, the skeptic I come to in, like, uh, spring gate up on them something and yeah. spice up the thing. You get what I say? But yeah, man. We definitely want uh, all a little reason. Next next reasoning, um, to that, what, Tuesday? Right. Uh, Monday. Monday, 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 Monday. Monday. So Wednesday reasoning. Yeah, me definitely want to talk about it still. Definitely want to talk about it. You get me? I said, All right, yeah. my brother. Yeah. And then All my right. Microsoft, I build a $100 billion supercomputer and one bag of something, something called Stargate and them things. Eh. So, and you know, growing up, we are watching a little sci-fi there, which is Stargate, SG-1, and all them sitting there, sitting there. So, you know, say, Microsoft, them and open AI, them not play don't you know but i mean these are things that we have observed long long time it's just that we're not too too sensationalized and put fear mongering in the mix you get what i say yeah we see these uh, things and we right. see everything we are going we see everything we are going but again as me say we don't really sensationalize the thing you get me i say yeah mm, man yeah. um yeah what's look and listen man mr niger boy man yeah man me follow a doctor love you know so you know everything go mr niger boy me follow niger boy too you know, him have him new YouTube page and you know, also music at Japan, him YouTube page and him something there. So big up Niger boy still. You know, definitely um the savior for dance all in our way still in terms of clean music and you know, yeah man. I garner the attention of the people them. So that's that there. Um George Smith Lion man, big up on yourself, you know. People, 150 right. people there, you know. At least leave 130 likes when I leave. Please and thank you. At least um, drop a like on, on your way out. Yeah, man. Greatly appreciated. All right? And if you're new to the channel too, you can also subscribe. So um, when we go live, you can be notified and you can check in as well and share your perspective. Because so we do the platform. You know, it's open and receptive to various ideas and things like that. You know, solid reasoning go on. You know, the zeal and passion that the same way. I would just keep it respectful. That's how it is. So big up to um Lion Man, Jared Smith, James Band, big up, you know. Um, big up to um IQ Meds, big up Miss Julia, Lali Bella, um, big up to RR to RR check in and instead of instead RR contribute to the reasoning, RR, I make it very personal. No, my general, and that's the reason. We hear this on the internet, mm. we don't know each other like that, so we just stick to the information, man. We don't get too personal like that. Um, big up to MP, you know, you know, MP always check in early, listen all the six hour reasoning and still there. Big up MP, man. Big up all the ones and ones. Self me, big up yourself, you know. Black light, big up yourself, you know, you know the thing going on. Yeah, man. Big up to um who is the the panel, man. Big up to big up to um the general the man. Yeah, man. Big up to um re name again, Black man? Light. No, Black the light. reviewer. Reviewer, man, reviewer. reviewer. Okay, yeah, man, big up review, big up that all of the Michael Davis, big up yourself in my general. My at root, yeah, big up yourself, manners and respect. And Marie Williams, big up yourself. Yeah, man. Poseidon, yeah, big up, you know. Nikki Willie, big up, Ruan Noble, D Anna, Summer, big up yourself, Michelle Clark. You know, all of the ones and ones I'm gonna big up on yourself. Um, just remember if you just leave a like on the stream. Thank you very much. Wednesday night again. Yeah, man, we're going to have some more topics up for discussion. Thank you all for supporting the platform. Yeah, man. So big up on yourself, people. Catch you up on our next one. You know, I said tomorrow, um, time and space permit. I talk about tomorrow. May I say, like, later, time and space permit. You know, I said, if Rick Storm step out, there will a little reason over this as well. So I just saw we do it. So big up on yourself, people. Greatly appreciate the support. As always. And you don't know the thing go. Jamon, you're still there. All right, Jamon. Yeah, man. Big up Ruan Noble them. Big up all I chuckers them, you know. Yeah, man. Big up the ones and ones them. So big up on yourself, people.
Upper note, upper note. 